Cuphead and Mugman have made a deal with the devil, and to save their souls, they must defeat tons of boss fights. In today's video, we play through the full game of Cuphead as well as the DLC, The Delicious Last Course. Will we be able to handle every single treacherously difficult boss fight this game throws at us? Let's find out together. So yeah, let's get started with Cuphead. It's actually like a little book, which is pretty cool. Once upon a time, in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care to, under the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. One day, the two boys wandered far from home, and despite the Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craps table. Hot dog, exclaimed King Dice, the casino's manager. These fellows can't lose. Nice run, boys, laughed a newcomer. The brothers gasped. It was the casino's owner, the devil himself. Now, now, how about we raise the stakes? And he suggested with a toothy grin. Win one more roll and all the loot in my casino is yours. The devil boomed. But if you lose, I'll have your soul. Steal? Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cried Mugman, as he understood the danger, but it was too late. Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose, the brothers trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now, about those souls. The brothers pleaded for their very lives. There must be another way to repay you, Mugman stammered. Yes, please, mister, Cuphead added. Hmm, perhaps there is, the devil snickered, pulling out a parchment. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me, and I just might pardon you two mugs. Now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys mo out most rudely. <laughs> you have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls, otherwise I'll be the one collecting yours. Cuphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, panted Cuphead. We have to find the Elder Kettle, he'll know what to do. This is why you should never gamble. It's just not a good idea. You should instead, you know, buy something that'll make you happy. <laughs> All right, well, as you can see, we're talking to Elder Kettle. What a fine pickle you boys have gotten yourselves into. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fates. You must play along for now, collect those contracts, and you'd best be ready for some nasty business. Your debtor friends won't be very friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect they'll transform into terrible beasts. Take this potion so they won't hang you out to dry. And we'll give you the most remarkable magical abilities. Now go to my writing desk and use the miscellaneous inkwell there. You need to prepare yourselves for a scrap. Can we talk to him anymore? Well, what are, you, what are you rascals waiting for? Off you go. Meanwhile, I shall try to figure out some way out of this mess. Good luck, you trouble, troublesome little mugs. All right, well, let's go into the tutorial then, try to figure things out. Of course, I do know how to play, but it has been like a year or so since I've last played, so I wouldn't mind giving it a shot again, sort of see how things happen. All right, so, duck, hold down to crouch. So, yep, we can do that. It's gonna be very important. B is to jump, tap for short, and hold for a higher jump. X is to dash, now it's gonna be super important. I actually sort of wanna change the button for that, we'll have to wait and see. Um, but X to dash, and then we can down and B to descend, drop down from certain platforms and Y to shoot for rapid fire, or hold for rapid fire. R is to lock, so we can stay in one place and sort of look around a little bit more. So like, if, obviously, if we're trying to shoot up here while I'm walking, it won't really work, so I have to hold it and do that. All right, let's actually stand at the right angle. There we go. And the parry slap, so press jump while airborne to nullify or interact with pink objects. This also builds your super meter, so I can go like this, that, and that. That's very cool, I think it's very funny. Uh, resurrect. Uh, revive your dead pals with a well-timed parry on the ghost two-player mode only, which, yep, this whole game is uh, multiplayer. And then A, the EX move, an upgraded attack that requires one super meter card. So we have that right there. That was one EX move. Uh, and there's coins. Collect coins to purchase items from the shop. And then there's like a super move, I thought. I'm not quite sure. I don't remember exactly. But yeah, this game is super duper duper difficult, so we'll have to see how everything goes. But I'm super glad it's on the Nintendo Switch now. I mean, you get to play this wherever you want, because before it was only on PC and Xbox. All right, well, we learned that. Do you have anything new to say? Uh, you'll have to lay out all those debtors and to move on. Now shake a leg. All right, <laughs> we'll do exactly just that then. Let's exit. This game is really pretty though. Like just the art style, it really looks like an old cartoon, which is super cool. 
Okay, well, let's get out there in the world and start doing what we gotta do. Oh yeah, this is the overall, this is super fun. Oh, there's a little apple guy. It's so pretty though, oh my gosh, I love it. Hello. Hey, fellas. Looks like you're in for now, huh? Well, I used to be same the same way, always getting into trouble, running, jumping, shooting. But now I prefer just strolling around and going to the pictures. But hey, let me give you a hand, take this. Ooh, you received three gold coins, very generous of you. Hey guys, good to see you again. Oh, those coins helped out a bit. Maybe check with the other folks around here, they might help you too. The one's not trying to kill you, I mean. Alrighty then, so we'll take a look for that. There is a shop right here and definitely want to buy some pretty important stuff at the Pork Rinds Emporium. Let's get to it. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. All right, so he has different items and these might not mean too much to us right now, but it might be good to take a look. We have the Chaser, which is the EX Chaos, Chaos Orbit. Uh, long range with below average damage, no aiming required. So it's one of my favorites and probably wanna buy, but we could also buy an extra heart hit point. Adds an additional hit point, but lightly weakens your attack power. Don't think we need that too much. We have the spread shot, which is EX eight way. Um, well, that's the EX. Okay, I gotcha. Um, short range with great damage. If you can keep close to your target, then we have the smoke bomb, invisible dash. That is another super important one. I might actually get that before I get the chaser. Um, you will not take damage during a dash. A great defense maneuver. So I think we're gonna get that. And we'll get the roundabout EX jumbo rebound. Great coverage with average damage. Aim backwards for maximum damage. So we're just gonna go into the smoke bomb, and it actually replaces it with something else. The pea sugar automatic parry. Uh, the first parry move is automatic. All you need to do is jump, which I hope that we won't have too much of an issue with. So yeah, let's get started with that. We have ourselves already um, an extra move. I don't know if I have to go and equip it. <laughs> You got to equip those new purchases if you want to use them. Look at your equip card, you bums. That was rude. <laughs> All right, well, here we go. Here's our equip card. So I want to go to my super, now I want to go to my charm and get the smoke bomb. Got you. So I don't have a super. Got you, okay. Hmm, I'm taking a look at our list. Yeah, this is world one. So we'll try to get world one done in today's episode. I'm really not sure. Maybe we'll do sort of like portions of each world in each episode, well, we'll just have to wait and see. But there is a level down this way. I guess that's maybe the first level. What is over this way? Forest Follies, run and gun. Okay, so there's sort of two different types of levels in Cuphead. There's sort of like side-scrolling levels that you can go through, and then there's also boss fights that you can take on. I guess we'll do one of the side-scrolling levels. The big purpose on these are to make it to the end and to get five coins along the way if you can, and we'll do what we can. These games just take a lot of trial and error, so we'll see how things go. I'm a little nervous, to be honest with you. <laughs> It's been a while since I last played, but I know it was like as tough as nails, you know? So, just gotta be careful, I suppose. Oh, okay, okay, we're fine, we're fine. That was a little scary, excuse me. Beat you up. Just gotta watch for things to parry as well. If we ever have that opportunity. Watch it, okay, like there is that. And sometimes it's just better for avoiding things. Oh, sir, I didn't know you could do that. And there is a coin right there. Whoa, okay, watch out. That was not watching, I'm already down the one HP. Oh no, okay. There we go, I parried that one. Okay, we're making it, we're making it. Ah, there we go, got coin number two. I'll try to get every coin, but honestly, this isn't like, my goal isn't 100%, it's just sort of to make our way through <laughs> as much as I can. And then I can dash across that, watch it. Whoa, okay. Hold on now, hold on. Give me a moment, just one moment. Oh, okay, so I have my, uh. Oh no, I died! <laughs> I jumped right into that. We were getting so close to the end, too. Nowhere to run, nowhere to go. This forest is your foe. Oh my. And we have to start all the way back at the beginning again. See, it's gonna be very interesting. Just like lots of trial and error. That's why I'm not really sure if I'll be getting too many levels done per episode. Just that way, you know, not every episode is like a billion hours. Because, you know, some of these worlds, they might not seem like they have many levels in them, but when you consider how much trial and error each one takes, then it gets really long. It's a good game, though. I mean, I think it's only like $20, too. Like, I think it's worth the value. If you like this kind of game, that is. Watch it. Okay, I didn't get hit by it this time. That's good. Nice, okay. Get that. I wanna do parries wherever I can do them, because they might, you know, give me more super moves. That's sort of a big benefit the parries they don't mention too much, is that they give you the super moves. Okay, let's get rid of that guy and dodge that acorn. Okay. We're doing all right. I'm gonna try to dodge that stuff. I think one of these guys, ah, you do, you stinker! You got me! 
<laughs> oh well, it's fine. And what's going on? Oh, I remember this. Ow, that was bad. Because, oh man! You need to get rid of that thing real fast. It takes a lot of damage. Here you go. I remember that. Uh, that's not a fun part of it. We'll keep going then, we'll keep trying and see what else we can do. <laughs> Luckily, each time we make our way through the level, it gets a little easier. You know, we sort of learn all the tricks to it. But I definitely think I might want to change my controls. At least a little bit. Just because I don't like where the dash button is. I think I did that originally too. I changed where the dash button was. It's like one of the shoulder buttons. Cause I just feel like that's a lot more intuitive. Thank you for not destroying me. There we go, got rid of that thing. Oh, but I didn't get rid of you. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you got me there. I might have to just restart now. <laughs> he had a really good shot. Oh man, what a throw, what is with those guys? This is crazy. Oh, look at that, I got an achievement, parry persistence, which is pretty cool. Just being able to get more parries and stuff, and I mean, not more parries, but more achievements. It's my first one, so. Hopefully we get many more. Once again, I'm not really focused on completion in this game. I'm just sort of just trying to have fun with it. If we do get completion, that's awesome and amazing and everything, but not exactly necessary. Did I get another parryable thing? Thank you. There it is, very cool. So we have a full meter with that. Might wanna get rid of that guy and dodge. Oh boy. So yeah, we can try to destroy this guy as much as we can. We do have to be careful just because of the acorns, but we made it! Very good, very, okay! Oh, that was a fast dodge. Okay, okay, I see it. I got it, that was actually pretty good. And we made it! All right, bravo indeed, a round of applause. We got the perfect run because we didn't take any damage. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, much better. So, what was my grade for that one? Our time completion was a minute 20. HP bonus, we get three out of three, three out of three for the parry. Five out of five gold coins, our skill level is two stars. And we get an A plus. Golly, a perfect score. <laughs> okay, well that's the first and only time that's gonna happen. I'm just, I'm guaranteeing it. Don't get your hopes up. It might've been a great first impression, but the game gets way too difficult to maintain that kind of score. Prepared. All right, so I do wanna go down here before we go over to that bridge, because there's another boss fight we can check out. The root pack in, botanic panic. And then we can also choose like simple or regular difficulty. We'll do regular and see how things go. I don't think I need to do simple. Um, but yeah, this is sort of the main meat and potatoes. <laughs> Pun intended with what of this boss fight I think it is. Um, this is the main meat and potatoes of the game, uh, is just fighting the bosses. <laughs> and this is why it's meat and potatoes, or it's at least potatoes, ooh. So we're just trying to beat this guy up as much as we can. Parry off that worm, because it is pink. That's sort of something, it's not always like a nondescript pink object. It can be some normal looking object that you can also parry off of. So I can already hit you with one of those. That's good, I don't have any of these super moves, you know? So I'm trying to be careful here. But so far we're doing great. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> That's why I don't like the parry button where it is. I'm trying to press the uh, special. All right, I'm trying to be careful with this and try to parry into some of those. I, I pressed the button to parry, so that was weird. Hey, little guy, it's okay to, it's okay to have a cry, aw. Um, I'll try again. I don't think I'm gonna have a perfect score for this one, because I think for the boss fights, you need to parry certain things. To have, ow, okay, let's retry that right away. Um, you have to have a, you have to parry everything for a certain score. I'm not sure, though, if that's actually the case. We'll find out. Right now, I can at least parry off of all the worms. Boom, got it. Okay, now this is the one where they're a bit faster. For me, it's just, you know, way more valuable that I survive. Oh, I didn't even need my, uh, my EX for that one. We have coins, I probably should have spent them before I went into this level. There we go, there we go. So he's gonna start crying in a second. I just gotta be careful of them for right now. Like I could typically, you know, try to parry some of them. I don't think it's worth doing at this rate. There we go, we got him pretty good though. So he should have one more phase. He's been a potato, an onion, and a carrot. I mean, it's sort of just a whole group of them. <laughs> and I don't think it's all the same guy. That wouldn't make any sense. Oh no, okay, I just barely got that. Can, we, uh, can I throw my special upwards? I can, that's good. Whoa, there we go. Um, I'm forgetting which button to press. <laughs> that got me scared for a second. There we go. Luckily, the carrots only take like one hit to take out most things. Only take one hit. But I also, most of the time, only take a couple hits to take out, so that's the problem. And we're doing damage to him. Obviously, it won't be perfect, because I've already taken some damage myself because I forgot about this third eye move, because why does the carrot have a third eye? <laughs> Some of these boss fights are very weird. 
Here's just some kind of psychic carrot. And there we go, we get a knockout. Taking names. Nice stuff. Very cool. So our first, I guess, group of bosses, so it was more than one of them, is taken down. Our time was um, at 28. HP bonus two out of three. Parry, th okay, we only had to do a minimum of three parries. That wasn't too bad then. We got an A, a brand new record. I could probably have done that again and gotten a perfect score, but once again, it's not what I'm worried about. It's A-OK. -okay. I mean, I think you unlock hard mode after <laughs> after beating the game once, so it's just like, it's definitely nothing to worry about too much. Anyways, definitely some things are opening up down this way. We got the soul contract, the root pack. All right, you got the root pack soul contract. And what is going on down this way? I'll be a monkey's uncle if I'm putting my moolah on the bank. For all I know, the devil probably controls that place too. He'll never get a hold of my gold if I spread it all around. And if some Joe happens to find a coin or two, good for him. That's what I say, harumph. I don't know if it's the best investment strategy, but you know, if it makes you happy, that's what really matters. Um, I, I guess he doesn't really give you anything. He just He's basically just letting you know there's coins to find and that they're his coins. Um, but anyways, if we have coins to spend, we might as well spend them, even if apparently they might have been his. He seems to be fine with that. So yeah, well let me go ahead and get the next thing, which I think is going to be the chaser. Remember everything I see, I think it's gonna be the best idea. So let's go ahead and do the chaser. And then next we have the lobber, which has the EX Kablooey. Medium range and good damage with a slower rate of fire. Not gonna worry about that too much. And before we get into the action, I do wanna see if I can't change the controls of the game. So yeah, I'll be right back once I figure that out. Okay, so down here we have a little boat. This is Ribbing Croaks and Clip Joint Calamity. So before we get into it actually, I wanna go ahead and equip our shot B, which is gonna be the chaser. So we can sort of choose between the two, which will be very, very helpful. Still don't have a super. Hopefully that happens at some point. But for right now, we're doing pretty good if you ask me. So uh, yeah, let's get to it. Um, Do the Clip Joint Calamity, where I think it's some interesting characters in this one. We'll find out. Whenever it loads. I feel like the loading screens are a little bit longer here on the Switch, but you know, it's worth it. All right, we got some some frogs. <laughs> so we can switch our weapon at any time. So right now we're using, wait, what happened? Did I do this wrong? Oh, I did, didn't I? Okay, well this is actually fine. Maybe. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. <laughs> I messed up my controls a little bit, I think. I don't know. No, maybe I didn't, maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm just being weird. Okay, anyways, yeah, we're just gonna defeat these frog dudes. We have this one weapon right here, which auto sort of aims at some enemies, but the thing is it does a little bit less damage because of that, so it's not the best thing ever. It's just uh, pretty good though. So let me try this again and try to do a little bit better. Ah, oh, I didn't quite hit that, that's a shame. I didn't hit that one? Are you sure? Oh, okay. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. I think next time I'll probably pull out my uh, auto aim and just try to focus on dodging a bit more. Oh no, oh no, what's he doing? He's moving, there we go. <laughs> okay, now they're on both sides of it. This is where the auto aim can be very helpful because we can just focus on not getting hit and then that just sort of does the work for us. The only problem, as you can see, is that, ah, they, they can still get me if I'm not very good at the game. Crude and bad, because we're from the wrong side of the lily pad. <laughs> wow. Here's a real high class belt. Let's try this again. I'm a little bit more used to what they might be up to here, so that's good. So I have to be careful of this, because apparently it is really hard to get that done. But I did it, and I just jump into that one. I really don't like the parries where you have to, it's just not easy, where you're jumping into it instead, because you have to press jump and then press the button again really fast. There we go. I wanna get a little bit closer to these guys, but be careful. Okay, nice. And also good. So I've done my three parries I need for the A plus requirement. I mean, I'm mostly, ow, focused on surviving and I'm not doing a, oh, I can't, okay, I thought I could hide under his legs. Can't do that. <laughs> this is where I just, you gotta try a lot of stuff. You gotta figure out what works. Let's go ahead and use this for a little bit. Mostly because I just wanna focus on parrying where I can. Ah, oh, I can't believe I didn't get that. I definitely don't wanna get hit in this section. I feel like I'm having a hard time. <laughs> Might be obvious. Come on now. Whoa, went right over that. Nice. There we go, ow! Ah, oh, not a good balance to make, that sort of stinks. But I made my three parries, and of course, because of that, 
I do have uh, that right there, and that's useful. I mean, I have quite a few of those. And I can sort of, I don't know if I'm hitting both of them with that. Nice, okay. Whoa, look at me. That was very good. Okay, add a watcher for this one. Boom, and then smack him. Smack him again, very good. Now I'm gonna switch over to, whoa, boy. Ow, <laughs> not good. Come on, stop it. Okay, we're, we're, we're sort of doing all right here. There's lots of things to dodge. Very interesting little projectile she's throwing. I'm not exactly sure what they're supposed to be. Now I guess I can switch to this. I'm always facing somebody. What is he trying, is he trying to eat me? Oh no, okay. Oh, there are two in one deal. Okay, I can't quite hit him just yet. Oh, you know what? I gotta parry that. Whoa. I don't know when I can hit him. Uh, I don't know what that is. Oh boy. So luckily, I, I'm, I'm hitting him. I'm doing damage. Watch it. So it looks like wherever the blue flame is, I should have used my dash. That was the farthest we've gotten. We got pretty far there. You went for broke and now you're croaked. Not good. Let's try it again. I want to see whatever damage we can. He's gonna spit out those fireflies, literally. There we go, there we go. I don't care for these guys very much, gotta be honest. We didn't even run into those last time. Watch it. I'm trying to get that parry going on. Ain't turning out so well, I got one of them. It's much more important for me not to get hit, I suppose. Um, I can't quite hit that guy. That's why I need to use the auto aim. There we go, much better. At least makes it so I can get my priorities a bit straight. It'd be tough to do. Let's go ahead and hit him a little bit, and his friend. Oh, this is where I just don't like it. Okay. Well, we seem to survive that pretty well, actually, unless he's not done. Gotta be careful. There we go. It seems to be the best bet is to like dash backwards like that. Whoop. Okay. While you're dodging one, he's already throwing out the other one. That gets messy. Okay, whoop. That was close. A little too close. Okay, well, what are we gonna get this time? We gotta be careful, because yeah, it's gonna be spitting out coins. But I can parry that one. And three frogs. I can't be good with how bad the frog situation has been so far. There we go, come on. I'm just trying to make sure I stay on these platforms and let my auto aiming do the rest. And then I can't hit him when he's like that. Oh, I'm such a dingus. I took damage, I really didn't need to. That stinks, we're doing so well too. Triple frogs again. I don't really know what this one really does too much, the EX move here. And I guess it just makes some kind of armor that will knock out enemies that are trying to get near us, so obviously not that helpful for this situation. But we definitely have to be getting close. Okay, that goes all the way across though, actually. I didn't realize that. Whoa, whoa. I'm gonna just switch and try to hold on tight. Oh, they got me, that is a tough momentum to keep. No, yikes indeed, he went for broken now you're correct. We were so close. Oh, I should've just been throwing some of those blue fireballs by the chance. Ah, oh, man, come on, one more time now and we can get him, for sure, for sure. So he's punching, he's throwing those fire balls of doom. I guess they're like little punching gloves, aren't they? Ow, you know what? I'm trying again. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. But this is exactly why I wanna definitely like sort of take my time through the game and not worry about like, okay, I wanna get the entire world done in an episode. Most games I do that. But with this, I know it's gonna take a while, especially for the later worlds. I might just sort of break up the action. That way we're not getting too exhausted. Watch it, oh boy. Nice, okay. Ah, oh, why'd I do that? I'm, I'm not doing so well. So I've gone here with all three health. I'm hoping I can keep it that way. Oh boy. Nice. What do we get? We got three frogs again. Not good. I mean, I actually, this one's not too bad. As long as I can just sort of keep above them like that, we'll do pretty good, actually. Ow, oh, but I had to take damage. That sort of stinks. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. I know we can keep this going, and we'll do all right. Oh, that was a waste, okay. I was hoping that actually land. Now the bulls, I'm not too fond of for obvious reasons. I'm just gonna keep shooting while I try to dodge. 
And that seems to be working just fine. Oh, and there it is, a knockout! We only took two damage, which we could have taken three. I mean, not, I mean, I only took one damage. I have two HP, which I could have had all three HP. Anyways, we did pretty good. As you can see, uh, is there any way like to speed this up? I don't know, I guess not. Oh, we only got one parry? I forgot about the parries. Oh, well that stinks. Our grade is a B, it's okay. I'll take it. <laughs> it's something, all right? Alrighty, so with that done, as you can see, we're gonna move back out into this area. And that makes a bridge over this way. Ribby and Croaks. <laughs> guess that was their name. Was there anything up here that we missed? I think so. Looks like there's a good chunk. Like, what's this little tree? Ruse of an Ooze. Goopy Legrand, oh cool. This sounds like it could be fun. I'm sort of roaming around. I don't know if I'm doing this stuff in order. I'm <laughs> most likely not. But I'll just try what I can and see how it ends up going. Yeah, this has been a ton of fun so far. All right then, Mr. Ooze, watch it. I'm gonna do what I can to beat him up. He sort of, whoa, okay, I sort of remember him a little bit, like some of his moves are a bit crazy. I dodged right into him there. That was silly of me. Sometimes, I don't know, I have a hard time remembering the distance of the dash. So if I duck, yeah, I can sort of dodge that one. Oh, that was close. What I do like, though, is that, oh no, oh, he's gonna get bigger. That's not, yeah, I wanted to back up a little bit. Um, is that every time you do die to a boss or anything, it does tell you how far you went. So like, and that's like really inspiring for like, oh, just a little bit farther, you know? Keeps you going. Come on, come on. Whoa, boy, that was close. All right, throw one of those at him. That seems to work pretty well. Nice, oh, he's knocked out at the moment. Oh, I remember this, don't I? Or do I? Yes, I do. This is gonna be a problem, because <laughs> now apparently, He's not alive, but he's still attacking us. He still has plenty of vengeance. There we go. Nice, not bad. I think I'm actually only going for the auto aiming this time. This is a perfect place to do it. So I can just focus on attacking the dude. Come on. Yeah, not happening. Yeah, look at that knockout. Jeez, that was pretty cool. I mean, we didn't do perfectly, but we made our way through there in just like a snap. It was real easy. Okay, so how is that against Goopy Legrand? We got a minute 21, one out of three, zero out of three for parry. Was there even anything to parry? What was there to parry? Huh, I'm not sure. Anyways, we, we got a B, something. And there might be a way to go up, up here? I'm not entirely sure, oh, there is. Okay, so we get Goopy Legrand, very cool. And what about this path? Is there anything to find? Oh, you bet there is. Look at the secret little path. Cutting corners. So I guess you could sort of skip ahead or something. Right. Continue to do stuff in World 1, um, including two boss fights. So let's go ahead and go up north. I think to start things off, we have um, some kind of stuff going on up here. Also, I don't know if there's anything over here. I feel like there were some secrets in this first world map that I, I don't really remember. We'll have to look around. Anyways, hello. Well, who are you? What's that? You two want to fly in a plane like I do? Ha! <laughs> You're not seeing any cockpit till you study those blueprints. All right, so there's blueprints over this way. Aeroplane blueprint. Alrighty then. So let's try this out. I think I do remember this. This is some kind of like different, it's, it's not really like the side scrolling or boss fights. It's more about flying. Hold Y to shoot uh, and for rapid fire. A special one meter EX attack, full meter super bomb morph. Interesting. B is parry. Press at any time to nullify or interact with pink objects, as per, per usual, and ZR is a weird one. It is to shrink. Hold to reduce size and increase speed equipped with mini bullets, so pretty cool. All right, well, I like all that for sure, so let's exit, and we can get started, or is that the, are we leaving now? I guess so. <laughs> That's all we needed to know from there. Sort of weird. Can we talk to him now? I guess you two mugs are ready for the wild blue yonder. Just remember those birds you're flying have their own tricks. Your fancy fighting moves on the ground don't apply up there, although you can still parry like the dickens. Be sure to shrink yourself when the need arises, but remember when you're short, so's your range, see? Well, good luck, I suppose. All right, now let's give it a shot and see what ends up happening. Um, yep, going up this way. Threatening Zeppelin, <laughs> Hildeberg. All right, let's try it out. I remember this one being really tough. We'll have to find out together. 
I'm not exactly sure how I'll hold on to. I mean, I feel like we've been doing pretty okay. Uh, when it comes to all the battles and stuff so far in the game. I, I keep on getting the buns mixed up. I feel like I still need to reconfigure some of my controls here. But, you know, we'll do what we can with what I have. Yeah, and instead of dashing, we can get small, so I've already done a bad job getting hit. But definitely, this one's gonna take a fair amount of trial and error, I feel. But you know what, I'm sure enough practice will be, out great, that's right, he sort of, she sort of jives at you. I don't like that very much. Okay, watch it. Ow. So that was not good? <laughs> Fitting, isn't it? I'm a blimp and you're a wimp. Wow, this is rude. But we do get past the first phase, the only problem is there's like seven different phases for this boss fight. But, um, yeah, we'll do what we can. Oh no. Just trying to be careful. But this is gonna be the first time we'll be able to get to see a super in action, because if we get the full meter, we get to use a super, so that's pretty cool. This is where I sort of kind of want to avoid him or her. I mean, if I pay attention a lot, you can know yeah, when they're gonna go at you. All right, oh boy, parry that. Good job, actually, nice, and then Oh, here we go! Boom, that was our super. So we used all five of our little uh, meters in the bottom left, because every time we parry, and just over time, we gain those. So I could have just used like one card, and I would have just, just done a normal move like that, which I don't think is as good. Oh, so I think the constellation might determine what she turns into. That looks to be the case. But yeah, turning small, oh, come on, that was sort of baloney. It's definitely gonna help us dodge certain things. We'll, we'll still have to be very careful, as you can see, because this stuff goes right for you. So I've only taken one damage so far, which I feel like is pretty nice. Oh, I tried to parry that. Didn't quite work out for me. I don't know. Oh, we're fine, we're fine. Oh, we got a tornado to deal with. Tornado's not so fun. I'm trying really hard to parry this up and not bump into other things. That's not working out for me. There we go. Not bad, not bad. So, oh, you got me with that, you sinker. Come on, come on, come on. Boom, if I accidentally bump into something else though, I'm gonna explode on that instead of her and that wouldn't be very good. Oh, she's not very happy, so I gotta be careful. <laughs> what is she doing? Okay, now she's an angry moon. I don't know why. I guess because she's sort of about constellations for some reason. That's sort of the weird thing about the themes to the bosses. Is some of them are just like a weird mishmash, and I didn't know what was gonna happen there. Who are you lost too soon, and I was only half moon. Pretty close to the end, though. I'm definitely taking less attempts than my first time I played th through this game, so that's pretty good. I mean, I'll do what I can. Okay, I wanna parry that, I messed it up. <laughs> I've been trying to get better with this parrying. Yeah, I sort of like wanna let those guys shoot so that they could potentially shoot out something I could parry. Like this dude. And I just have to wait for when, when she's a bull, I need to wait for her to retract and that's when I wanna dodge. Okay. And they also make a little honk noise. Okay, watch it. What is that, he was green. I don't know if I've seen the green one before. That was weird. Anyways, we have the special. Might as well give it a shot. That was good. Oh, oh, you got me. I can't believe it. You got me with your laughs. See, they say that words can't hurt you. They can. I mean, at least in this game. Everything hurts you in this game. Come on, come on, come on. Ow. Oh, that was just me not being so good at the game. Oh, I do not like it. Ah, oh, man, I did so much worse this time. Uh, I made it pretty far still then, when I wasn't doing well. It shows you like things are slowly but surely working out, right? I just gotta get more comfortable with the flying and stuff. Okay, I'm just trying to focus on earning those parries, not taking damage while I can. Yeah, she's gonna go right for us, so we gotta be careful. Oh, come on, I couldn't even see you moving over here. That wasn't fair. Cause I gotta sort of be in the middle of the screen there, so I don't get hit by her retracting. Whoa, I almost got hit there, that was super close. You know what? I'm giving you a dose of your own medicine. I don't know if that hit her or the little purple blimp. Okay, can't hit, oh, so the green ones, they fire multiples. Wow, that was close. Whoa, just barely dodged that one. Yeah, I don't wanna deal with any of this. Oh my gosh, okay. The bow and arrow thing again. Boom, parrying that, so I've gotten two out of three parries. Oh my gosh, come on. That was awful. <laughs> you won't get too far, it's been foretold in the stars. I like how they're always rhyming. They're all just performers, you know? Let's get back to it. 
Not getting hit by that one, that's for sure. Don't you dare laugh at me, this is rude to do. All right, you're coming right for me. Haven't had anything to parry just yet, but I'm sure I'll change any moment. I got a first parried thing. Oh my gosh, I just let that happen. You know, I don't appreciate that very much. Oh no, oh no. Ugh, oh, I am not doing so well with this one. Hit her with that, let's see if I can actually do it. I don't think I can, but oh, I'm getting worse as I go along. I seem to be doing okay. I mean, I say that, I'm at one health. I'm gonna fire one of these. Oh, it hit that guy, no, it hit multiples. Okay, I didn't know it did that. Sometimes I do like this move too. It can be just reliable to throw them out like that, especially with the consistency that you can do it with. But that's pretty nice. Oh, parry that one, excellent. I don't know if that first one, oh, but I ran right into the ha ha ha. I don't know how far along I was there. But you know what, I'm determined this time. I think we can get it done. Oh boy, just don't immediately get hit. I'm getting pretty familiar with most of the moves. Try not to hit the purple guys, it's just an accident. Right, that's not a parryable thing, so I don't care too much. Oh, I can't parry when I'm small. Okay, I, I wish I knew that. <laughs> Oopsies. Come on, you're going down. I'm doing it, we're gonna take you out. Yeah, this is it's the ha ha ha's again. Parry that, okay, I've done three parries so far. I'm doing the super bomb, boom, smacking you with that. I'm just gonna lay on as much damage as I can while of course trying to dodge things. Oh yeah, she hasn't even turned into the moon yet. I don't know why I think I'm so far along when she's still just like blah, 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 you know? So, not much I can do about this except for dodging, throwing missiles, that'll be good. Okay, so this is the part I messed up on. Ow, Dad, I don't really know exactly how these guys work. It looks like the red ones only attack at a certain spot, while well, the yellow ones, well the red ones only attack if you go past them. Oh, we got gotcha! you! All right, well that's good. Man, oh man, you know this is all crooked now. <laughs> Yikes, that was not easy. That was definitely a toughie. But we got it done. My grade is not gonna be very impressive. There really is no way to skip this. You just gotta sort of let it go do its thing. Uh, but we did everything really good except for the HP, so maybe we could still get an A rank and an A minus. Okay, that's very good. I'd be happy to bring that home on my report card, so you know what, I'll take it. So, with that one done, our first boss battle of the day, we still have a couple more to complete in this first world, so that's what we wanna get started with now. All right, we got Hildeberg. So let's take a look at what's going on down this way. Treetop Trouble, it's a running gun level. Five coins to find. You better bet I'm gonna find all of them. Boys, I'll try. That'd be the best idea, right? The coins are very important. They're really the entire point of these levels. So we wanna make sure we get them. It's sort of the big value. Unless we run into like a coin that's like so impossible for me for some reason. Anyways, oh, we gotta parry off of you. That's for sure. See, I think the auto aiming here is actually a pretty good idea. All right. Uh, once again, I really only need to parry three times, I believe. I think that might change, depending on the level. Oh, I actually needed you, didn't I? That might have been a big mistake then. I mean, I could. Oh, maybe, just maybe. I don't know, I might have already missed out on a coin. If that's the case, I might wanna retry this one. Like I said, coins are important. I think I could just, you know, try to be careful. Getting up to that point. But I certainly don't want to Miss out on stuff I really need. Okay, uh, boom, and then, nice, see that's all I'm looking for. Oh, that wasn't really fair, the trajectory there was weird. Okay, nice. Ow, that was maybe a bit unnecessary, but, ah, uh, come on. Who invited you into our tree? Only members are welcome, you see. Well, I'll keep that in mind. I remember this level being quite difficult, and it's really proven itself to me right here. There we go. Okay. Keep it moving. I just really don't wanna attack anybody for this first part, it seems. Oh no. Come on. That is not cool. I mean, it was, all, it was my own fault for just being silly. Still not cool, though. So our first parryable guy is right down there. <laughs> it doesn't matter too much as long as I can. Oh my gosh, it wouldn't be a problem if I could just time my jumps right. It's not easy. I'll try again though. This is always worth trying again. There we 
we go. Just trying to dodge that guy. Oh my gosh, it's so, I don't know how I did it the first time so easily. It's so tough. Ah. There we go. Was that so bad? Apparently it was. Okay, get that guy, dodge across, get hit in the face. That's just how it has to be apparently. Let's try not to take any more damage at the least. It looks like I can start attacking again. We got our second coin right there. Oh yeah, these wood guys are not very fun. Oh, gotta be careful about them. Oh, oh, I could parry that, and I did. Look at me. Okay, watch for the bugs. Definitely get rid of this guy however I can. I might just have to do some auto aiming here. Whoa, watch it. Ow, I can't stand on top of them? I thought I could. I sort of remember being able to, but I, I might be wrong. I might have just missed as well. Come on. Oh, get up, whoa, come on. I thought I went on that platform, I didn't quite. I already like two thirds of the way through though. Maybe just a little bit more half past why. Oh boy. <laughs> Let me try again. Uh, so once again, try not to attack during this area, just because there really isn't too much of a need to. As long as I could just do that, I'm fine. And I dodged right into that, so that wasn't the best decision in the world. I'm making lots of mistakes here. Yep, lots of mistakes. So for the most part, I seem to be getting a bit more luck with trying to just avoid some stuff. There we go. I mean, I think that is actually something you can do as a challenge in this game, is try to do, I think there's like achievements or missions for, ow, getting through everything without taking damage. Not only not taking damage, but not destroying any enemies, which I feel like in some levels wouldn't make too much sense, but I remember it being a thing. Okay, so we are looking for that last coin to get through. If I stand on these guys, like a little fireball will come up and take them out, so you gotta be quick with it. I don't really get how that works, but it's how it works. There we go, okay, so I've gotten all the coins! No, we made it so far, look at that! Oh my gosh, no! I'm just gonna try it again. Once again, like just running through this one without worrying about the enemies as much is pretty doable when I'm not doing that kind of stuff. <sighs> you know, I don't know what I'm doing right now. Okay, so far, so good. With getting through this, I haven't taken any damage. Don't know how long that's gonna last, but I'll, I'll do what I can with it. Oh boy, oh boy. I like being, oh no, way up on the treetops though, it's very fun. I'm glad that, oh gosh, you don't immediately get knocked out for falling, you just take some damage, but man, oh man. With that being said, we're still in a bit of a situation here, aren't we? Um, oh no, that makes the platforms fall. Okay, uh, I'm in a bit of a pickle. I can't make that jump, that didn't make any sense. I gotta go back to the beginning, I defeated him too, oh no! Oh, I actually had it too, if I could've just made my jump, I would've been fine. Oh, that stinks. Okay, so I'm trying this again, I think if I hit him with that, and if I keep going at him, I can hit him with another one, and then hit him with another one, and hopefully soon we can get him. Uh, I'm in trouble. Okay, geez, he's taking a beating right now. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Dodge him, and then hit him with that, and that was enough, awesome! Where do I go now? Uh, over this way, whoop! Yeah, we made it! Bravo indeed, we made it through! That was the toughest level yet for sure. Okay, as you can see, our time's 132, our HP bonus is two out of three, parry, parry, three out of three. I don't know why I said parry twice. Anyways, we, we did okay, we got an A. Only thing I really didn't do was get the two out of, the three out of three HP, which is really tough in this level. So you know what? I'm not too worried about it. It'll be f fine, it'll be okay. So what else do we have left to do? It looks like we have a dare, uh, stairs down that way. And I have you to talk to. What are you looking at? My chip? Ha, <laughs> that's not my fault. I've been busy fighting off this casino debtors. Now I gotta save up to have my blade fixed. So help me. I wish someone would bust that King Dice one. Okay, I don't really understand that last sentence. But it looks like actually there's something like behind him or something. I think there is. Uh, Cagney Carnation and Floral Fury. Oh no, not this guy. This guy's the worst. The worst. We'll try it, we'll see what ends up happening. He might be the new toughest level yet. He's so cute, but then he's so evil. 
All right, well, if we just hit him like this, you know, if I need to, when we need to get, okay, I forget how he works. <laughs> He's got a big face. Probably set, for sure to spend some of my coins. Yeah, when we're starting the dodge things, I can just sort of do the auto aiming. That should certainly help. Oh, I could have parried off of that when it was pink. All right, well, I just gotta keep that in mind. I gotta keep your big face in mind. Get out of here, dude, ready? Hiya. I love this song, though. Oh, no, well, <laughs> let's try that again. Foes who attempt to fight this will leave. Well, this will leave with allergic, whatever that is. I don't know why I had a hard time reading right now. I guess because I'm putting so much energy and it is fighting. Okay, I'm gonna be able to dodge this one. This is where I probably just wanna get the auto aiming in. And just figure things out from there. All right, so he's doing more of that. I gotta wait for the pink ones. Do their thing. I, oh, come on. Not fair. So I need to destroy these guys too. Oh my gosh, but I'm distracted with you guys. I don't pay attention to you. He's just, he's such a dancing dude. Okay, watch it. Oh, <laughs> he's tough, he's real tough. I don't like it. It's high class indeed. You know what, I'm just doing this. For now, it works. He's gonna start firing at me like that. That's not the buttons I meant to press. Ooh. All right, try it again. Watch it. Yeah, not on that one happened. Sorry, buddy. I could just do this more and more over time. Where's the pink one? There it is, I got that parry. Very good to have. Okay, he's gonna do the big face of doom. So you know what, I'm gonna hit him with one of those and hit him with another one, because why not, just good measure, right? Okay, they're gonna come back to, for me, I know they are. Yep, there it is. So he's trying to dodge so far, I haven't taken any damage, it's absolutely beautiful. Oh, he's doing more of this. Oh, I missed it, that's okay, that's okay. I'll have more to dodge and more to parry, I can only imagine. We have plenty more left to go. Okay, can't believe I, oh what, come on. I'm complaining about that one, I already am. I'm about ready to complain some more. I can't hit it, oh, I'm the worst. All right, go to the auto aiming. What are you doing, dude? You are looking insane. Extreme pollination and total domination. I got pretty far that time, though. A brawl is surely brewing. It's brewing, all right. But they need to make like just like a proper cuphead fighting game with the same announcer. It'd be very exciting. Okay, come on, come on. He's gonna do all that kind of stuff. So I gotta be ready for it this time. I, that was not ready for it. I pressed all the wrong buttons. Ooh, can I change my controls from here? Cause I might just do that really fast. I wanna change something else as well. Options, controls. I have the, where, where's the A button? Right here, EX shoot. Replace, uh, first center the zero with all sticks and axes. Okay, there we go. Um, let's try that. So I don't have to press A for my special because then I'm like letting go of the fire button at times I don't really want to. It gets messy. There we go, got that parry, almost landed right into the other thing. Yeah, let's get our auto, auto aiming. Go, 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 go. And then I can switch, oh, that's so much better. Like a thousand times better for sure. And it's just like so much easier for me to pull off. The auto aiming wants me to get rid of that guy, so might as well give it a try. Watch it. I mean, the thing that keeps me going, why'd I do that for so long? I feel like in this game is the good music. And also, like I said, the meter that tells you really how close you got. Like, that's always, like, captivating. Like, oh, I'm so close. I feel like these games are, are they're always so easy to get mad at and be like, oh, I don't wanna play anymore. Uh, especially when I do that. <laughs> okay, get him, get him, and get him. I definitely need to get, like, a super soon. I mean, I, I, I think I remember how I get them. I need to find, like, some kind of chapel that should be around here. Whoa, I gotta be careful right now. We're in big trouble if I land in that. On those spikes down there, and whatever platform these take over. I love this music, it makes me wanna dance. Come on, parrying that one, that's for sure. Watch it, you know what? You're getting some of this, the only drawback with this. Oh, it's, it's, uh, wasn't ready for it. Oh, <laughs> you're as close as you can get there. Man, oh man, I'm getting you this time. There's no excuses, you're gonna get destroyed. Come on, he's gonna attack down that way. Well, that's where auto aiming can help. 
It's all about trying to find a good balance between the two. All right. Oh, I missed it. Oh well. There'll be more chances for parrying. Watch it. Some of those will attack him. Then we'll switch back to this while I can, while I'm just making a clear shot. That's not what I wanted. And I messed out on that parry too. Now I'm running out of parries to, to get. There we go. Very good. So that's what I'm looking for. Much more effective. I can't believe I dodged that. Okay. So there should be another pink one popping up soon. Hopefully. There. I got it, but then I landed into somebody. Not good. All right, this is where things get a little troublesome, to say the least. I just have to be ready and paying attention. I was not paying attention. Very bad. Okay, okay. Ah, oh, yikes. So this is where I gotta be careful. Smack him with one of these as much as I can. Parry off of that for sure. Watch it. I like it when I can be way back here though, so. But I try to work with, but it's not always easy. But when I'm in the, f the closer ones to his face, I really gotta pay attention to his little animation so I make sure I don't get hit. There we go, come on. I know he's close to getting taken out here. There we go, got another good parry. And it's a knockout, a walk in the park. Why is it a walk in the park? I disagree. <laughs> okay, well, we got it done. Man, oh man, evil flower dude is taken down. What is our score? Our time is a minute 24. HP bonus always two out of three. Parry three out of three. Super meter six out of six. And the skill level is a whopping two stars. So we get another A. Not an A plus. So very close to an A plus. But so very far from it as well. Okay, well, I'm glad we got it done. I don't know what's left. That might be just about everything. It does lead down that way. So let's take a look. Uh, soul Contract, Cagney Carnation. Very cool. And I'm gonna take a look for myself. If we take a look at our list, yeah, we only have technically one more thing left to do. It's not on here, and that is to go down and figure out the little chapel thing. I don't know why it doesn't even mention this, but it really should. I mean, I guess it's sort of like tucked away in a little secret area over this way, a little fish fishing for some reason. Be gone, spirits. Oh, wait, you're real. I was about to hit you with the old parry move. That's how you deal with ghosts around here. Only a nitwit tries shooting someone who ain't really there. Speaking of not being in places, what do you fellows mind moving on? You're spooking the fish. Oh, that is just weird. I don't want to think about it anymore. We're just going in here. Mausoleum one, that's what it's called. Mausoleum. So there's lots of spirits in here, and I guess, according to the fish, we have to parry them. And after this, we're spending some coins, and we're all wrapped up for today's episode. But I've had some fun, you know, making our way through the first water cup head a little bit more. Help! All right, so I think I have to parry all of them. It's a tough thing. Uh, we'll do what we can. Always remind me of the Pac-Man ghosts for some reason. They sort of kind of look similar to the Pac-Man ghosts in like this PlayStation 1 game called Pac-Man World. I played it when I was really young. They also don't look like that at all. I, I, I don't know. I don't know, I'm weird. <laughs> okay, boom, got that one. We're all pretty good so far. I know this gets more difficult later on. There we go, we got the two for one deal. Oh, <laughs> we got the little ghost. That's cool. Excellent. There we go. What more is left? We got this guy up this way. Got this dude. And there we go, victory! Ceramic strike! That was really good. Didn't take any damage at all. And. Gosh, I didn't, I don't know how to thank you boys for saving me. Where are my manners? I didn't introduce or even introduce myself. I am known as the legendary chalice, pleased to meet you. I was searching for magic and got trapped by those ghosts. Speaking of magic, please accept this gift. It should help, whoa. There are other mausoleums around Inkwell Isle. I just wonder. So it looks like, I think with that we got our super move. I probably should have gotten this a while ago, but hey, if I was able to make it through this far without a super move, I wonder what we can do with it once we start using it. It's going to be very cool. It's a type of move that uses all five of our super cards. You unlocked a new super. Very, very nice. Dear me, you mustn't forget that magical super arts have to be equipped in the menu before use. 
Alrighty then. So as you can see in our super slot, we can go ahead and get super art one energy beams. A, a devastating attack spills from your head, horizontal only, ground or air. Very, very cool. So we've got two more of those to get in some future worlds. But for right now, that's gonna wrap it up, I think. I mean, actually, no, we wanna do the shop. And that will be all wrapped up. Super happy about that. But let me take a look at the list. Is like I mentioned the mausoleum like at all? I guess not. I feel like overall pretty good scores, A's and B's across this list. And let's get to our shop. Pork Rinds Emporium. Welcome. Welcome. All right, so what do we got for us this time? I have seven coins I can spend. I could do like a different kind of shot. Like we have spread shots, we have lobbers. Um, we have a heart. I don't think that's gonna be too useful. There's automatic parry. Let me just go ahead and buy, I think out of all these, I like to spread the best. And then we have charge, EX radial bar barrage. Hold attack to increase damage, no rapid fire, so precision is key. And I might just buy some stuff to get out of the way, like the, the Perry sugar or whatever it is. Uh, and then coffee, autofill meter. Super meter continuously fills in addition to what you earn. And now we're moving on over to world two, where hopefully everything turns out quite well, but die house. Ooh, what is this about? I am not sure, but we'll move forward and we'll find out together. Yeah, these worlds, there aren't many worlds in this game, but they can be quite long. Hello? Oh, it's, it's the dice man from the casino. Well, ain't that a pip? Looks like you boys really put a kibosh on them debtors. You can head on over to the next aisle. Plenty more marks for you to learn on there. All right, well, I'll see ya. <laughs> I love his song. It's very cool. But yeah, he's, he's a very scary guy. Oh, guys, hang on. Thank the stars I caught up with you. I believe I found a way for, out of this mess you're in. Hot dog, you have? Your strength is growing. You'll soon be a match for that no good King Dice and maybe even the devil himself. Oh, <laughs> golly, do you really think that? I do, but you'll never get close to the devil unless you already have those soul contracts in hand. Only then will you get a chance to turn the tables on that fiend. So when that time comes, do the right thing. All right, well, just beat him up. That's the end goal. <laughs> we're gonna beat everybody else up to beat him up, but if that's what we gotta do, it's what we're gonna do. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. I do wanna talk about one thing I have yet to talk about, and that is that this game actually has some DLC coming soon. Sometime this summer, I do wanna play that, but I wanted to give this game like a fresh playthrough on the Switch before I did. Anyways, as you can see, it looks like we have plenty of levels all around us, even this little guy, but we'll just start with the level. We have Baroness Von Bonbon in Sugarland Shimmy. If I remember this one correctly, it is super duper duper difficult. So we'll get through it however much I can and we'll see how things go and hopefully it'll be a good time. <laughs> but we just gotta give it our best shot, I suppose. Okay, whenever it's loaded. Yeah, this one's sort of like a bit of an amusement park and look at this, there's candy everywhere, my gosh. Gonna give me a toothache just looking at this. Okay, so we got some like jawbreakers here that are trying to attack me. I didn't try any new weapons just yet. I did buy a couple. Maybe I should have. Uh, get us do auto aiming for now. This guy's just not very nice. He's just all up in my face. Do I have to like get rid of you? I might have to get rid of you before yeah something more shows up. Whoa, you were just trying all sorts of different stuff. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, there she is. Get her. It's, it just doesn't hurt you. Okay, well, watch it. This guy. Is so menacing. How do you dodge this? I don't remember this. Oh no. Okay. Okay, that's a miracle. I did not get hit there. Okay. Um, I'm gonna have to dodge a jelly bean this time. I'm so sorry, buddy. But I can get you this time. Oh, how did I not? How did I not? Okay. Oh, come on. You know what? Hit you with a little bit of that. How's that feel? I do have my first super, I definitely want to use that, so I probably shouldn't do that too much. Oh God, that has to, that's a waffle, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I understand that it was about candy, not waffles. Come on, come on. Oh, It might just be sweets. I mean, I do see like pretzels and this cake, I mean, I guess it's sort of, it's like a cake castle. Yikes, straight off the iron and too hot to handle. So I think I'm trying to attack the castle when I'm supposed to be attacking these monsters that are attacking us. So if I if I just change my priority a little bit, that might just be, whoa, you're new, candy corn. I do not like candy corn. Like I don't dislike it, but I definitely don't like it, you know? It's just not like a candy I've ever really been in the mood for. I'm gonna retry though, because I took damage. I just feel like I need to try to survive this without taking damage at first. Oh, and you're new, angry cupcake man. Okay, you know what? I think this one might actually 
be worth my while to, how did you get me there? Okay, I just gotta keep going. I gotta try to like figure these guys out. Both the auto aiming. It's like dodge these guys where and how we can. Want the auto aiming sort of do at least some work for me. Right now I need to do a whole lot of work it seems. Oh, we got him, we got him, that's good. You know, she didn't like that very much as you can see. Still can't even attack her. Now we got the candy corn and I'm dead. <laughs> oh, I should have read that, something about a sweet tooth. Didn't mean to. I don't have too much of a sweet tooth. Like, you know, there are some candies and sweets I do like, and if I'm not careful, I'll probably have too many of them. I think that's everybody, right? But most of the time, I don't find myself like craving sweets or like, oh, I really want some of the sugary. I usually just want food, you know, I'd rather have a meal. I mean, if there's candy there, I'll definitely, I'll take some, you know, like that's, oh, come on, not a problem. But I, I don't ever sit, find myself like sitting there like thinking, no, I could really go for a cupcake right now. It's just sort of weird like that, I guess. So, you know, like without it being in the house, which I try not to leave them in the house, you know, just not any kind of sweets, um, I don't find myself actually having sweets very often because of it. That stunk. That was just me not being too, too good. Oh my gosh, because I'm trying to get myself in position. How's the jaw, old chum? Um, I'm trying to get myself in the position to actually hit that jelly bean. And that makes everything complicated. Okay, we're doing the jawbreaker again. And a lot of the time, I'm thinking it might just be good to use the blue move. Not always easy. Cause this thing like doesn't just you know go into a pattern. It follows you directly. So. I think we did it a lot faster than normal that time. What do we got this time? Come on, lady. What do you got for me? The waffle. Oh, there's the jelly bean. So it isn't until you watch it destroy your first uh, enemy that you get the pink jelly beans coming out that you can parry. Whoa. Okay, come on, ready? Ready? No, I didn't want to get rid of him. I wanted to parry him. Okay. This might be a bit of a problem. I can't believe it. I got hit. Not fun. He's trying to dodge this dude, he's not being very helpful. Okay, well she's not very ha happy with me either. What button is this super then? I actually don't know, hold on. I know we have to check the controls at this moment. What's the super button? EX shoot, switch weapons, move up. Maybe it's the same button as the super. I don't remember. It doesn't tell me either. Wow, okay, well I clearly don't want to use it right now. I don't know if I can hit that thing. I probably shouldn't try. <laughs> I'm on my last bit of health here. Just trying to survive. I parried that. I made it work. That's always good. This really is a tough boss because it's like a bunch of bosses sort of crammed into one. The candy corns are too much for me. A sweet tooth is fiendishly uncouth. All right, well, that's cool, I guess. Try again. Begin in need. Okay. Got him, move it, move it. This cake house is very angry. I probably shouldn't be so distracted by it though. If I could get like back this way and then turn around and oh, it's like too low. You know what? That's not what I wanted. I can tell you that much. Ooh, we got him. Okay. Well, she's not very pleased, as per usual. Now it's the candy cane again. I thought you were gonna not move in the pattern you did. To be honest with you, oh, come on. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Because he sort of moves in like a figure eight pattern. Sometimes, but not always. Oh, why is the candy cane my kryptonite? Not the candy cane, the candy corn. You know what I mean. <laughs> it ain't easy so far. A real challenge. Oh, no. Okay, so luckily this is working fantastically. Now I think I can even hit him when he splits into his nine pieces there. I just would rather not. I just wanna focus on surviving. There we go, see he was not too bad. She doesn't like that as per usual. Just go back to Candyland. I mean, I guess we are in Candyland is the idea. Ah, oh, I thought the parry would protect me in some capacity there. Don't know why I thought that. Come on, this one's really tough to do anything about and also dodge the jelly beans. Like what a real challenge that is. There we go, we got him. Wasn't easy. I know, I know, you wanna give me a, a talking to at the least. And the talking to is the least of my worries here. Come on. I would love to get that parry, but the darn candy is in the way, the flying candy. Okay, she was 
She was out there, she was trying to get me. There we go, I got that. If I could just get rid of this jawbreaker. Where am I? Oh my gosh, I lost myself there for a second. Here's our super! Hit it with the milk! I don't know if that was a good idea or not. Uh, she wasn't really there for very long. But now we can also auto aim a little bit. She is not looking very nice. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. This is a problem, though. Watch it. Okay, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh, I think I can parry this. I can, ah! <laughs> oh no! I won't sugarcoat it. You never stood a chance. You say that, but I got pretty far there. You gotta try it again, though. So she can just throw her own head at you. We didn't run into this guy last time. Hmm. It's not easy, ooh, it's not easy. I wanna make sure if I can avoid it, not get hit for those guys. Because they would just be better. Okay. A little to the left. Not bad. Okay. Ooh. This guy's just not very nice. Not nice at all. There we go, though. Made it work. I, okay, I don't know if that hit me or not. I, got, I mean, I didn't. But I don't know if it could have hit me. Oh, not Cupcake, dude. He's my least favorite. I think. I, I, I would say even slightly more than can, Candy Cane, or Candy Corn guy. His moves are so weird, and like the way he dashes around is hard to work with. It isn't pleasant. It just, especially when I'm not good at the game. <laughs> Delicious and vicious, wild, mal maliciously nutritious. You are not nutritious, you're a cupcake. I don't buy that for a second, he's a liar. Oh, and I gotta deal with him again. Let's see if I can't. Honestly, he's, he's at least a fair chunk easier to deal with when I don't have to also worry about the jelly beans. I think the big thing to keep in mind with him is stay on the floor. Do not get on the candy, do not jump in the air because when he does his diagonal dashes, they are not easy to deal with, but even then, it's easy to mess up. So it's just tough all around. Who do we got this time? The, the waffle. The waffle's not too bad. You just gotta make sure you're, you're spatially aware most of the time. Okay. I really want to hit this jelly bean, so boom. Now I can switch back to the auto aiming. Don't have to worry about this jelly bean very much. That's nice. Okay, I think if I wait about here. No, jelly bean, I'm sorry. Not what I wanted. This is what happened. Okay. Boom. Got him. I'm just going to stay over here for a second. And we got him. Get rid of the jelly bean. One more enemy then. Who is it going to be? It's going to be this guy. Uh. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I, I just wanted to use the normal thing. Man, I didn't even get rid of him. That did. But now I don't have that for the lady, which is gonna make this very complicated, but right now if I could just you know, really pile on the attacks. Okay, I don't trust this. <laughs> I don't trust it. Just do the auto-aiming and dodge what I can. I have two HP, which is nice. I mean, yeah, okay. Got it. I don't know if that counts if it's more than one time like that. But I'm trying to see if it does. I think it does, but it just sort of counts as like a mini parry. Like it definitely builds something up. Oh, you are not nice. I'm sure you know that. Oh, I almost got that. I just need a little bit more. Okay, there we go. Here we go. You're in trouble now, lady. It's a knockout out of the park. Man, that was crazy. I just barely got it. Yikes. 13 minutes for the first boss. Not too bad, right? Okay, well, as you can see, that took us a total of a minute and 49 seconds for the actual fight. But once again, we did great with everything except for the HP bonus. That's always our problem, which makes sense. That's where the most trouble, troubling thing is staying alive. So we got it done. First boss of the day was quite the challenge, but there's plenty more challenges to be had, so we can't falter just yet. And let's see what's going on. Looks like the tent is opening up that way. And Soul Contract, Baroness Von Bonbon. Bon. Very cool. Let's talk to this guy a little bit. Good timing, fellas. I just added an upgrade on your aeroplanes. Now you can wall up your foes with bombs. Just switch your weapon whenever it strikes a fancy. Try it out! Your aeroplanes are now equipped with mini bombs. Switch your weapon anytime during battle. Alrighty. Uh, so speaking of which, I think this is actually an aeroplane battle. Yeah. Jimmy the Great in Pyramid Peril. Let's try it out. This one, if I remember correctly, is wickedly challenging. Absolutely so. So we just gotta be careful. We gotta try our best and see how things end up going. 
But yeah, like I was saying earlier in today's episode, I want to try the DLC. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. It adds a new playable character, the Chalice Lady, uh, who we sort of saw in ghost form in the last episode. So, like, I really want to check that out, of course, when it releases. As of recording this, it hasn't released yet. Ah, oh, I remember loving this one because of the, the stop motion background. That's really cool. Yeah, the bomb is sort of like this weird, like, lobbing thing. I am definitely going to have to have some trial and error for this guy. That was not good. <laughs> <laughs> but like the stop motion with like a little claymation like pyramid or something. Probably want to dodge smoke. Okay, I think I can parry that cup. Too bad I did as bad of a job as I could possibly imagine. I guess so maybe I couldn't parry it. But I can parry that. So that's good. But if I'm like here, it's a, it's a really weird angle to make work. So I don't think I'm gonna be doing this one too much. But probably does a fair bit more damage. All right, well, yeah, we gotta get through all this now. Try to dodge what we can when we can. We gotta remember that we can turn into small sized airplanes when we need to. And that's certainly gonna help us dodge some attacks. Oh, and I already died. <laughs> you really didn't stack up. <laughs> oh, I get it, I get it. Um, Yeah, this is not easy, but we're gonna have a good time with that. Just gotta keep going. Oh, got a cat. This is new, little cat scarabs. Oh, my, my, my software is done downloading. Forgot about that. Ow, ow, ow. This is a problem. I've already taken some major damage here. I do not like it. So, let's try not to let the same thing happen twice. Yeah, you gotta hit him where his face is. If you don't do that, then it doesn't work. Just sort of silly, but you know what? Oh, but even touching the pillars hurts him. I didn't realize that. Yikes. I guess it's a good day for a swell battle then. Come on, come on, what do you got for me this time? More of this stuff. Parrying that, I'm gonna, yeah, just dodge that stuff in small form. Oh, but I ran right into that one. It's just like that, I can't believe I also got hit there though. That stinks. I know he's, yep, he's about to disappear, so I really don't wanna waste our special. I wanna use it right when the, when the time's good for it. Oh man, what is wrong with me? I can't believe I'm doing that. This part isn't even all that hard. It's, it's the later on parts that can get really difficult. He has a lot of phases to him. Let's try this one more time. See what kind of thing he throws at us. I do like that each time, like there's like certain phases, but what they might be can change with just like at random. And I think that's fun. Oh, come on. I was just trying to get to a place where I could dodge at. Didn't even want me to do that. I've only taken one damage, which is at least a better start than before. Get down this way. Gotta make extra sure I don't get hit by any of these spinning little blades, because it's not gonna be fun. Okay. Not bad. And hello, he's in a sarcophagus. Oh, he's very happy, yeah, I'm in a sarcophagus, look at me. All right, well, you know what? We're gonna go into bomb form and I messed it up, so that's what we gotta be careful of. Be real careful of that, and it's hard to be. So unfortunately, at least that's what I did, is I ruined it. Come on now. I'm not really hitting him too much here. Just trying to get through everything. Makes it more difficult. All these little mummies, these mummy genie things, aren't making it easier. I don't think I could parry them, so I just gotta, oh, get hit. All right, well, what's your next phase, buddy? I know we're not done, there he is. He just, <laughs> just shows back up, like nothing ever happened. There we go. What is this one, then? Whoa, I haven't seen this before. I've never seen that. I'm pretty sure. I do not remember that at all. Parrying and that, I missed it. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? He's mimicking us. That beating was for free, no strings attached. Oh man, he's such a jokester. Okay, buddy, I know what you're up to. I know what I'm up to too, boom! That's gonna be a lot better of a start, I think, for this section. I can only hope. I'm just gonna keep at it now. And if I could just occasionally throw one of these, hit him right on, that was great. Didn't even have to bother with that phase, really, which that phase can be a little bit overwhelming, so I'm glad. I sort of forget what's after that. Oh, um, I don't even remember what I got hit by. Oh, I remember missing, oh, now I remember, yeah, it's a little puppet. <laughs> How did I forget this? Okay, so I just gotta watch for the parryable one. 
which I'm sure is coming up. And I got it, but I also got got. Oh, come on. Not fair. Not fun. It's his darn hat in the way. Jeez Louise, come on. The hat makes it so difficult. Oh, we got him, okay. I wasted a little shot there, unfortunately. Whoa, he's huge. He's making us think about pyramids. Not good, not good, not good. Whoa, that can hurt you. It's barely visible. I need a new volunteer. This one collapsed in fear. Oh my gosh, we were so close yet so far. I don't like it. But I'll try again. So let's see what we get this time. It's all the all the jewelry one. I feel like this is it easiest. Okay, I missed one parry there, unfortunately. I don't know if I can parry that chalice with the pink gems on it. But I got one parry, so that's good. It's something, if I can get two more, that'll be good as well. So we need to destroy this step. We gotta be careful, the spinning blades, which honestly, I don't know if they've ever hit, hit us just yet. Let's not leave that to be a first time, now. Just gotta keep moving. Gotta keep being careful. It's always the scariest when you're entering room and you just don't know where it could quite be. Okay, so here we go. We're all ready for him. I'm gonna wait for him to pop up. He's gonna be like, yeah! And then I'm gonna hit him with this. Boom, beautiful. Now just keep going at him for as long as we can. As long as appropriate. Okay, come on, I know he's low. Yeah, there we go. Didn't take any damage, just like last time. This is where things went a little bad, though. Let's see if that happens this time. Just gonna be able to hit him right away with that, which is nice. It's the hat that makes this all so difficult. I know he's gonna... I can't believe it! Oh my gosh! What is up with me? I'm just gonna hit him with this. Ba-boom! Try not to take any more damage than I have to. There we go, he's done, he's done. His hat might fire once more, but it didn't, that's good. Okay, so now I have two points of damage to take here instead of our traditional one, so that's good. And then I have to dodge this thing, which is barely even noticeable. Wow, 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 wow. Um, also now have to look out for that. And it's not easy to look out for, I'll tell you that much. Let me fire these as much as I can. No, oh, that was it, that was a knockout, very nice. Okay, he is coughing up and everything. I took damage there, but I didn't count, woo. Okie doke, so as you can see, we beat him. The results, a minute and 54 seconds. Only had one HP, only parried two things. Oh, that one wasn't as good. So sorry, we only get a B. Okay, we get an A and we get a B, that's all right. I'm still pretty happy with that. And it looks like this little time guy is too. He's just jumping up and down. Okay, so two boss fights done. That also opens up something over that way. We get Jimmy the Great. And uh, I can talk to you guys maybe? Hi. Who ever heard of a barbershop trio? If we can't find our fourth member, we'll sound right again. We'll never sound right again. Be a pal and let us know if you spot him, won't you? Will do. So what else? Oh no, I remember this one. The Carnival Kerfuffle, Beppy the Clown. Oh, I don't like it. But we'll do what we can about it. We'll probably do this fight and then another one and we'll leave it at that. Like, I think that's a good balance. We'll have to wait and see. A great slam and then some. Yeah, this guy's not fun. He's just not fun to deal with. He's not very pleasant. Um, it's probably gonna take me a lot of trial and error to re-remember how he, he, how we can fight against him. Oh, I was trying to parry that. I'm a dingus. I think that, you know what? Let me exit the map real fast. I need to try some different weapons anyways. I couldn't really try different weapons with the previous battle because it was an airplane one, so they don't really apply. But here I could, so I probably should. So I know I just hopped in this level and everything, but let me take a look at what's available to us just because I haven't, like I said. Let's try the spread and the shot B and sort of see where we go with that. I mean, I can't really change too much besides like getting a pea sugar, which I don't think is gonna be worth our while. It's not that great. Um, so let's go ahead and do the carnival kerfuffle again. And I just think that this might be better or might be a bit smarter during certain situations. One way to find out. And we haven't really shown what this shot does. It's a close range one. Because of that, you're gonna be playing some risk you know, getting so close to them. I'm such a dingus, because I keep on forgetting that if I'm shooting, of course I'm not gonna be able to hit him. And that's where the auto aim can be a bit of a problem. Oh my gosh, he's not easy. Why'd the clown drive over the cup? He wanted to crack him up. Wow, you are so rude. Okay, 
Try this again. Oh my gosh, come on. Like I'm getting pretty good at police watching for that. Okay, pairing off of you, I'm gonna use that to dodge too. I think for this it might be better to auto aim while I can. Nice, okay. At least I got that going on. Whoop. No more uh, parryable ducks popping up yet. Okay. Oh, he fell, good. Oh, now he's on his roller coaster. No, he's here. Hi. Okay, can I get him like this? Oh, you bet I can. Oh gosh, the little balloon dogs. Ah, oh, dude, watch it. Get out of here. It is not easy. It is not easy. This one takes a lot of learning. What the balloon animals think of the cup? Quite the goblet down. Oh, I get it. Goblet, as in, you know, like a cup. I, I, I didn't really get it at first, but then it, it got me. There we go, come on. Ow, man, you turned around too much. Right, I'm gonna use auto aim for a little bit, I think. Like maybe when I know he's not gonna be a jerk. It's not very often that I know that. Whew. Oh my gosh, it's so weird. There's like something odd about the way he moves. And this is why I tempt I'm tempted just to use the same setup the entire time. But I definitely wanna try new things and see how they work. But what I have works so well for me, you know? It can be hard to uh, do that. There we go, see that's what I'm talking about right there. There we go, come on, come on, come on. Get him as much as I can. I don't think there's gonna be another parryable duck. Ah, oh, that was, I feel like he stalled out there for a second. Come on, he's gotta be getting close. Apparently not close enough. There he goes, he crashed. Get him as much as we can. I don't know what this actually, the special move is for this one. I'll have to see in a moment. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I didn't get hit there. All right. Oh, that was pretty cool. I like that. Definitely a good one if you're overwhelmed. We almost have our special. I think, our, yeah, our special's available. I don't wanna use it until I'm like horizontally, you know, aligned with him. So probably not in this phase. There we go, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Okay, you know what, you ready? I'm ready, get him good. Very nice. Okay, let's do some auto aiming so I can focus on parrying as much as possible. It's just a good situation for it. Ah, oh, I didn't even see that stuff coming. Okay, so it's gonna go downwards, yep. Okay, here comes another roller coaster. Sort of gives you that visual cue in the background. But we got him, so I can get a free parry off of that one. I gotta be careful, because there definitely are places on this roller coaster that are spiked that can hurt you. Are you okay, buddy? He's crying. Oh, no. How much more is left? Oh, no. He's an evil carousel of doom. Oh, uh, you know, I need to hop on top of this to survive. It's tough to tell exactly where I am sometimes. I think it's gonna be better to keep these red shots and then go with this and see how many of these guys. Oh, I didn't even notice I had the full thing. I didn't even notice. I thought I had my no normal thing. Oh, we were so close. What do you call a cup that falls off a swing? A tumbler. A tumbler is another type of cup. He's got a lot of jokes, I can tell you that much. Oh, I'm gonna try this again. Come on, buddy. Nice. Oh, don't get too close, though. I just save as much HP as possible, but also parry as many things as possible. So let's do that, and nice. Okay, I got it. So we can go back to our spread shot. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Watch it. Oh, that was just barely. Something that worked out for me there. There we go, he crashed. He only crashes when he slams forward, so you gotta be ready for that. Let's get him again, just like this. Whoa. Very close, and I didn't mean to mess that up because I was pressing the wrong button. I was actually gonna try the super. I made a mistake. Well, that is sort of kind of hitting him. Probably not nearly as much as it should be. There we go. We got him pretty well there. There's that phase done. But, oh, come on. That wasn't really fair, because I had to jump over that. Oh, man, not cool. Well, a little bit's different this time. I actually have two HP <laughs> instead of one. So, what you really gotta do here, I think, is you gotta stay up here, and then wait for the train to do its thing, 
I'm gonna hit him with one of these spin runes. And then we're gonna switch over to the auto aim. Oh wait, okay, you can still get hit by them that way. Like that's what gets really tough and scary here. And that's what I'm trying to deal with is the baseballs going everywhere, but the train got rid of them, so that's nice. Hit him with that. Keep going as much as I can. These little baseball penguins are going to be so ridiculous, as they always are. As they always are, forever and permanently. No! Oh my gosh, I get closer and closer every time, but it's never good enough. Oh my gosh, I never want to see another clown again for the rest of my life. Okay, well this sounds a bit different. I've actually made it here with all three of my health. Very uncommon for me, so I'm just gonna go ahead and wait it out. Hit him like this, very good, very good, very good. And as soon as this dude gets a little crazy, yep, I know that's moving, and I'm gonna boom, smack him with a little bit of that. Oh, okay, I'm still up here for now, that's great. I mean, soon enough they're gonna be throwing those baseballs, and that's when I wanna switch to this. I'm just try to dodge him wherever I can, and I'm doing okay so far, actually. Okay, I won't miss the last one. There's always one last one, isn't there? Boom, hit him with a little bit of that. Hit him with a little bit of this. Come on, he's gotta be getting low. He's gotta be. Oh. Oh, there it is! Oh my gosh, that took me like a half an hour. That took so much work. It really, really did. I think I'll probably finish the episode up with that. But man, oh man, we got it done. <laughs> oh my gosh, it was a two minute and 14 second boss fight. Two damage shaking, but we got a three parry, six super meters, and skill level two. We got a B plus. I guess that time wasn't very happy, or they didn't make him very happy. I am drained. <laughs> I am super duper drained after that one. We are moving forward through the second world, and also you might know something's a little bit different. I didn't realize this was even a thing, but you guys, you know, <laughs> definitely mentioned it. It was that um, there is actually Mugman you can play now. This is apparently a new update that uh, was added in the Switch version, but I think it's available for all versions now. But you can play as Mughead when you're not, or Mugman, not Mughead. <laughs> in the single players. So that's super cool, so we'll be checking him out. I think he plays the same as we go into Funhouse Frazzle, but I think that, you know, his animations might be different or something, but we'll find out. So it'll be very cool for sure. But yeah, we'll be trying to complete World 2 as much as we can in today's episode, hopefully complete it entirely. That's a goal. Um, I haven't played in a day, so I might be a little rusty at first, but that's why I like to put through the running gun levels. Oh, whoa, oh, I remember this one. Everything is upside down, and I can duck into this little duck. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm a little worried, to say the least. I feel like I'm gonna mess some stuff up here at some point or another. Go under you. Okay. Oh, we got this eyeball guy. I don't like that very much. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna do the auto aim here. I think it's a good idea. There we go, there we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't like it very much. Oh, no, oh, I got hit there. I should've just dodged. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, can we beat this guy up? We cannot beat him up. Grab a second coin. I love the background here, it's very cool looking. Very confusing as well. Oh, we have all the upside down staircases. Okay, I think I can dodge across. Ooh, just barely! Watch it! Oh no. Whoa, okay, I tried to duck under that, didn't work out so well. I don't even know what's going on right now. Gotta be honest with you. There we go, that seemed to work pretty well. So you know what I might do is, ah, <laughs> get hit by a horn. Now I wanted, we had toyed around with you, now scram. Actually, not too bad for a first attempt. Yeah, I like Mugman a lot. He's a lot more like modest and relatable, I feel like in a lot of ways. Obviously like Cuphead, sort of the overzealous older brother. I mean, to be honest, the Mugman is like the voice of reason. He was always like, Cuphead, no, ow. Okay, I'm gonna restart that. I was gonna duck under him, but I have to press up to duck when we're, you know, like that. Gotcha. So go into this duck, because I need to get up there to get the thing, the coin. So I want to do that. Whoa, hello. That wasn't there before. That was weird. Huh. Okay, keep going. So I want to do some auto-aiming for this. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. So far, that's the case. You just got to watch the lips. They're not so nice. Okay, we gotcha. Not too bad. I maybe should have gone... Yeah, like this, because I, just, I don't want to go on the roof any more than I have to. The ceiling. This gets a little confusing. There we go. Some of these, oh, coins, I was gonna say, are very easy to get, but then I was a dingus and ran right into it. Oh, come on, I'm back down to one health again. Okay, let's just try not to be as silly with this one. 
That was almost pretty silly. There we go. So I just need to be careful with this guy because he's not very pleasant, is the thing. And I can just skip him. <laughs> That's the best part about it. I gotta go right past him. All right, you know, let's go ahead and hit him with that, and then hit him with, ah! I got him too. Jeez, that is tough. If I could just get there with more than one health, we should be fine. But yeah, let me tell, uh, let, 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 you, okay. I, I don't know what I got mixed up with my words there. Tell me, be sure to tell me that. <laughs> oh my gosh, playing Cuphead and talking coherently is not an easy combo. Let me know who's your favorite, Cuphead or Mugman, which one will you be playing with in this update? I would love to hear about that. Anyways, go ahead and start beating this up. Oh no, we should be fine. Just gotta go over here. Luckily, we don't have to do too much against this guy. As long as we can just keep aiming that up, we're A-OK. -okay. okay, that could have been a little bit more of a problem. Got a little lucky. Yeah, I'm gonna let him fire. Grab this, but then be careful. Nice. Duck under that one. See, I got it this time. We're doing much better. Just, oh, be careful. Yeah, I need to do that. And then I need to, whew, it's all kinds of risky. And that's gonna be better there. But for this portion, I'm thinking we wanna do this and that and that. Yeah, we got him, sweet. Except we got our last coin right there. Oh, okay, that's fine, that's fine, it happens. That's okay. The only problem now, it gets very confusing which way is which, but we're fine, we're fine. He's probably gonna spit out some stuff that won't be, uh-oh. <laughs> Oh, he's, he's puts his tongue out. There's some things I do remember, some things I just don't at all. So how do I get through this? There we go, I made it, bravo! That wasn't too bad, I remember that one being much more difficult. I feel like some of these I remember being much more difficult, and some of these are just as difficult as I remember them. All right, look at him, he's so happy. I love it. So, a minute 32, two out of three HP. I didn't parry anything, except for the cards, so I guess the cards don't count. All right, well, that's fine. <laughs> I don't care too much. We got it done with Mugman. That's always fun. And as you can see, what is gonna happen next? We still have plenty of other levels to check out before we're gonna move through here. We got a little bridge, that's nice. So let me take a look for myself. We go to our list. We still have two more boss fights and a running gun level to do. So let's look around for exactly just that. Over this way, we got the shop. Okay, we got Pork Rinds Emporium again. We got a good chunk of coins, so, I mean, we got all five coins in that level. So there's definitely something we're gonna be able to get. Like, what's coffee, autofill meter? Oh yeah, I remember. Let's do the lobber. I feel like that's something we need. Goodbye. I remember the lobber being helpful for one of them. Don't remember which one. Uh, maybe the dragon. There's a really tr tough dragon to fight at some point. we we'll keep an eye out for that. Uh, but yeah, let's try this out over here. Look at the fun fair fever running gun. All right, we'll be able to get another five coins. That's great. Okay, so trying this one out now. We'll have to see what ends up happening. Whenever it loads. So this is the second running gun level. We also have to find the, the you know, the cathedral thing. Okay, oh no. Watch it, buddy. What do you think you're doing? I'm just gonna hit you with a bunch of this. Oh, I think we got him. Oh no, I remember these. Oh, I can parry you. Ow, that was not worth it. <laughs> Gotta be careful, those bolts are so tiny. Oh no. That's a big problem. What? Wait, what? I parried you, but it didn't count? You did look foolish today, but clown tryouts are next week. Huh, not good. And begin. I don't know what to do about most of this. Try to get over like that. Ow, not good. Okay, I tried to parry you, it just, it didn't work out ideally. There we go, I got past it. There we go, I'm persevering. Ah, <laughs> this tiny little watermelon seeds. That's what they're the size of. Jeez, come on. This is where all the difficulty went. Yeah, let's just get through this as much as I can. I sort of like not don't want to attack the, the balloons. Actually, that might be a better strategy. It just feels like natural just to hold the fire button the entire time. At this rate, that was really dumb of me. Was, I don't know if dumb is the right word, but I just didn't play very well there. 
There's another one. Ah, didn't even see the bouncy ball. Well, that's pretty cool, I like that. Can I hit these or no? I guess not. Something else might start hitting him. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Okay, I see. Parrying that one, that was pretty cool. Oh no! I, I thought I could make that jump. I guess I can't. Let's get back into it. This is not easy. But I think we can handle it. So, yeah, let's try to be careful. Yeah, the hard part is that he doesn't really go, he doesn't move very linear, linear, linearly. That is really not good. I'm like a mess right now. Parry you, that's good. Watch it. Okay. There we go. The only problem is I'm down to one health now. That's not gonna be so helpful. Oh, I wanted to, okay, well I'm not parrying that one, but I can parry that one. So we only have like a finite amount of these guys. That's good. But there's gonna be more! <laughs> How was I supposed to see that one? Yikes. Okay, so I'm back here now. I wanna get down here. Watch it, okay. Okay, whoa, I actually didn't take damage there. Interesting. <laughs> oh, that was so uncool. Oh my gosh. Just please watch for a second. I don't know how we survived that, to be honest with you. Are we close to the end, like at all? I have no clue. <laughs> okay, uh, wow. Okay, that was a good jump, actually. Believe it or not, I made, I made that happen. Oh, hello. This actually hurts you from here. Oh, no! <laughs> what was that? What hit me? <laughs> oh, I thought I found myself a little cheap. I was being a bit cheeky there. No, not at all. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, let's try that all again. So I've caught up a little bit to where I was, but I'm back down to one health. Oh, okay, watch it. Oh no, yeah. Okay, so back here I am. I'm gonna hit you with as many of these as I can muster. <laughs> okay, watch it, lady. Oh no. All right, going back that way, we got you. I don't even know what she was supposed to be, some kind of like coin operated, operated machine. What's over this way? Nothing, okay. There's like a fair amount more here. Oh, it's like, oh yeah, big snack sign. The weird pretzel guy is a little creepy. Um, is he like undefeatable? No, he, he's defeatable. We got relish and mustard flying at us at top speeds. And ketchup, don't forget ketchup. Arguably the best condiment of the three. No, should've just dodged. Oh man, that is tough. Not easy whatsoever. Okay, I'm back here now. This time I have full health, so hopefully the condiments won't get me. I mean, they might still get me, but hopefully they won't get me so much that I lose all three health, because then I'll just be plain embarrassed. That's a relish. Got it. There's a coin. Glad I got that one. It looks like the, the weird thing about the pretzels is they don't really do much. You're like They hop up and down, but they don't really have an attack, it seems. So like you really can just get up close to them and attack them down. They're sort of like just they take up space. And we found the dude spin all these condiments at us. He's very rude. <laughs> all right, well we got him. And I think I got all five coins there. Yeah, I would say so. I think that was all five of them. I hope so, we're about to find out. I had a lot of fun with that one, but it was tough. It definitely took a couple of tries. And it was a minute and 44 seconds, two out of three HP, two out of three parry, really? I thought you did pretty good with the parries, but I guess I only got two of them. Anyways, that's still an A minus, I'll take it. So I guess we don't get the final here, but I should have six coins in total, right? Because I had five, spent four, and got another five here. I'm pretty sure I spent four on the lob. We're about to find out. Yeah, we have, well we have six, yeah. Okay, then perfect. And let's talk to you, hello. You can't catch me unless you take a shortcut. That's what some punk kid kids did last week. It's only, it's the only way they could have beaten me to the rides. Say, maybe you could show me where the shortcut is around here. All right, well, I do think we know where our shortcut is, if I remember correctly, but for right now, I'm not gonna worry about that too much. Instead, we're gonna go back to Pork Grind's Emporium and check out what, he, what else he might have to offer. So we have Roundabout, and then we have Charge. I think I like Roundabout the best out of this collection. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, so there's a couple of different ways to go now. I mean, I think up this way, or like up, might be the... Cathedral? It is. You know what, let me earn this up now and also talk to you. So have you spoken with the Quadratus, the Wadria being across the aisle? That is something few others can claim. I have. 
Is there anything of interest around here? There's the dragon. He, he's he's very scary. Uh, mausoleum too. All right, we'll try the mausoleum too now. Um, that way we can hopefully get another superpower. I sort of really prefer the one I currently have, so I don't plan on changing it. But it's good to have these just in case. <laughs> I like Mugman's little animations. The ghouls are out tonight. Now I don't think Mugman said that part, but I just like this little stretching. Boom. Got it. All right, so far so good. I like these missions. Like they can be tough. I remember struggling on them a little bit at times. There we go. But so far we haven't taken any damage, which is really nice. Oh no, we got one of the spinny ones. They're tough, but I somehow made that work. That was good. All right, boom, got him. This music's so good too. Oh, I almost did that too soon. I'm, I'm actually surprised I hit it. Even like the dodging animation seems to be a little bit different. I think. Oh, oh yeah, I can't let it hit the, the, the trophy. I, I forgot that was sort of a thing. <laughs> That's how. Used I uh, used to not really having an issue with that I am. But that was great. I had tons of fun with that one. I knew if I rooted around here, I could find something special for you. But but I didn't know I'd get trapped again. Thanks for saving me a second time. Take this magical super art, and I'll see if I can find you another. All right. Well, that's pretty cool. That's the lady we can play as in the new DLC that's coming out sometime this summer. I'm super excited to play that. That's all the that's the main reason I wanted to replay this game is so that I could, you know, jump into that and it just sort of feels a bit more coherent. All right, so you unlocked a new super. Very cool. So we'll check out super number 2 at some point or another, but not now, I don't think. Right now I do want to go up this way and take on our next battle, which seems to be Wally Warbles in Navy Air Action. Let's get to it and see how things go. I'm open pretty good. But I think this is a flying mission. If I remember correctly, there originally was a bug in this level that I ran into that <laughs> froze the game. Anyways, let's get to it. So I do have the, ow, bomb move. <laughs> that was not good. This one took me a lot of attempts. I remember, ow, yeah, now I'm realizing why it did. Definitely a lot of like little tricks to this guy. You gotta sort of learn as you go along. I don't know how much I like that. There we go. See, his animation for that is even a little bit different. Oh, here we go, here we go. Parried him. That's always good. Oh, I wanted to get that guy. Oh well. I could just keep with these for Sometimes I feel like these, like if you can land them, are a bit more damaging. Ah! Oh, sort of uh, misangled the trajectory there. I own the air, I fly where eagles dare. Wait, that was, I guess we were just about to go into another phase there. Let's try this again. I think I'll be able to do a little bit better this time. Just because I already know what to look for. Like that's gonna be the triple bullet shot. And then we can dodge this. Okay, he threw out two there really fast. All right, parry off of you. Wait for that and go right into it. That was not what I wanted. No, I didn't mean to hit him there. That's sort of a shame. Okay, that's fine. Parry that guy, move over this way. So I could, ow, it's not easy to do, but I could parry you, turn into this, smack you. And this, oh, you didn't like it. Oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> he sort of just freaks out a little bit. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Uh, we got a lot farther than that time, for sure. He's got a lot of little tiny phases. Come on. I know what I'm doing now. Hopefully, watch it. I love the background for this one, though. Oh, it's so cool. All the, the ones in the sky are definitely always a good time just because of the visuals. All right, I'm gonna go down here, boom, get you a little bit. Now let's get your little buddies up here. Oh, come on. I don't mean to destroy the pink one. It just happens that way. I can't believe I missed that. That was just embarrassing. No, oh, come on. That's very silly of me to do. Okay, ready, parry him. Excellent, so I have the bomb move for when I need it. I don't think I wanna use it here because I think the feathers will do something to it. Oh, come on. There we go. Here we go, here's my chance. Boom! Come on, keep getting him, keep getting him. Oh no, he's back at it now. Oh, oh, boom! That was pretty good. 
Oh, now I remember this. Then he turns into this evil little guy. It's not easy to deal with. And then they start getting closer. He's got like the evil spiked eggs. It's just like, it's such a weird thing I missed. Are they always pink? I don't know. Oh, they are. Too bad I let them hit me there. I mean, not on purpose, it just sort of ended up that way. Oh yeah, oh, <laughs> my dad's the brawn and I'm all brains. Together we bring the pain. Oh, that's his dad, okay. So that wasn't too bad. I feel like I could definitely, if I could just dodge some of those, you need to know what you're getting into for that one to dodge it. But it's definitely doable. Watch it. Okay, I'm gonna dodge some of this stuff. I'm gonna have faster reactions. No, I wanted the pink bird. All right. No! Ah, I'm trying so hard to deliberately not hit him, and I end up just directly hitting him. Dodge the egg. It might just be better just not to worry about it, and then just parry him. Probably what I should have been doing from the beginning. Just add so much more to dodge. Okay, before you get to do too much, that was actually really good. Because I think if I get hit by these feathers when I'm doing that move, it will intercept it. So that would stink. There we go, so when he's tired, hit him with this. That was good. Okay, back it up again, back it up. Yes, okay. No damage taken so far. I can hit this guy, back it up. Oh boy, we're in trouble. But we're doing all right. Hard to hit. Oh, that was way too soon. That's fine, that was my first bit of damage taken. There we go. The time was a lot more anticipating the speed of it. I think he's gonna do it again soon. Yeah, look at this, look at this, look at this. Ready for it? Boom, how's that one feel? Oh, we didn't like that very much. What's going on next though? We're not quite done. Oh, I forgot about this phase. This is where the bomb's perfect. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hit the pink shoe, but then everything else is becoming a problem, so I didn't really hit that. Whoa, I, I just, I've never really used that move too much, so it's always weird to me. We got so close there, even without my feathers, you're, you're in four stormy weather. Oh my, that was so close. Let's give it one more good shot, and hopefully we'll be able to get it. I think so. I just gotta stay back in that last phase, try not to get hit leading up to it. I really think I could get up to there without taking a single hit of damage if I play right, which obviously I think you can say that about literally any situation in any game. But you know what I mean, right? Maybe, I don't know. I think I just I have a lot more of a possibility with it, with this one. Boom, got it. Okay. That's sort of my favorite thing about this game though, is that while a lot of the boss fights are really truly tough, I do feel like they're all doably fair. Um, and not only that, but masterable in a way that's fair. There aren't like too many of the boss fights that are like absolutely bogus. There are some, don't get me wrong. But most of the game, it's a really well balanced of difficulty that I like a lot. So I, I was sort of bummed I took some damage there. But it happens. Just gotta let it be. Let's hit him with some of that. I don't know if that was the best idea. But you know what, if he starts firing at me with one of those, I can parry it, and now I got another one of these. Boom! Got it! Very cool. Now let me get out of here in one piece if I can manage. Oh man, the timing. A little scary, but I did it. So he's gotta be getting taken out soon here. I'm gonna dodge out one, and I still get hit because I'm not being so smart with it. Okay. That one I can get without too much of an issue. <laughs> Come on, dude. Ah, that was all my fault too. Oh, I almost got hit there too. That was super scary. So I want to change to, no, I could actually just go in there now, maybe. Okay, that could have been a big mistake. Luckily it wasn't. The problem here is there's so much to dodge. At some point, especially when he's on that side of the screen, it looks like to me it's gonna be a, oh, much better idea just to stay back. Hit him with one of these. That's not what I meant to do. Not whatsoever. I got the buttons mixed up. Ah, oh, that happens too often to me. Oh well. <laughs> oh, so close, it's so far. The ending is a really tough part. Come on, I'm so ready for it this time. I can get him, I definitely can. There it is, there it is, boom, go into bomb form. Switch like that, go like this. Hit him with as much as we can. Okay. I need to back it up. I really need to back it up, we're taking damage. There we go. Oh, they didn't get him. I thought they would, but because they usually just auto-aim. 
It didn't happen that time. Oh my gosh, hit it. Oh no, smack it with that. There we go, there we go. That's not gonna work too well, I need to do this. Come on, on my last bit of HP, there it is! It's a knockout, they're peppering him up now. They've turned on him. <laughs> That's just weird. All righty. That was not easy, but we got it done in a minute and maybe two minutes. Oh, look at that, two minutes and 10 seconds, one HP. We got the three parries, we got the six super meters. It's gonna be a B plus. Oh, I guess they weren't so happy with that time. That's unfortunate. Ah, uh, that's fine. But I think that means there's one last boss fight to do. I've been saving him for last for a good reason. There's a rainbow, cool. Uh, but there we go, Soul Contract Wally Warbles. That's a tongue twister if I've ever, I've ever seen one. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at our list. There's one more thing left to do. I'm not looking forward to it, but that shortcut is actually behind Mr. Warbles over here. Um, it, and it should just be going all the way around and popping up. What do you know, over here. And look at this guy. Hey, I heard you managed to parry four times in a row. I'll bet you're so proud you can bust. Here's a coin to reward your persistence, boys. Don't spend it all in one place now. Oh cool, we got a free coin. <laughs> I mean, it's really impossible to not spend an entire coin all in one place. Actually, maybe that, I guess it is the shortcut, but we could have found it some other way. Regardless, Grim and Matchstick in Fiery Frolic. Oh no. Actually, before we get started with this one, as far as I remember, the lobber is actually better in this situation. We'll find out together if that's a bunch of baloney. I don't remember, but I do remember this guy being ridiculously difficult. So if we can get it done on the first try, that we feel really good, that's not gonna happen. Let's see how far we can get on the first try though. Just from when I remember the boss fight and pure reflex skills. Oh man, I love the background for this one though. See, as you can see, this one can just Oh man, the, yeah, the weird part is the lack of sort of m amount of dodging movement you're able to really properly get. Whoa, okay, it is just this, not a lot of real estate going on in this one. Oh no, especially with his wiggly waggly tail. Eh, I'm not getting this one on the first try. Well, oh, that was good. Oh, yep, okay. I missed all three of my parries and it still took damage for each one. Don't m misunderstand my flames, I just meant fun and games. Really? And maybe he's really friendly and just comes across really awfully. I just love his animation though, he's great. So when I'm getting closer to him, I do a bit of that. And there's no way I'm hitting those ones, so that's fine. But I think this does a fair amount of damage. I like how the last one's always the parryable one. Ow, oh, okay, not good. I do think that we should probably save up though for the special. Oh, that was not going the way I was expecting it to. Let's hit him with some super milk move. That sort of worked. I mean, we're moving on over to this. Oh, you know what? This is actually where the roundabout thing would work well, wouldn't it? So maybe I have some options on different things. This is one of the few bosses where you can really mix up with the weapons and it can sort of work. I'm actually tempted to try that. I'm gonna try that real fast. I, I should have read that too, but I'm gonna try changing our weapons so that maybe I can try the roundabout for this area. I think that could really work. I mean, I guess the auto-aiming could have also worked, but I feel like if I could do this, this would probably likely do more damage. All right, one more time, let's get into it. I'm already sort of making some progress. So, you know, first try I didn't get too far. The second try I got to the second phase, so if I can get to a new phase each try, this won't really be too bad of a deal. <laughs> Don't think that that's gonna keep up, but I'll try. Okay, so whenever this guy's done dancing around, I agree, a very great day for a swell battle. So I just wanna get up here as soon as I can. Not gonna get those ones, but that's fine. All right, he's jumping right into the fireball. Okay, I actually, a bit surprised I dodged some of that. Okay, that's just, I can't see. Too much movement on the screen there for a bit. That is something I remember being a problem coming up, is that there's gonna be a lot of movement on the screen. In like one of the last phases, that was really hard to figure out. So let's try the lobber. I don't remember this too much. And is that even landing? Oh, it is landing. Well, some of it. The problem is these guys are gonna start jumping around and that's where maybe the auto aim would actually be better then. I mean, actually, if I duck and cover and not do that, that's clearly not what I wanted to do. 
Sorry, I didn't mean to put you in the <laughs> hot seat. How do you stutter with an H? Like, that's just tough for me to do intentionally. I'm sure I've done it myself, because I, I stutter with most words. But that's unintentionally. Okay, I might land a couple of those. It's the tail that always gets me, you know? It's just hard to both dodge something horizontally coming at you and vertically. That's where I might just be better to stay back for some of it, if it feels like that's what's gonna happen. Cause this thing has a better reach than it seems. So honestly, I definitely could do that. You know what, this is gonna be a great opportunity to hit him with some milk. And I take some damage out. That's not what I want. Oh, and I died. Whew, that is tough. I wasn't very far into it. Like, I mean, I got halfway through that phase without it being really all that long, you know? So that's definitely interesting. So parry that one, duck under that, parry that one, not bad. Because you really want to stay up here, but then you can't really see what you're doing or where you're going, and it gets really messy. He's got a really long tail, by the way. <laughs> I mean, his proportions seem to be too to be, too be determined with how much he's stretching and squashing. Come on, come on, come on. I don't want to use the milk move until we're on the second phase, because I know I don't need to use it now, and if, if you know he moves away, I'm gonna be missing out on potential damage. All right, so let's just start with this. I haven't taken any damage. This is a particularly good situation if I didn't land on the fire dude's hat. I mean, if I do this, that doesn't hurt him. I was hoping that maybe if I just hit his tongue, it would count. So this is where the roundabout move would help, and also just not being very bad at the game would also help. Ah, oh, man! These little fire guys make it so much more difficult. We are just about done that one, too. Come on, I, I, I'm starting to piece them together. I just gotta get him. Okay, so I'm gonna hit him with one of these. Hope it works out okay. There it is. Okay, didn't take any damage. I got very close to it, but I didn't. I just gotta pay attention to the little fire guys as much as possible. Yeah, okay, that, that cloud was just misleading. Okay, there we go. Two HP left as well, so that's pretty good. Oh no. Okay, this is where it's really good to have the roundabout though. Really, really good to have it. I mean, these fireballs are not easy, as you can see, because they pop in this way that's just like, ooh boy. And visually, there's just so much happening on the screen, and he breathes fire. One, two, three, you better flee. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, we're in for it now. All right, here we go again. I highly doubt this is gonna work out all that much better, but I'll do everything I possibly can. It's just, oh, dodging the fireballs and dodging this dude when he goes into his flame mode. It's also hard to tell which one it's gonna be, but it was in that time. Oh no, he's not done. Oh man. And I was so close that time too. We actually made a good chunk into that. If I could have just waited a little bit longer, I could have pulled off my super and might have been it. Not easy. Definitely not easy. There's a reason why this is like the most hated boss in the game. At least one of them. I don't know if it's my most hated boss. There's some of them that I, I feel like I disliked more. Anyways, I mean, I guess you guys are along with me for this one anyways. Come on. The goal right now is just to not get hit whatsoever on this first phase while also trying to, you know, get it done quickly. Because the quicker the better, of course. Come on, there we go. Actually didn't take any damage, so that's good. And then I switch to this and I get to the lowest you know, cloud I can. And then when things seem about right, I'll do this. And I'm gonna dash back over. Excellent. So now what I gotta do when it comes to landing damage and try not to get hit, that that cloud's a, uh, a trick. Whoa. Oh, darn. It's okay if I take one hit of damage during this. Oh, come on, of course that means I have to by law take two points of damage at the minimum. That is infuriating. Oh well, I did what I could. We're back down to one health, but man, all I have to do is pay attention to the fire guys there. They just sort of jumped in a weird way. Ay ay ay. Like I know I'm not supposed to hit the fireballs, but what? Like, I gotta also hit these guys. Like what do you do? I don't know. So I'm trying a bit of a different strategy for this one. Instead of using like the reverse, like I'll use the reverse for a couple of shots here while he's still fitting up, spitting up the fire. But then when he starts spitting up the fire, all I have to worry about are these guys. They'll make a noise and pose before they actually jump. So as long as I'm fast enough, I should be able to, in theory, dodge all of them. They always jump at you, and there we go. Um, right when they're about, to, like wherever you're standing is where they jump at you. So now, this is a perfect opportunity to hit them with the super. 
and he's been hit with that super. Okay, so if I can just keep surviving and just try to dodge some of these shots with the uh, roundabout. Oh, he's dodged him and then just, ah, oh, well that was just silly of me because I'd not expected to have to attack. I don't know why, I should have. Okay, we're fine, ow, not fine, not fine, not fine, not fine, we're down to one HP. Um, I can't believe it. That last phase is so difficult that I just lost all three HP there. There's just like so much visually going on with the moving clouds and everything. It's just, oh, it's tough. But I, I think I know how to get there a little bit more reliably now. If I could just keep those things in mind, keep those practices, have all three, three HP, and then, um, you know, hit them with the final blast, and then just sort of survive for a little bit. All I gotta do, that'd be great. <laughs> I don't know how possible that actually is, but I'll try. Come on, come on. I'm actually not doing so bad. As soon as I start talking, I just gotta not talk. I'm so sorry. I know that's the whole point of the entertainment is to talk. Okay, okay. Ooh. Duck under that one. Dodge at, no wait. Oh my gosh, we finally did it, a day at the fair. Whatever that achievement is, I don't even know. I can't believe it, we only took one HP. We almost did that perfectly then. <laughs> All right, so our final time for that boss fight is going to be a minute 26. It felt like a very long minute and 26 seconds. I only did one parry on that one. Oh, out of all the ones, I only do one parry on. Oh, that stinks, oh well. Usually I get like three, four, five parries on that, but I guess I only did one. Man, oh well, it's fine. I'm just so glad we got through it. It took a lot of effort. But as you can see, we got ourselves another one defeated. We got Grim Matchstick. If we keep playing as Mugman as we move on over to Inkle Isle 3, I'm super excited for this one. Um, at the same time, I'm not excited for it at all because I'm sure it's gonna be super difficult. Got a lot of a hard time with the dragon at the end of World 2. But hey, it's King Dice again. What's up, buddy? Looks like you might have under underestimated your bums. You gave it to them, give it, I cannot speak. You gave it to them debtors, but good. Go on over to the next island. Lots of fun times waiting for you over there. <laughs> All right, well, goodbye. I don't know what's with the one, two, three, four, five in the background, yeah, like on the chalkboard. It's like a weird thing to put there. The little mugs have some fight in them, I'll say that much. They're making mincemeat out of them debtors. You see, I knew there was something special about those fellows. Well, don't be so sure just yet, boss. I think there's something fishy about those two. Don't blow your wig, Dice. If those two little f what is that supposed to mean? Try anything, I'll be waiting. Okay, well, let's keep moving. And let's, <laughs> let's see if we can handle whatever he throws at us. I'm not really sure. Okay, so here we are in Inkwell Isle 3, and there's a big, oh no. Oh no, they're starting it with the worst one. R Rumor Honey Bottoms and Honeycomb Herald. This one's a headache and a half. I can tell you that much. Whew. Uh, I mean, hopefully right off the back of the dragon, we'll be able to handle it, right? Maybe. Probably not. But I'll try. Okay, let's get to it. Oh, I haven't changed my weapon, so let's hope this is gonna be a good idea. Oh man. Oh man. Oh yeah, they go everywhere. He's throwing out another one. You know, this is just rude and painful too. Don't forget the painful part. There we go, kind of, I like how he just gets like one boo-boo on his arm and he's done. Okay, come on. Oh, here she comes. Not good. And her head just falls off. It's very odd to say the least. Oh no, we got the bee bullets. Okay, watch it lady. You really think this is necessary? I gotta do the auto aiming for a little bit as I try to dodge this stuff. Okay, what is she up to now? Something awful, I'm sure of it. Whoa, can I parry this? I, if I press the button at the right time, maybe. Hey sugar, this honey is off limits, now scram. I, I can't, I'm sorry. I, I'm contractually obligated to defeat you. Okay, destroy this guy while we have the chance. Oh, I don't like the bomb. Okay, that time wasn't too bad, but it could definitely be a lot worse next time. Made it work, okay. He's gotta be almost defeated here. Oh, there we go, that was actually a pretty good parry. Oh no, I'm falling all over the place, and at bad timings too. 
<laughs> the bees look so depressed, I feel so bad for them. I was like, I hate my job. That's never fun. Whoa, whoa. The Triangle of Doom is, is also not a fun situation. Whoa, oh, I didn't even see that one. It sort of blends in. Like, man, the visuals to that are very odd. Okay, she's doing the wrecking ball thing. Can I get her? There we go. Then she starts spin spinning out the bullet bills. That's when I gotta spring into action. Okay, no, that's not that's not very good. Come on, come on, come on. Ah! There's a, so much dodge in there, it's crazy. I know I can do it though. Honestly, our current weapon setup aren't, isn't too bad for it too. So like, I really wanna get going with this. You know, I'm getting like halfway through the boss fight. Okay, beat him up. Just go from as much as we can. Oh, come on. The bee popped up at the worst time. I wasn't really ready for him. I don't know. All right, taking one point of damage. I would like to not take any more. But we got him. Come on, where are you? Now well, you're popping up somewhere. It's all about where your finger shows. That's where you're gonna pop up. Not to say that's that's very a good situation. Oh no. Oof. There's like this rhythm you have to maintain that's so ridiculously tough. Okay, so for this, we know what to do. Get the auto aim going on here. There we go. Ah, oh, what was that? I, I swear I pressed jump there and nothing happened. A whole bunch of nothing. These things are not fun to deal with. Is she gonna throw more of these at me? I gotta be honest right now. I'd rather you not. Not the Triangle of Doom. There's this two translucent for me. We're about to get you too. You stinker. I've been trying to save my super so I can use it, you know, closer to the ending. I don't think she's gonna be as bad as the dragon. But I don't think she's gonna be good either, you know? If I could get some parries, that'd be great, but it's really hard to get them in such a crowded area with so many stinking platforms. I mean, I don't, like, it's like, I like there being platforms so there's something I can stand on, but then also it makes parrying a bit of a nightmare. There we go, I actually got him without taking any damage this time. If I don't get hit by that, which I did not. Okay, she's popping up over here. I'm trying to hit her with what I can before I need to go into the, because of evil triangle of doom over here. And I don't even know if that's like parryable. It's not really at a very good spot at all. That's really frustrating. <laughs> okay, okay. If I could somehow dodge all the bull bills, I don't see that actually happening. I need to do the auto aiming. Oh man, what are you doing? Okay, so I got here without taking any damage again, which is nice, but can only go so far. If I definitely need to do, what hit me? Did it really, did he really rebound on me there? Definitely jumping down from the platforms can also be important at times, but not always the most doable thing. All right, uh, I tried to parry it. Sometimes it's, parrying doesn't work the way it should, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on. I don't know if you're on your last phase here or not. You're not. Okay, come on, I really don't wanna deal with you here. <sighs> come on, I, I know I had my special, and she was about to go into that last phase. That's why I wanted to save it. Dominate and abominate, that's how I be. <laughs> we didn't even get to see her in that form. Oh, man. Come on, I know we can do it. This will be the one. I can hope, right? We'll find out. <laughs> okay. Just about sort of switching at the right one at the right time, which is easier said than done, of course. It always is, always will be. Okay, that's a good parry to get. Let's go into auto aiming. There he is, he got beat, so that's good. Ah, oh, I almost got that parry, would've been good. Where's she gonna be? She's gonna be here. Okay, yep. Oh man, that is so frustrating. That is not even fair. I will argue that to the end of time. I don't even know what happened there. Oh my gosh, these things are the worst. It's like, it's, it's the only level or boss fight where too many platforms is actually a problem. All right, I think that I might've just made my way into the last phase or I'm very close to it, I guess. Come on, I know I can get it soon. No, not the Triangle of Doom. That is the most infuriating thing. It's like, no, Triangle of Doom. I just want to be able to beat you. 
come on. So now she definitely should be in the last phase. I'm gonna be very flabbergasted if she's not. Okay, here we go. Hit her with the milk! Eh, milk and honey. That's a, that's a popular combo, right? She's going crazy. Oh no, what do I do? Um, I guess I did the right thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, oh no. It's very uncomfortable. Oh. <laughs> okay, well I made it there. Oh, we got so close! Oh man. Not too bad though, I know what to do. Sort of, kind of, if I could just make it there. The bullet bills mess me up. Okay, dodging all that. Just trying to beat him up as much as we can. Oh, eh. Come on, that's it, that's it. And then, yeah, move this way. He sounded so offended that time, I was like, ah! All right, all right, yeah, get over this way. And as much of this as we possibly can. Because landing this, I feel like, oh, come on. Because the, dis the time, the, the distance of time between when it shows up and when it first shoots is unfairly quick. Because by the time you've utilized the, inf that I don't even know how to explain it, it's just so frustrating. I never will look at bees the same again. All right, I'm back at this again, once again with two HP. I need to land as much damage on this as I can. I'm glad that doesn't hurt. <laughs> I always get so worried it will. It's the fists though, like, I mean, I just don't like them very much. They're not very easy to work with. I mean, I try to take it nice and slow. Okay, is she doing the buzzsaw? She is. Which is sort of a good opportunity to land some of that. Oh no, I let it get too far up. Okay. Um. Oh man, it just sneaks up on you. That one was so close to, probably just like one or two more hits and I would've gotten it. This is upsetting. So let's go ahead and try this again. <laughs> I tried so many times, but if it works, it works. You know, just like, I just gotta keep going. I've gotten so close now that I know I can get it, obviously. Just don't beat the fists. At least not right away. Okay, I can hear the buzz saw, so I know it's gonna be a thing. And I have two hit points, you know, so I just gotta keep going. Oh, and these fists, oh, that's it! Okay, awesome! That phase is sort of weird, because what I think happens is sometimes you build up enough damage to move on to the third phase, but she's still into an action of her second phase, so she still tries to complete that before she moves on to the third phase. So sometimes you can do third phase damage in the second phase, if that makes sense. Uh, that was just really difficult to run through. How was my super meter only five out of six? I did a super move. I don't know, I don't care. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Weird. Anyways, um, as you can see, we got that done. It was an awful score, but I'm glad we were able to do it. <laughs> that took me a half an hour just for one boss fight. And that unlocks that area over there, which is very cool. Uh, we got Rumor Honey Bottoms' contract, which is pretty cool. At this point, though, I wanna sort of explore the rest of this area and see what else we can find. A little uh, pirate over this way. Ah, you're gonna need some tips if you want to kill all these deadbeats. Start by mixing up your weaponry. Can't expect all your arms to work on the same on every foe. Mix and match landlubbers, that's what I say. Okay, I'll keep that in mind, I have been already, but. And as you can see over this way, we got Captain Brinybeard in, shooting and looting. Now before I do this one, I would actually like to change my weapon just to my normal setup and see how that goes. And then maybe also, I haven't checked out my other super, it's the invincibility, cross astral plane to become invulnerable for a short time. I don't know if it's good though. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. I think what I have is fine for now. Cause it does damage and it makes you invincible for a short time, so like that combo is really nice. So you have to be invincible for a good while to make the other thing worthwhile because you aren't doing any extra damage. Okay, we got Mr. Briny Beard here. Oh, I remember this one being really tough. Whoa, oh that's parryable. Not really in a good angle. Oh, look at that, nice. This is where it's just tempted just to do this all day. <laughs> All right, parried it, very good. And I already have this right here, this is why this is so good. Okay, what do you have to say about that, sir? Apparently just more barrels. This is a pretty interesting first phase, because not too much happens. Okay, what's going on now? Oh, the squids. Oh, that's a lot of stuff to dodge. Oh, okay, wait, it darkened my screen. I don't know if I was supposed to dodge that or not. 
Ow. Okay, that was just me being awkward. <laughs> Hit him with this. Oh, that wasn't so bad this time. Ow! Wasn't ready for that. <laughs> okay, so I'm taking damage here, obviously. To be expected that I died sooner or later. How much damage we, wow! Your skills be like me buried treasure. Just a myth. Wow, that was rude. We got pretty far for our first try. That wasn't so bad. Now I know a bit more what to expect. Might be able to make this work out a little bit better. I might, I'm not gonna guarantee it. Especially if I do that. Let me retry, I know I can do better. It's a good day for us, well battle. Okay, what's he got for me? He's got that and that. Oh, could have got that one too, but that's fine. Still got a good chunk of them. Let's back it up a little bit. And then he's gonna start firing. There we go. See, I like doing that a lot. That's fun. <laughs> That's really fun. Okay, so here comes, oh no, it's not the squid this time. It's a shark. Hello, Mr. Shark. Please back it up. Thank you. Okay, um, thank you for actually finding that one closer to me. We're getting there. There's three of them. Oh no. Oh, I got hit there. But that was the first time taking damage, so. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm sort of starting to figure this out. We got the, the dog sharks. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Very ridiculous. The barrel really does add a fair amount of problems. I, I can't believe I parried that. There we go. Oh, I need to dodge right away yeah, so I don't deal with that. He's looking sick. Oh, ow, no. Oh my, <laughs> there goes the pirate. The, the, the pirate ship is the real problem. <laughs> oh man, we still have so much more to go though with the pirate ship. That's the, like, the, the real boss fight. That actually might be a problem. Come on, come on. Nice. All right, not too bad, not too bad. So you can tell when the barrel is ready to attack depending on his eyes. I mean, obviously that's a hard detail to really focus in on at times, but when his eyes are sort of like spinning around and he's looking up, that means that uh, he can't really attack you at that moment, but when he's looking down and he's looking fierce, it means he's definitely gonna come for you. And I can't believe I got hit there. Okay, okay, he's got the shark again. That's fine. I think I can handle what I got. Okay, back it up. Nice, okay, go, go, go. Not too bad. And now there's just like a lot of context clues I need to pay attention on. The barrel's face, the boat's face. It looks like the shark's coming, so I gotta hide over this way, and it gets real complicated from here on out. There we go, there we go. I'm fine, I'm fine. Yeah, if you could pull up the pink thing again, the squid, I guess is what it is. Or maybe an octopus. Oh, ah, oh, come on. So this is the one who's gonna launch him off, and I just got this guy to deal with. I think I gotta hit his little uvula. That was just complicated. That orange move like sort of swirls away around in a way that's hard for my eyes to keep up with. It's a little wild. I feel like I should just throw normal EX moves at it at that point. Hard to say though. That's for sure. <laughs> Very hard to say. Okay, I missed one there, unfortunately. I'm not missing that one. It's important to earn those up as much and as fast as I can. Get back up this way. Whoa, what a combo. Absolutely beautiful. Sign me up for more of that. What? Okay, if you say so. That was sort of a shame. Okay, come on, keep fighting him. Who is he gonna kill over this time? Uh, dog sharks. Never fun. Luckily, we're handling them just fine. All right, he's pulling this thing up again. There we go. Does get you in a good angle for that too. How'd I not get that one? Okay, both of my damages have been from just poorly parrying. Whoa. No, oh, I don't know why I didn't move. That was me being very silly. Okay. Okay, so I'm doing pretty good so far and I wanna keep it that way, but Actually, he called over another thing. I thought the bow was gonna get mad. I'm surprised at all this right now. Um, 
I feel like maybe, maybe we're gonna do some extra damage to him. Here we go, here we go. This could end up good, could end up not so good. We'll have to wait and see. No, no, that was bad time. <laughs> Thought I was, no, come on. He just whittles away my health so quick. Wow, I didn't even know what to expect that time. Oof, oof indeed. Okay, so I'm trying to earn up my fifth move or my fifth card here so I can do my final move if I need it, but I'm hoping Ah, oh, no, I can't believe I got hit there. That was just me being bad. I got a little battery, too. I was, I'm hoping that I can use a special move, obviously, when I need it. Now, okay, okay, getting a little better at that. Now he's gonna get mad, he's gonna do a super charge. I'm gonna duck run under it, but I can keep shooting because of the wonder, wonderful auto aim. Let's hope this actually lands. Oh boy, that did a little bit. Not as much as I was hoping. I feel like I need to jump a little bit. Okay, I'm starting to get this a little bit more. It's not as bad as it looked. But this will be, I wish I could, oh no, they're still working in there, it is a knockout. That boss fight wasn't as bad as I had thought. It's just sort of knowing about how to make those jumps with the little bubbles with the orange juice in it for whatever reason. Alrighty, so it was a minute and 51 seconds. Two out of three health, three out of three parries, way more than that actually. So that should be a nice A, right, yep. There it is. That's definitely one of those ones I feel like if I practice enough with it, I could definitely get the full A plus for it. But hey, not so bad. Let's go for one more, or, or well, as many more levels as we can, I guess. There probably shouldn't be one more. There's quite a few more left for this world. Uh, God, man. I feel like it gets more excited every time we can put in a level. I'm not sure, though. Anyways, list. Uh, yeah, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine things to do. And I've only done two of them. So I need to at least do like four or five. Uh, moving up this way, we have a running gun level. It's Perilous Piers. Let's try it out. I think this, oh no, I remember this one. I don't like it for multiple reasons. One, it's difficult. Two, it has creepy crabs and lobsters and stuff. I don't like it. Not one bit. <laughs> we'll do what we can. Maybe I'll get lucky and I'll do it like on the first try or something. I highly doubt it. No. Not expecting it. But hopefully me and Mugman can make our way through. I don't know. <laughs> I don't like these guys. They're just flying around. Okay. Oh wait, ah, <laughs> I feel like he got, he took a lot less damage to get rid of too. Come on, come on. I just gotta get rid of him, there we go. Getting past these fish juice is like not easy for some reason. Boom, got it. Okay, that got that. Oh, come on. See, look at these crabs, they're creepy, ah, come on. I'm just trying to be careful. There we go, whoa! <laughs> right into the fuzzy thing. The Fish Federation and the Crustacean Nation are victorious once again! Oh no. We'll do what we can with this, but don't know how it's gonna turn out. There we go. Okay, come on, come on. This guy is just like a pain in the butt to defeat, especially with all the fish. Plenty of fish. There we go. Oh, come on, that is just too tough. That is, just, the angling is really upsetting. <laughs> I know, I know, Fish Federation, yada yada. Come on, let me get back out there. There we go, I dodged him. But this guy's the real pain in the butt. But if I just sit here, oh, he, he has like a different range of attacks. He really is aiming for me. All right, get that. Okay, I'm trying to just focus on this thing so I can get it. Get rid of that dude. And I can't just simply, there we go. Just jump down and ignore all my problems because my problems won't ignore me. There we go, there we go. I know there's a coin coming up. Oh, come on. The extra time I needed <laughs> to angle up that jump didn't help me very much. A happy starfish down there. Oh, watch it, buddy. Lobster doing the backstroke. Not a fan. Okay, I, don't, I do not like this guy one bit. Why do you have the power of lightning? Who knows? Oh, I got you already. Well, that's nice. How and how? How about how? <laughs> I don't understand. Don't you do your lightning. 
You do your lightning thing, then fine. See if I care. I'm, a, I'm just getting out of here. Oh, I see that coin in there. It's a pretty sneaky little spot. So I think we found three coins so far. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I made that jump. Whoa, <laughs> what's happening now? Um, so he makes like a little cannonball, and there's shrimp, and there's, that's a scallop, I think. I have no clue, that's parryable, good to know. Um, so I'm gonna have to time this right if I want that coin, and I did not time it right, so. Oh no, I got it, but I got got. <laughs> oh my gosh, what do you do? That was ridiculous. Oh no. I was so close, too. Come on, this time we got it. I know we do. I believe it. I feel it in my bones. There we go, there we go. Oh. Come on, just like sit here and get rid of that guy. And then, ah, oh, couldn't quite get him. That's not gonna be good. I'm trying my best to earn up that, uh, that super so that we have it. Easier said than done, of course, especially when I get rid of every parryable fish there is. Okay. Oh no. Get on top of him. Ah oh, no, there's another one. Okay, I'm gonna wait right here. Go over like that. Watch it. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh. Ah. Hold on. Parry this guy just because I can. I don't know why that got, grabbed my curiosity so much. But it did. No way! That just wasn't cool. And that just doesn't make any sense! Why? Why is that jump like so weird? Like is there something I'm missing there? All right, so I got here with two HP, which is usually not as, you know, bad as I normally am. I'm usually at one HP here, so let's keep it that way. I do have my super move, but I, I like to keep on to that for as long as I can. Grab that coin, oh no, I missed a coin. Well, then I need to do this up. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. Oh man, I've been trying this quite a lot and I've gotten very close, but not far enough. <laughs> Definitely not far enough. Okay, the problem is the shrimp and everything else make this, oh no. Well, there goes my coin. You know, I've tried this so many times. I just need to move on. I would love to get that extra coin, but I'm going crazy here. Just trying to get everything else. I like, I just complete the level, you know? So I'm just, I'm just gonna keep going. I'm not gonna try to restart it just because I missed a coin because I'd rather actually Move through this level without it taking an hour. There we go. Whatever, who cares about one last coin? <laughs> Way too many tries on that one. Way too many. Like, it's a fun level, but you get really sick on it. Sick of it. Oh, on like the 15th or 20th or 5,000th try. Okay, well, as you can see, I'm not gonna get a very impressive score here, and I couldn't care less. Get me out of here. Come on, Mugman, we're leaving. So what other things might we be able to do in today's episode? I wanna get at least like around half of the world done before you know we finish up, and then we can do the second half in the next episode. Definitely the difficulty is starting to spike as it's supposed to. It's sort of the last world before the final boss, you know? Anyways, we got some stuff over there. We got the cathedral, which I'll probably do. I also wanna take a look. We've gotten two boss fights and they uh, leveled on. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if we could at least do like four things, I mean, I guess if we do this as well, that'll add to it. I mean, it won't be on the, on the on the list for whatever reason, they don't end the mausoleum. But hey, it's still good to get. So let's get to it. Mausoleum three, we'll be able to get some kind of power up, which is always cool. The ghouls are out tonight. The ghouls are out tonight. So obviously, with this being the third and final one, it should also be the most difficult. That's what I'm expecting at the least. So <laughs> let's see how things go. There we go. We're getting some pretty cool combos. I feel like, sometimes I do sort of feel like they improved the parry control since when I first played through this game. I'm not really sure. Whoa. Oh no, hold on, ready, boom. There's a lot of ghosts now, <laughs> whole bunch of them. Wow, look at that combo. Whoa, and it keeps going, that was amazing. Oh my gosh, that was so cool. <laughs> we even got an achievement for it. Okay, here comes this lady. I'm gonna go ahead and try to, boom. No, wait, whoa, 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 what? Oh, come on, I landed. We were right at the end. Is success achievable? Not when we are this unbelievable. I was so close to it, too. That was the first time we failed. I guess even if one of them hits it. It was sort of an awkward situation where I was supposed to be in the air, but I wasn't really because I hit the, 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 the table. 
Which sort of sinks. Makes me sort of wish that the table wasn't there. I guess it could be helpful for like a decent starting point. All right, boom, get that guy. Move over there. I mean, I know the first time I did these, I failed at them a lot. Okay, get that guy. So I'm not making as crazy as a combo. Oh, come on. <laughs> this one's suddenly really tough. Here comes a spooky bunch. A spooky bunch. I mean, these are some of my favorite levels though, because they're just sort of really fun and satisfying to do, especially since they're a little different each time. Especially these later ones where we can have these crazy combo jump opportunities. Like, that's just a lot of fun. There we go. See, last time I was in that situation, I just ended up landing on the table. All right, get that guy and that guy. Ooh. The problem with this one as is that while you're working on some ghosts on one side, they'll pop up on the other and become a big problem. Okay, not too bad. So wait for her to loop around. There it is. All right, I see this guy and his two friends. There we go, pretty cool. I thought this one's a lot more tame. I don't know why it's not as difficult as some of the other ones. But hey, I'm not complaining. There we go. Got him. Because this one little touch is all they need. And there we go, yeah, that was way easier. Magician Lord, very cool. So we got all three of them, I think. <clears throat> Thank goodness you came by. Those lousy ghosts had me, but good that time. Here's the last magical super art I was able to find for you. Well, time for me to take a powder. Good luck. All right, see ya. <laughs> So it looks like we got ourselves all three of these special moves. That's super cool. And hopefully we can utilize them at some point. So we have an invincibility one. I think this is the one that sort of turns us into a tornado, but I'm sure we're about to find out. All right, you unlocked a new super, number three. And it's not gonna tell us anything about it from here, but we can go to our super giant ghost. Maneuver your spirit and body simultaneously for maximum damage. And he like spins around real fast and everything. Okay, so let's talk to you. Hi there, little turtle guy. You boys think your situation is a multicolor mess, don't you? But what if I told you there was a way to see it in shades of gray? A way that only a pacifist platform would be able to perceive. Would you violent little mugs believe me if I told you that? I wonder. So yeah, there's actually a black and white mode of the game you can play, but only if you complete every uh, run and gun mission without damaging anybody, which is really tough. Okay, so what's our boss fight up this way? It is Cal Calamaria in High Seas High Jinx. Very cool. <clears throat> Sorry, I, like, I, I don't know why I keep on having to clear my throat today. Anyways, I think I remember this one. If I do, it's gonna be a tough one. I don't know, a lot of them are tough from here on. I don't know if there's any easy ones from here forward. Whoa, this one looks really cool. Yeah, I just love the moving water. Oh, this is an airplane one, okay. All right, well, we'll get, get at you. I throw one of these at you, watch it. Okay, we got electrical fish heading our way. <laughs> oh my, can I parry off of any of these? I can parry off of that one. Ow, oh come on, that was a trap. That's not fair, that is really tough. What the heck? Okay, there we go. I'm throwing some of these at you. Oh, boom, that wasn't too bad. Got an angry turtle down there. He's ready for a fight. Okay. Boom, got that one. Oh, I didn't even see that they were spreading out. You are a cutie and I'm not sure if I should catch and release. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Uh, let's keep going. Let's see if we can't do that again. But maybe a little bit better. I don't know why everyone's so evil in this world. But they are, ow, jeez. I, I need to be better at that. So right now I'm not being very good at that. It's got land shots, not take damage like that. Okay, ow, man, I just, I don't know what I'm doing, ever. Okay, so we actually have the special, but I cannot get there in one piece. Man, oh man. Okay, let's do it again. This time I might actually start with this again. I feel like this is actually probably more damaging, but because of that, it's probably harder to land as well. We got the angry turtle, so I wanna definitely back up the places that are a little bit safe for the lander shots. I'm not gonna be able to parry that one. There is just so much to dodge there. That was crazy. All right, back to this for the time that I got. And then I'll switch back to this, parry that. Yep, I know how you guys work now. Doesn't mean that I'm good at doing much about it, but I'll do what I can. Ow, come on, be gone. 
There we go. I need to see what the special is for the for the lob missiles. I've never really done that, have I? What do you do about this? Oh, it pushes you up. Okay, that's a problem. Ow! Come on. That ain't cool. Oh, we got this guy again. And then the evil ghosts. I can't believe I didn't get hit there. Actually, there I go. <laughs> how far did I make it that time? You dare to gaze? How about stone boots so you can swim with the fishes? Uh, so I guess she's both like Medusa and a, and a mermaid? All right. Okay, so, oh, you're doing the, the seahorse first. Oh, that's what it is. Yeah, seahorse, I get it now. Okay, well that combo actually is quite deadly. Ow, I always forget about the fish just leaping at you afterwards. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna parry that one. Ah, oh, man, that is a mess. That is a mess of all messes. Come on. Okay, try again. I just, I love the background of this one. It's so beautiful, I love it. All the, like, the watercolors, I guess are called, right? Pastel, something like that. So let's go ahead and just beat you up like this for a little bit until you throw some more threatening things at us. Oh, where's she going? Oh, she's back. So the redfish actually is probably the easiest one to handle, which is why I never get it. <laughs> there we go, watch it. Come on, just one more card and we should be good. If I could parry. There we go. So let's, oh no, it's the same. Oh, both ways it's the same? Oh yeah, that's right. I don't know why I keep assuming that's like specials or supers or whatever they are, are tied to the weapon when they're not. Oh well, looks like there's only one super you can get for the airplane missions, that's fine. Okay, you're doing the yellow fish now. And this is actually a lot more challenging. Dang, every single time! My gosh. I never get it right. Okay, that that's weird. Oh, now she's just Medusa. What? What do I do? What do I do? I gotta fire a lot. Um, let's just fire a lot of these. Like that, oh, okay, I couldn't parry it. That's fine. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, watch it. Oh, now you're made of stone. Okay, now you're just ahead. Oh, this is bizarre. This is really okay. Oh, I keep on forgetting how that works. I just freak out. Doesn't look like there's too much of a way to dodge it either. Okay, you know what? I need to just go in. Ah, that was not what I wanted. Holy mackerel, is that your best effort? Actually, we got pretty far there. We could do that again, we'll be fine. Let's give it one last shot, see if we can't beat her. Okay, land some of these right away. Just before she can really do much about it, especially like the seahorse isn't that big of a deal. But then she'll sort of go away. So I just need to be real careful and try to, yes, yeah, stay away. See, I've learned her tricks this time. I don't know if that's actually hurting her or not. So now we got the angry turtle of doom and his ghost friends. Okay, so far no damage, that's good. What are you calling in this time? We got all the, the, the puffer fish. There you go. I oh, don't know. Double parry, triple parry, not quite. Oh, did that even hit her? I don't think it did, what a letdown. I feel like you can't use that move here. You really just gotta use the individual ones like this. There you go. Okay, not happening. Actually can dodge this quite easily, given the situation. I'm gonna hit you with one of those. Oh no. So this is where things get tough. Can I get rid of these guys then? I don't know. I don't know, come on, come on, come on. There we go. I don't know which button specifically I'm supposed to press, which is the tough thing, but if I throw one of those out, that'll be great. Okay, okay, okay. Get me out of here, get me out of here. I'm just pressing all the buttons at once. I don't know if that hurts her at all now, though, is the tough part. It might not. Oh, parry that one. No, 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 no. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Three HP still, actually, is fantastic. Just dodge the evil skull. Okay, see, if I just, I need to make sure that when that's coming our way, that we angle up appropriately so I don't get hit. That's really all I can do. There we go. <clears throat> oh, no, 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 no. There we go, we're good, we're good. So I'm gonna throw, oh no, that, that. I was trying to not do that. But hey, if it works, it works. Look at that, perfect. No damage taken. That was a beautiful round. I can't believe we just did that perfect. I think we're gonna get an A plus score. That's really exciting. So as you can see, it is going to be a minute and 50 seconds, three HP, three parries, six super meter, and a skill grade of two. That's an A plus. Golly, a perfect score. I wanna see more of that, that was great.
Okay, so what else is there for us to tackle around here? We want to make sure we take it on. But that was that was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that boss fight. Crapard! So I actually want to go back, but this is Calamaria. Completed. Yeah, I want to go as far back as I can. Or maybe I should go to the shop first, see Pork Grinds Emporium, all the kind of stuff. And see what he has to sell. I mean, we have seven coins right now. We could have had eight. Oh, wow. Well. Welcome. So he has a charge and he has, okay, so you know what? We'll just buy the charge. Oh, well, he's almost out of stuff. We got whetstone, parry attack. Your first parry move doubles as a damaging axe attack. That's sort of weird, but okay. Yeah, I remember that and it's just like not making any sense to me. Anyways. Let's go ahead and uh, take on at least one or two more levels. That would be great for me. Hello, Mr. Fork. Not everyone earns a grade A rating, if you know what I mean. And not everyone can maintain that level of quality over time. Consistency, my dear friends, that is what it's all about. Then you will experience scintillating sensations that I do. Okay, so maybe I should talk to you if I get all A ratings. I don't plan on doing that right now. Oh no, I remember this one. Uh, Werner Werman and Marine Corps. All right, let's try it out. <laughs> this one's tough. If I remember correctly, this one's real tough. I don't know, they'll have to be prepared. I think this one's sort of more of a reference to an older cartoon. Sort of, kind of? Yeah, it is. Well, you'll see what I mean soon enough. Uh, oh gosh. Yeah, I remember this now. The music is bringing me back too. Maybe I should use some auto aiming. Okay, I parried off of these. Oh, I see, I remember that now. I really like this song. This is probably one of the best. Oh, who's that in the background? Ow. Come on. Oh, he's got a spoon, everybody watch out. There we go, that was a good parry actually. All right, you know, you're getting the milk. Ooh. All righty, all righty, come on. Oh no, there's bottle caps. Oh, well, okay, I don't know what's happening at the moment. <laughs> okay, those are spinning. Okay, well, it's, it looks like it's a good idea that I dodged. Okay, I'm sort of piecing together what's going on here. So I can stand on this thing, luckily. You just get him like this for a little bit. Got it. Actually, yeah, I can just attack like this. Oh, <laughs> I forgot. We made it pretty far the first try. This tank is the ultimate weapon. You will not win. <laughs> All righty, if you say so. But I think the hard part's still coming up. So if we could get through this without taking damage, it'd be great. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, that was actually a decent parry. Ah, oh, that was not. <laughs> this sort of jumped into it. Doesn't help me very much. Oh no. Ow, oh, okay, I'm gonna retry that one. I sort of parried or dashed the wrong way. It just didn't work out. Gotta try again. Okay, we're taking this dude down this time. No, come on. <laughs> I'm pressing the button like multiple times so I can hit it, but it's just sort of weird because I don't want to jump too high and hit the other thing. A weird balance. Okay. These bombs are both easier and more difficult to dodge. They're like little cherry tomatoes or something. There we go, I got it. Okay. Nice, okay, that was good, that was good. There, yeah, we got the two for one deal there. Let's smack him with a super. Excellent. <laughs> I like how everything in the background was jumping around there too. There we go. Okay, so far so good with that dodging. Wow, okay, so wow, he didn't even do any of his like moves where he charges forward. So when the flames come out, that's when I gotta move. I don't know why I couldn't piece that together, but I really, okay, man, I'm a mess right now. Oh, well, well it was so easy to do, I just, I'm silly. All right, I'm hitting him with the milk right away. I don't know why, but I played really badly with the cherry bombs, so I took more damage than I would have preferred. I think that for right now, we'll just do the auto aim. I will just try to dodge things. That might just be a better way to focus on stuff for this area. That way I don't have to, oh no. Oh, I jumped right into him. Not what I wanted. Okay, so I hit him with the special there nice and good. So I'm just trying to do the auto aiming where I can because it's much easier than trying to manage everything at end aiming, you know? There we go. Okay, ow, dude, I would appreciate it if you could watch it. Because this is not easy. Okay, there we go, we got him, we got him, we got him. 
So what's happening next? Oh no, it's a cat! He ate him! Oh no, this is a problem. What's the smack with a couple of these, I think? Ah, oh, I didn't even pay attention to that part. This is meow. Man, we got a lot more to go to, so I need to get there without taking too much damage, is the thing. But yeah, obviously this is a reference to you know, the cartoon series Tom and Jerry. It's very cool, but not an easy boss. That's for sure. Okay, so I actually got here with my special without taking any damage. I don't know how that happened. An absolute miracle, and you're gonna get a whole bunch of milk. I you know cats sort of like milk most of the time. That was actually not very cool. <laughs> Ow, and I didn't even know those things falling from the ceiling could hit me, but I guess they can. Oh no, this is just weird. This is just plain odd. Um, I really don't know, man. I went in with full health, and that's all I did. I hit him with a special. Why? <laughs> He just attacks so quickly, you gotta, it's, it, it's really tough, because it's hard to get to that point in the boss battle, and then on top of that, you really need to know his attack patterns to make it out of there unscathed. So it really stinks. Come on, I'm here with three health. If I don't win this one, I don't know what's gonna have me win this one. I've been having such a hard time with this last phase for an obvious reason, it's really tough. And usually when I'm there and I have health, and I'm like, okay, I'm ready to do it, they usually change the pattern on me, only then. So if I have any other extra superpower, I should just use it to throw right at him. There we go, there we go. It's like, throw that one up there. And just like, keep attacking for this. Like, I'm gonna parry that so I can throw another one up at him, but I know I'm close. I know I am. Okay, I come, okay, there we go, we got him. I don't know. Oh, and it was around the whole time. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, indeed. That took a lot of attempts, but I'm so glad we got it done in a minute and 35, and it might have even been an A plus. I don't know, I guess so. I am so blown away by that. Like, it worked out pretty good. <laughs> Two A pluses in one day on the third world, I'll take it. All right, so there we go, we finally got it done. And uh, we'll see what's happening after that. Looks like some doors have been opened up, which is fantastic. We got the Werner Worman contract forward with it. I did a little bit of Mung Man in the last couple of episodes, so I figure it might be fun to go back to Cuphead now and just tackle whatever bosses we have left. I believe it's three more bosses and one more run again level, and it looks like our last run again level is right up this way. It's the Rugged Ridge, so let's get to it. Now, I wanna give a quick warning. I haven't played in a couple days, so if I'm rusty these first few battles, I'm so sorry, but hopefully we can get it together real fast. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping. We'll have to wait and see. Ready? Whenever this hourglass is ready. Here we go. Okay. Oh, I remember this one. Okay. I'm definitely gonna be playing bad at first. I'm just saying. But I'll survive as much as I can. Oh, I remember the evil fire heads of doom. Everything is of doom around here. There we go. Watch it. Okay, we're fine. Oh gosh, I remember big rock cat. Get out of here, rock cat. Come on, come on, come on. I know he's almost down, he has to be. Oh boy. Okay, we did it. We got past him. So far, no damage taken, some way, somehow. I mean, this is sort of kind of the easy part of the level, unfortunately. Oh, okay. We made it work. We haven't parried anything yet. There hasn't really been anything to parry, but I remember there being something around here. Okay, I messed it up. Oh no. Oh boy, ready? I can parry this one. Yeah, that's something. Watch it. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to parry that one either. So it's like every other little dragon. There's a first bit of damage. There we go. Get that coin. Thank you very much. Oh boy. Man, oh man, that was ridiculous. Oh, we got the goats of doom. Everything is of doom. There we go. What? Well, that doesn't work. I thought that's okay. I sort of did it right, but I also did it wrong. Gotta keep that in mind. I do see this. I think we got four out of five of the coins. So we're just looking for one more. You know what, I'm so tempted to use my super move against you. It might be worth my while. But at the same time, I don't know if it is. Those guys were pr pretty easy to dodge. Oh, hello again. So I need to be careful about this. So maybe, okay. So I can just defeat the wall as well. I didn't know if it was something I had to parry over. Oh no, not this guy. I wish I could take him out right now. So this is where I might be actually be more useful to have a different power up. Cause I don't really know how well this truly works. Cause I don't know if he can be defeated or not. I'm pretty sure he can't be. Come on, come on, can we really get this done on the first try? 
Oh boy, there it is. Oh, 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 okay. No! I thought I landed on it, but I guess I didn't. Be vive, oh fum. I'm the guardian of this ruined land. All right, I got it. I got pretty far on our first try. I can't complain. Maybe that was just sort of like first try of the day luck. And I'm gonna lose every time now. I'm expecting it, yeah, I'm expecting something like that. I need to save as much health as I can. So I'm gonna restart that one. Get rid of this guy. The problem is that they will come back. And so will the things they throw. I don't like it. What? Oh, I didn't even see that. What's wrong with me? Oh my gosh, come on. Okay, doing a little bit better this time. I have two health instead of three, so let's try not to immediately lose it, even though this setup is clearly different. Um, I'm pretty sure it is. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it is all the same setup. Oh, dude, really? That stinks. Come on, come on. It feels a little different, but I guess this part is the same. There we go, I, that's the jump I messed up on last time. Okay, we're making it now. It's just because of the slanted parts of the platforms, it is a little hard to tell which part of it you can land on and which part you cannot. Oh man! We were even closer that time. Oh my gosh, it's so tough. But hey, once again for like a third try there, not too bad. I just, I just gotta keep going. Back down to one health. Come on now. Oh boy. It's the little fireballs that really mess me up. That's why I sort of need the auto aiming. I don't know if you can even get rid of the fireballs to, though. It looks like you can't. Like, I mean, I attacked him quite a lot there just with the auto aiming and it just didn't really get him. Oh, I thought I was gonna miss there. I'm so glad I didn't. I think staying on the high ground majoritorily is a better idea. I mean, obviously we died to that last time because we had to sort of fall down on the fire guy. Oh man, it's just like, you don't really get the time or the angle to really judge that distance. I remember having a problem with this level for that specific reason last time too, is that you just can't tell sometimes where you're gonna land because of how the platforms are visually angled. And that's just not fun. This time I have all three health. I don't know how I managed that, but I did. So let's hopefully not lose all three of it immediately. That would just be embarrassing. Okay, keep going. Big jump, not bad. This guy's just not very nice right now though. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, made that jump. Got the coin. Just gonna dash over there, didn't even jump. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm doing low ground here, but then we're going back on the high ground, so we're fine. At least they give you a variety of platforms here so you can sort of mend your strategy the way you want to. I cannot believe I landed that one. Come on, we gotta be close to the end. I think we are, right? Or maybe it just goes on forever. No, it doesn't. Okay, we're done. Yeah, we got him, and he falls. Awesome stuff, not a single point of HP loss there. I'm so excited about that one. Okay. So as you can see, we get a minute, maybe two minutes? Yeah, two minutes and 12 seconds. HP bonus, three out of three. Parry, three out of three. Gold coins, five out of five. That's gonna be an A plus. Awesome, awesome stuff. Or just an A? Oh, come on, really? <laughs> that had A plus written all over it. Oh, wow. Hmm. I, I'm a little bummed. I'm trying to get over it, but that was still pretty nice. You know, an A is an A. So at the end of the day, I'll take it. And as you can see, we get a little staircase that way so we can travel a little bit more easily. And what is this guy gonna say? Ah, that Wolfgang. Always oh, taking notes to express two notes worth of music. I'm taking 10 notes. He has no conception of what I mean by less is more. I know you agree with me. Go convince that 10-eared clock. You won't listen to me anymore. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind. Can I go in here? I guess not. Um, But I can go up this way into the junkyard where there should be our next boss fight, which is gonna be Dr. Cow's Robot in Junkyard Jive. I do like this guy. A lot of people say he's difficult. I never really found him that difficult, but maybe I'll, I'll get my butt kicked now and we'll, and we'll show how wrong I was. Who knows? But I think he's a really fun one. He's interesting for sure. It's another flying one. A lot of the f most fun bosses are flying ones. So he has actually three parts of his body you sort of wanna beat up depending on the situation, which one will be smarter. Um, and I sort of, I, apparently I got hit there. Um, I sort of have to remember which ones are worth getting rid of. I think the, the belly, yeah, that sort of stunk. Um, objective complete, target scrapped. I'm thinking that the belly is gonna be what we should focus on first. 
just because it can be a bit of a bad situation there. I can't really shoot through that little laser. Gotta keep that in mind. Actually, yeah, I think the belly, just because those guys, they sort of take up the screen in a really tough way. And then after that, maybe the laser, because this thing's definitely getting in the way, because I can't shoot through it like I can everything else. There we go. Now I can focus on this. I do have my, oh, but once you destroy it, something else starts. I forgot about that. Okay, parrying that for sure. Oh, it reminds me of the Iron Giant so much. I love it. Okay, come on, come on. Oh boy. Can we just get through that? I can't believe I dodged that. No, okay, I forgot they exploded. Oh, he has a little heart there. I don't know what we should focus on. I got hit, that's not good. Oh, ooh, yikes. You know what, I should probably just use some of these. Okay, so I can't really get through to his head anymore. I just gotta focus on the, the heart in the center. There we go, okay, I understand now. There we go, let's do one more. The magnet pulled me closer, oh, that was tough. We were so close to. So I don't know what happens if I just take out the center part first. Will that little heart pop up right away? I mean, it might be a bit of a risky idea, so I don't know if it's something I actually wanna focus on here. Ow. But I feel like I just need to experiment with it and see what happens. No, okay, it's just sort of an open gap until we get all the things done. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh, I'm getting hit by everything right now because I'm silly. There we go, go up this way and destroy this thing. See, that's probably not the way I want to do it because there's like not really any parries or anything. Like it just sort of gets messy. Even though I don't have to deal with all the nuts and bolts being shot out if I do it this order. There we go. Come on, at least not right away. I, I know I did that one awfully. But I was sort of just experimenting with different orders in which we could do it. I'm thinking it would be still smart to focus on this first. Just with the situation. That way we can earn up parries with the center one as well. Okay, just barely dodged that. Could've been bad. Okay, so yeah, the belly is taken out. I'm gonna get rid of this now. There we go. So I'm just gonna launch this there. That wasn't too bad. Get rid of this thing. Come on, keep working on it. It's almost out of here. Nice, oh, he's just, he gets so mad. He gets so angry. Got it, okay, and that makes it like a chain reaction too. Very interesting. There we go. I think that thing can still hurt me, so I gotta be careful. Um, but now I wanna use my fi final thing here. There we go, that was actually a pretty good idea, it seems. Ow, I couldn't even see him. The foreground was in the way. That's sort of unfair. That's doubly unfair. Come on. Oh no, oh no, dodging that. Come on, get this stuff out of here. Explode these bombs for now. This is sort of his mini phase that you can see on the progress bar. It's just sort of surviving this and, whoa, that got me too. Malfunction, malfunction. Yeah, this is sort of his like weird little mini phase. This is not easy. This one's, <laughs> I mean, I, <laughs> see I told you I'd end up eating my words. I don't know, I did it like in like one or two tries. I must've gotten lucky. And maybe it was like more than one or two tries. I can't remember, but I just, I was surprised with how fast I beat it. Which is usually saying something, you know? So I already took a, a hit point there, which is not what I wanted. There we go, we got rid of that one. I mean, I'm starting to, ow, get rid of this faster, but I'm still just plain awful. Okay, you know what, let's go into the bomb mode. Boom, get rid of that thing as much as I can. Maybe I should've focused it on the heart. Yeah, I'm just playing really not so good right now. Okay, got into the second phase with two HP, that's a new record. Oh my gosh, okay, so we just gotta dodge these things, but also beat them up as fast as possible. Definitely when they're coming in from the right, that's much more doable. There we go. I just gotta be careful of where he's gonna come into next, yeah. Got it. Nice. Come on, just a bit more, I'm sure. I mean, am I supposed to be attacking him right now? There's no way. No, I'm supposed to be attacking him right now. That's ridiculous. <laughs> uh, I think my best bet with that would be to, yeah, wait for that and then to, to miss, entirely just miss him. That's definitely what I wanted. I don't know if that's really gonna do very much. Ah, oh, there goes our other HP. Come on, come on. It's ridiculous, we all know it. Come on, man, he is not letting up right now. He just moves too fast. If he could just move ever so slightly slower, it'd be much more doable. Okay, okay, he's down. Oh gosh, I don't like this. I remember this being really tough and ridiculous. 
but at the same time, I don't know. Oh, I have the perfect equation to hinder your evasion. That's not good. <laughs> I'd rather him not, not hinder my evasion whatsoever. All right, well, I'm certainly not having as much fun with this guy as I remember having. He's just as stressful as I remember, though, that's for sure. How am I getting through this? Oh, man, sometimes the red sort of meshes in with the red background, like, that's not really fair. Ah, oh, man, I finally get back there and he barely get any farther. That is just super duper tough. Okay, two HP this time, we're getting a little bit better. Let me hit him with these as soon as I can, because I don't think I'm gonna be able to parry. Okay, now they're blue, they're not, they were, they were red last time. Okay, it definitely is throwing me off a little. But the, the blue ones seem to be easier to dodge. I tell you, sort of like a weird combination. Oh man, of Dr. Wily from Mega Man and Dr. Eggman from Sonic with his crystals and stuff, and him riding a robot and his crazy mustache, like just all these weird combos. This time I got three HP. Let's see how quickly I lose this one. Okay, come on, there we go. I can parry that, but then I'm in big trouble trying to get back over here. Um, if I could just get that one. Okay, I'm at full. Now getting over there, much more of a challenge, but I sorta of kinda of did it. There we go, it took a second for it to actually land for some reason, but now he does the red one. The red Chaos Emerald. And now we're in a big pot of trouble. There we go, there we go, there we go, come on. Oh, oh man, a lot closer this time for sure though. There it is, okay, that took way too long. Way too long, I don't know how I got so lucky with that the first time I've ever done it. But there we go, we did it. That was the worst thing I've ever experienced in my entire life. Especially since, since I kept on getting this really bad luck where the final killing blow was always hidden between, like behind some kind of foreground art. It's like, why would they do it that way? Why would you design it that one of the most like projectile intense portions of the game so far is also littered with just like little bits of foreground art in the junkyard. It's just like, that doesn't make any sense. Like that's just not even necessary whatsoever because there's no way you could have possibly known. I don't know, I don't like it. Anyways, as you can see, that does unlock a little garage I think we can walk through, which is cool. Is there anything up this way, though? I mean, anything of interest? Ooh, maybe there is. Uh, oh. Oh, I see. So I guess you could have sort of kind of skipped it if you wanted to. I mean, I guess you still have to get them all done. Sorry, I'm burping. Anyways, so Ludwig's been filling your mugs with his less is more drivel, eh? Keep talking to that fool and soon nothing will sound right to you. Okay, uh, don't say I didn't warn you. These guys are just born not to get along, aren't they? Anyways, we're doing okay so far. I've only gotten two done and I've been playing for an hour and I still got two more to do. So let's go ahead and do this one. This is the theater. Uh, Sally stage play in Dramatic Fanatic. Let's get going. And I don't know what the uh, one after this is. Whatever other one we're missing. I'll have to look around a little bit, but I remember this one not being so bad. So we'll try it. We'll see what ends up happening and Move on from there. Yeah, this one's like a cool little stage play. I really like this one. Like it tells a little story and everything. Like it starts at the wedding and I can definitely parry that. <laughs> and she sort of moves like a fighting game character for some reason, which is just sort of cool. <laughs> I just like the husband in the background like, oh no, my darling, what is gonna happen? The wedding's ruined. Ow, that was badly timed. Uh, come on, keep getting her. Definitely when she's bouncing her, ow, I didn't know that lands there. And where's time for my phone alarm to go off? Break a leg, nah, break two, yikes, that's rude. Almost done the first phase though. Okay, come on. So far so good actually, I don't know if I need the auto aim as much as I thought I did. All right, well, okay, well that was just me being negligent. Gotta be a bit more careful. I mean, there definitely are some spots where the auto aim can certainly be helpful. Just gotta pay attention for them, and I thought that was gonna actually curve. I don't know why I thought it would like, follow gravity in any way, but it does not. There we go. Come on. I probably shouldn't be doing that. Should oh, goodbye! So off they go. And now it's uh, here, they're at, they're at home, and there's babies. So I guess the idea is that they, they got married, they had a family. Stay away from the center stage or succumb to the power of a starlet rage. Oh no. Let's try that again. Okay. 
That wasn't too bad, actually. Okay, that's where I just gotta be careful. Ooh, close. Very close. Okay, let me actually parry that. I'm trying to earn up my super. Emphasis on trying, I don't know if I'll fail. We're doing pretty good this time, I think. There we go, the, the, the background elements have gone away, which I can only hope, yep, means that about to move on to the next phase. So this is where I think I gotta auto aim, because there's just so much going on in this next one. I mean, for this, because it's just sort of straight ahead. Once she starts jumping around like this, I gotta go into the auto aiming. Because the baby's throwing stuff, there's these little toy cars. It's a mess. And then they fall back down. Like, oh my gosh. You know what? Let's hit you with this. Oh, that must have did something. Right? I can only hope. Do they only seem to fall? Ow. Okay, that was our first bit of damage. <laughs> like how the, once again, the father's in the back are like, oh no! Oh my gosh, and she passes away. And now she's a little angel or something. I don't know. Okay, what do we do with this? Uh, oh, it's a star. Thank you. I don't know if that was worth my while or not. Big wave. Uh, I don't know how you would get by that. I guess you could duck maybe under it. Whoa. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I, oh, okay, I dodged one and then I ran into the other. And a meteor. It does tell you in the top left what's gonna happen. I guess that's what you saved the pink stars for, for getting over the big wave. Lightning again. I don't like the lightning. Who would? And there's more of it. <laughs> Zeus wasn't happy with that statement. He was like, here's some more. Oh, that was it, yay! Maybe. It looks like there's still more to this battle, though. Oh, the roses are falling, the umbrella's spinning. Oh my gosh. Come on. Oh boy, I can't parry that. I would love to, but I can't. All right, ready for this? You're in trouble. They're gonna be asking for an encore after that one. That actually wasn't too bad. You achievement unlocked porcelain something. Cool, we, we did it. Still dodging the umbrella. Oh my gosh. That one was much better. So in total was a minute and, oh two minutes and 16 seconds, one out of three HP. Only two out of three pairs if I could have gotten one of those roses, but hey, whatever. It's gonna be a B grade, I'll take that. that that's fine enough. And yeah, there we go, that was actually much easier. So we're looking for one last boss fight before we're wrapped up for today's episode. Whatever that might be, hopefully we can handle it. Oh no, I remember what it is. <laughs> We're in big trouble. Soul Contract, Sally Stage Play, very cool. We are in so much trouble. So much trouble. One of my least favorite bosses for sure, Phantom Express and Railroad Wrath. I mean, maybe it'll be a bit better this time, but I'm not expecting it. Aesthetically, one of my favorite bosses. But when it comes to, in terms of actually beating it, we're in big, big trouble. This thing is so difficult. So crazy tough. All right, here's this ghostly dude. And he's throwing eyeballs at us. Yeah, I don't know if we'll wanna change our stuff. I feel like, oh, and there's a brick of doom. More doom filled stuff. There we go, there we go, okay, hold on. Because they can drop that on these things. And I'll sort of mess this up. So I think at some point it might just be better for auto-aiming. Ow. I feel like we do use a different weapon here and it works a little bit better. I don't remember though. <laughs> we already have our super, which is great. Oh no, I remember this guy. He's not fun. There we go. Ow, I got hit by the pumpkin though. All right, you know what? Hit him with a little bit of that. Oh no, <laughs> they took it right out from under me. All aboard, next stop. Your funeral. Oh no. Let's try this again. It's this little ghost dude. I don't like so much. Like, I mean, he, his, his design's really fun. But actually defeating him, not so much. There we go. I'm gonna dodge some of that stuff. Please try to, and that's me failing at dodging stuff. Whoa, not really what I was looking for there, gotta be honest. Jeez Louise, it just never ends. Stop throwing those eyeballs, dude. It's just there's too much around. There we go, we got him though. Okay. 
Death the what? <laughs> I hit his chin. Oh man, that's weird. I feel like there's gonna be something better than this though, you know? At least for this section. Because this is awkward. It is so awkward to hit everything there. Ah, well that's not my answer. That's not what I'm looking for. I just feel like there was something I tried here. Or at least that I tried something and maybe I just ultimately went back to this. Like maybe if this would just be a little bit better. There we go, see that's how it's working. But will it stay that way is the thing. There we go, I can parry that, no problem. There we go, parry that one as well. Come on, come on. Keep getting these eyeballs. Okay. Okay. <laughs> They're getting close. Just keep getting him. I just can't actually land any damage on him because there's too many eyeballs. There's too many. Okay, okay. I'm dodging him somehow. Oh my gosh, that was close. Oh boy, I do not want to use my super against him. I just feel like we've gotten this far. My gosh, why can't I do this without taking damage? It's, it's just impossible. My gosh. And we're not even getting to the tough part. This is the easy part of the boss fight, believe it or not. It's ridiculous. Okay, come on, come on, come on. You ready for this? Now apparently I'm not. <sighs> Here we go again, it's the monster, the robot monster all over again. Come on, hit him with some of these. There we go, was that enough? I don't know if it was or not, I don't think it was. Okay, just keep hitting him with this stuff, and I know you're gonna be a jerk with that, but like, what can I do? What is the zebra to do? Okay, that sort of worked out though. Oh no, Uh. okay, that's fine, that's fine. Because it's so hard to dodge the pumpkins, but also not jump right into the guy's chin, which damages us for some reason, you know? Like, I feel like that part's bogus. Okay, what's going on now? Well, first off, that guy. Oh no. What are these things again? I sort of remember these guys being awful. Uh, and they are. They're definitely awful. Most certainly, surely awful. Uh, there we go. No. Help, help! <laughs> Come on, somebody help me! Oh no! Okay, you know what? Hitting both of you! No, I thought I had the full set! What happened? I thought I had the full set! I swear I made the sound effect! Sorry, this train is only for the dead, but we can help you with that. Oh man, we were almost done. If I actually did have the full super, I would have been fine. All right, I'm back with these two. Right here. I'm gonna hit this guy right away. And if it seems like he's about to do his lightning move, okay, he's not, but I'm gonna start hitting them with this, and I think it should still hurt both of them. That was actually excellent, though, because I've already gotten rid of his brother now. And that means I just have to sort of auto-aim. I mean, like, okay, I thought that was gonna land on the, the little turn, which luckily it didn't. Oh, no. Oh, oh, that almost hit it. So if I just stay over here and mind my business, I got rid of him. I have two HP, and I don't remember what's next. Oh, gosh, it's him. He's gonna go on his little train legs, isn't he? This is my least favorite portion of like basically the entire game because there's like a one millisecond window to actually hit him. You gotta parry that and hit this stuff and then there's fire falling everywhere. The auto aim definitely helps out. It definitely helps. Okay. Um, it's definitely a whole lot more doable with the auto aim. I feel like whenever I lasted this boss, I didn't use auto aim. And I made it, oh I got him, okay, there we go. Why was it so hard for me in the past to trip downtown? All right, well I went against one boss that was way easier for me the first time I ever did it, and I went against this boss, which was much tougher for me the first time I ever did it. All right, well that's a good balance, I suppose. Oh, right, uh, we, we got it, right, 204? I mean, we're not gonna get an A plus or nothing, but we can maybe get an A. Yeah, I get an A minus, I'll take an A minus. That's not too bad. <laughs> I would never, ever want to get an A plus in a level like that. So I think for real, we're now done world three. We are moving out of world three and into the final area, the finale of the game. I don't know if we're gonna be getting the entire finale done in today's episode. We'll have to see how things go as we enter the casino. I'm really not sure, I'm a bit worried, but we'll try our best and we'll see how things go. I'm just, I'm all kinds of nervous. So, because it, it's not just the final boss right off the bat, we do have something to do before that, and honestly, in my opinion, can be more difficult than the final boss. So, let's get to it, right over here. Let's go into the casino. King Dice in, all bets are off. Does this mean that technically King Dice also has a contract on him? 
Well, lucky here, you actually pulled it off, but you've made me lose a bet. And for that, you ain't seen the boss just yet. We're gonna have to play a little game first. Oh, great. So we gotta play a little game first, whatever that means. I guess we gotta fight King Dice. Oh boy, now King Dice is a little bit different than your average boss, and that makes him like 10 times as difficult. We'll see it in just a moment. Right now, he's way bigger than you'd think. But we need to go boom like this. And you can see we hit a three, which means we go against boss number three. Because that's the crazy thing. There's about like 12 different boss fights you can go against in the King Dice boss. Oh, the loading screen between them now is a little lengthy. It wasn't like this in the in the PC version. Oh my. Okay, so yeah, we'll deal with this as much as we can. Oh boy. That's it, that's it. I sort of remember, oh, this guy being a pain in the butt, but very doable. So that's what I'm just trying to survive against right now is everything he's gonna throw at us. Come on, come on. I need to get across. Because they're sort of like, they're not quite mini bosses, but they're definitely not like full on bosses with their difficulty. So they're sort of in somewhere in the middle. And this is where this gets tough and weird to dodge. There we go, we made it, we made it. He's gotta be taken out soon now, right? I don't know. Oh, there we go, we got him, cool. Let me just continue trying to dodge stuff though, just in case. Oh my gosh, and King Dice sort of stomped them out. So we gotta be very careful. I mean, my goal isn't to go against every boss, my goal is to survive. If we see every other boss along the way, that's cool. But if we pay attention to the dice board now, now that we know how this works, we can roll a one, two, or three. Um, Let's see what we get this time. So we can either get a safe, a four, or a five. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, there we go, we got a safe. So four, five, or six. We get five. That's fine, we get health up, oh cool. So we have four HP, oh that's really nice. I didn't even know that was a thing. I guess because it was a little hard over it. Gotta keep that in mind. Okay, so we have four HP going into this boss fight. Which one is this one gonna be? Oh, I remember this guy. This one's tough. Come on, come on, come on. But we do keep whatever amount of, whoa, that's weird. Um, We keep whatever, there we go, amount of cards we had before. I don't know if that was a mistake or not. Oh, it almost was. That was super cool. I'm liking this so far. I don't know how long it's gonna go on for. There we go, look at that. Cool. Okay. Just stand back up here again. Yeah, I'm gonna go over this way this time. Oh, we got him already, that was easy peasy. That was great. All right, so that guy's down. A little uh, rabbit in the hat. Okay, so what is going on after that? Come on, King Dice, what are, what are you gonna throw on us? What do, I think we need to roll a two to get another safe. Yes, so let's try to roll a two. All right. Uh, there it is. So now we need to roll a two again to get an extra HP, another two and then another two and we can get over. But you might be able to notice, second to last, there's a start over. That wouldn't be good. So let's just try to get, I mean, any number works here, but two would be the best. Uh, oh well, that's fine. We don't need the extra HP, it just would be beneficial. Okay, so battle number seven, technically? We're going against, I don't remember this lady. Huh, I do not remember this lady at all. But it looks like if I parry off of these little uh, chips, I guess they are, I can make platforms out of them. It's working pretty well, actually. Uh, oh, but they're going away now. Yeah, let's just work with this. Okay. I guess auto-aiming would be much better here just because that way I don't have to face her if I can't, which a lot of the time I cannot. So I could use my uh, special move here if I need to. I'm gonna try that in just a second. There we go, just go out with this. I think that we could just beat her this way though. I mean, so far we're doing really good. There it is, look at that. Okay, some of these are getting really easy. I don't know if we just got really lucky, but so far it's working out. Okay, wow, what's going on next? I got either a one or a two, that's my goal. That way I can either get an extra H, or one or a three, actually. Yeah, one or a three. 
So 30% or 60% chance to get what I want here. So it goes like one, three, two, one, three, two. Up! Oh, no! Oh, come on. It just moves so quick, it's hard for my brain to register it and actually time it. I don't know what it is. So what is this gonna be? We have four HP. Oh no, I do remember this one specifically being like the most difficult. Because, oh yeah, I remember how this works. It's like a little match em up game. Okay, ooh, watch it. Nice, we actually got a match there. So now our goal is to attack him. I don't know if that actually hit him or not. That's a concern. And he moves faster if you mess it up. It's over here. Yeah, there it is. Because I remember at some point I did this one and it got stuck. There was like a glitch and I couldn't move forward. I had to do the whole fight over. That was not fun. Okay, whoa. Ah, oh, okay, that's fine. Oh, almost got hit by that one. I'm not getting very lucky with the matches here. Okay, here we go, here we go. Way over here. We got it. We seem to like that. Keep beating him up. Hit him with one of those, just because why not? Okay, ooh, don't get hit. I'm trying to save as much of my HP as possible. What will this one be? That's the Mugman one, and the Mugman one was in the corner. Very cool, we got it. I don't know if we need to get all of them to defeat him, but I'm assuming that that's the case. Hard to find out exactly, oh no. My phone alarm's going off at the worst time. I guess it wasn't too bad of a time. Come on, come on, watch it. Just keep beating him up, that's good, that's good. What do we got there? And, ah, oh, not quite. All right, well now I know for a fact it'll be that. Excellent, so I know where the last two are. Oh, I missed him with that, that's just embarrassing. Come on, little monkey, they're going down. Oh boy, got it, and got it, there it is! Now we just gotta fight him, right? I think we just have to survive our fight. Oh no, yeah, I, I couldn't really see. There we go, we got him. Unfortunately, I wasted one of our moves there. Ah, oh, that's okay. We're back down to full health. Can't really complain about that. But the problem is we still have to be alive enough to fight King Dice, and I don't remember how his fight goes, so that's gonna be tough. So my hope now is I think either a one or, so one or three. If I get a two again, I have to do it all over. Ah, ha, 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 just my luck. Start it over, come on. Get a three, yeah, there it is. So now my goal is to get another three. Or a two. Why do I always get two when I really need to not get two? We're going against another boss. Oh, but I mean, if we keep defeating them over time, we'll eventually just defeat them all, so we would just have to survive. Don't know how well that's gonna turn out, though. Okay, we got a little domino piece. Let's definitely do the auto-aiming for this. Oh yeah, it's on the conveyor belt. I don't like that very much. Oh no. That's that's a like a 12-sided die. Or something, maybe that was actually maybe a 20-sided die. Oh, parry that, please and thank you. Definitely seems like auto-aiming for 99% of the time is gonna be my best bet. Just because I'm moving all over the place here, I sort of wanna focus on that. I don't know what's with the domino bird up there. I guess I just gotta dodge it. Okay, I'm fine. I'm just gonna keep layering on that damage and over time, I mean, we got the full set. There we go. Like I could, maybe, okay, now I don't need to. I was gonna say, I could use my special move. These mini bosses aren't as, oh, they're kicking each other, that's just rude. Um, these aren't as hard as I remember them being. So I don't know what's up with that. Maybe they made them easier or something. Cause I think they updated some of the bosses a little bit. Anyways, now with that done, let's just try not to land another stinking two. Okay, for a second, for just a moment, I thought I landed another two. Yeah, okay, that's how I wanted to land a two. Now it's a one or a three, so I'm probably gonna land a two again. That's a one, okay, a two or a three. So since I already got the reset, I can't reset myself again. I swear that's different. Anyways, we're in the health up, but we also have to fight a boss. We'll see how that goes. 
I honestly remember being able to just like get sent back to the beginning over and over again. Like maybe I'm wrong, but that's how I remember it. Oh no, I don't remember this one either. It's creepy though. You know, I sort of remember it. Oh my. It seems very ridiculous, but it's, it's like, you know, a pool ball. And like some of the Q sharpeners, or whatever these things are supposed to do. Well, there goes my extra health. I want to keep this out, my, uh, my super for right now, if I can. I don't know why I'm relying as much as I am on, uh, whoa. I mean, I guess because the angling is just sort of weird. There we go. There we go, there we go, got it. I mean, so far this guy really isn't that bad. We're sort of jumping between our shots for now. There we go, we got him! Look at that! That's weird. But hey, we did it, we're back to full health, we have three HP, it's something. Whew. Okay, so with all that being done, we are good just to hopefully take on King Dice. I don't think there's anything else that could stop us. Yep, that's right. So, I can hit anything now. I'm not very worried about it. Got a one. Okay. Will it always be an immediate one the second he claps? It will, that's an interesting strategy, actually. Ready? It'll always instantly be a one, so if you ever just need a one, just make sure you hit it immediately. So you could have had a total of like five or six HP. Oh, oh my, oh my. I don't know what I'm doing right now. I gotta be honest, I gotta do the auto aiming for as long as possible. And then you know what? I need to do that and hit him with one of these. Okay, that worked out pretty well. Keep hitting him. Okay, just gotta be ready. Okay, I, I made that work. That was a bit surprising. Come on, back to it. Oh, oh, uh, hey, 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 look at that. Hit him again. I gotta be careful here, but, oh my gosh, we beat him? Wait, wait, really, that was it? I swear there used to be more. I swear they used to, that. Uh, last time I did this, it took me two hours. What happened? <laughs> did I like accidentally choose easy mode or something? Yeah, I'll, we'll find out. Because there's a star rating. No, okay. I am not kidding you. The first time I ever did that, it took me like two hours. That took me like 15 minutes. I mean, don't get me wrong, I am so happy right now. Especially with Hell on the Robot Boss in the last episode. But man, what, what was different? <laughs> I don't know. Well, I'm very glad to have gotten that done. And now we can move on to the next level, the final level, taking on the big bad guy himself, the devil. Ah, uh, this is gonna be interesting. Okay. Let's see how we can handle this. So this is where I get worried. Well, 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 look how far you've come. Not only did you bust, bust up my good-for-nothing lackey, King Dice, but I see you've got my soul contracts as agreed. Head him over and join my team. Never. Welcome, or well, welching on me just like all the others, eh? I'll teach you for backing out of a deal. Have at you. All right, we're fighting him, just like that. But man, I just, I remember this guy being surprisingly easy for a final boss compared to all the other bosses in the game. So watch him take like two hours now. Because everything I thought was gonna be easy was tough and everything I thought was gonna be tough was pretty easy. I don't trust nothing no more. My instincts are upside down. We're just gonna have to beat him up and hope for the best. Whenever it loads. But man, this, this is gonna be intense. Let's save Inkwell. I'll, whenever it loads. <laughs> Takes a while, I mean, it is a pretty big boss, so. There we go. Okay, so let's get at him. Right now, I'm gonna just do this. Ow, okay. Yeah, I gotta relearn most of his phases, to be honest with you, because most of them right now are a bit of a mystery to me, okay. He does that, he does a little clap. Uh, and now he's doing this. Okay, good to know, and I'm dead. <laughs> That's fine, I defeat this out. You broke our deal, now it's my turn to break you. That's not good. 
Okay, let's get back at it. Oh, ow, I keep forgetting he's gonna do that. For whatever reason. It's pretty easy just to you know, do something about it. Okay, ow, I got, I dodged it. But then I, I got hit still, because I'm silly. Okay, so for this one, I sort of, oh, he came, he came in from the other way. Ah, oh, man. That's fine, that's fine, we can handle this. I just need to pay attention to when he does, okay, that's new. That's a whole new move. Ow, and he just sort of slams down. Okay, this is where I need to do this. I mean, I just can't land very many shots on him when he does that. Okay, beat him up, beat him up. Ah, oh, I tried to just time it to the last moment. I didn't time it very well. You just gotta pay attention to all of his facial expressions. That's different. That wasn't the spinny one he normally does. Okay, so so far I've died to him quite a few times. Let's get back over and get to him. Ooh, not bad, not bad. Okay, so this is where we gotta just be careful and try to hit him wherever we have the chance to, but realize that it's more important that we dodge. There we go, there we go. That wasn't too bad either. I think we're doing pretty good. Oh, this is new as well. Okay, they are bouncing all over the place. Okay, I parried that. Come on, oh, watch it. There it is. Okay, which way? He's coming in this way now. Oh man, that's so hard to dodge properly. Almost have her full super. There it is. Oh, that, that almost hit me. Oh, oh, I think he's moving to the next phase. Here he goes. I gotta come too, but the fire will close in on us. All right, down below we go. He's got a big face. Oh no. Oh, okay, that hurts. So things are spinning around like crazy. Let's go ahead and hit him with everything we got. I don't know if that was a good idea or not. Whoa, that explodes. Good to know. I don't want to oppose me gets destroyed. We didn't do too bad there. We got through it decently. Let's try this again. Ready? Get at him. Whoop. Oh, I got hit by it. Okay, I need to make sure. I'm pretty sure I can get through this first phase without getting hit a single time if I can just get a little bit better. And I want that to be the case, so. Move it. Okay. I can get a few shots on him there, but not much. There we go. Nice. Okay, didn't get hit. That's good. So it takes like two or three blue shots to get rid of that guy. Watch it! See, this one is the one I'm the most familiar with. And it's also like the easiest one to dodge. I say that, so please don't get hit. Oh, come on, that time I was sort of juggling. Oh boy, he's doing it. This I always get hit by, though. Because it's so weird, I'm like standing there and it's like, ah, I just keep moving to the side. Going under, I'm like, that doesn't work. Ah, oh, that was awful. All right, I got two HP. Hopefully that'll be enough. Yeah, my full thing. I think the last time I hopped down here I was only at one, right? Maybe like, what was that, two? But I feel like I made a silly mistake getting hit the first time. So I'll do what I can. Yeah, it was this thing spinning around, and it was the bomb, which I just didn't really get, but I guess you just have to smack at it before it, uh... Oh boy. Before it explodes, you have to parry it. So like that. Gotcha. Okay, come on, keep getting him. We gotta attack his eyes, I think. It's sort of hard to tell. Like, there's a lot of visual information going on here. Ow, he's about to sneeze. And that makes me want to sneeze. Oh boy, Oh. Okay, I could have parried that, but I did not. That was like three different things to dodge. Anyone who opposed me will be destroyed. We got to his next phase, but didn't get too far into it. Yikes. I'm immediately gonna hit him with one of these. Cause I just, that's how I feel about it right now. You know? That was just, you know, getting some anger out. I mean, also it would probably be important for getting his health down, but you know, that's secondary. Okay, come on. I have been having a hard time with him, but still, like, I, like this is, you know, I feel like average amounts of difficulty for a boss so far. Maybe I'm just being hard on the guy. Maybe that's the problem. 
And he's, you know, under a lot of pressure. But you know what? He's not very nice, so I, I can't sympathize with him too much. And I, I'm dead again. <laughs> Yikes, we got to the next phase, but it's, it's harder to get beyond that. All right, hit him with the, with, with the milk. There we go. Come on, I know I can do it this time. I've learned enough, I've seen enough, hopefully. Okay, whoa, that was actually pretty close. Let's do the auto-aiming, and then focus on parrying that. That seemed to work out pretty well, actually. I'm gonna get back on this platform for now. The spinning axe is one of the tougher parts, just because it feels like such a variable. Okay, oh, no damage taken yet, either. I was hoping we could parry one more bomb, but if that's not what I can do, then that's not what I can do. Man, oh man. See, this is where things get scary tough, though. Okay, I survived that somehow. I am very surprised with myself at the moment. Okay, we got it. Hit him with another one. Oh boy. How's that feel? Is he gonna cry? It looks like he's about to cry. Uh, okay, uh, okay. I'm fine, I'm fine. I took some damage, but we're all right, we're all right. Still in one piece, for now. Okay, parry that thing. Keep it going. Oh my. Oh, oh he's crying. Here comes the waterworks. I don't know what we're supposed to be hitting. Uh, oh, we're still trying to hit his eyes. Ow, ow, that hurt. Ooh, that's tough. But man, were we close? If I could have just kept hitting him with our special, we would have been fine. Yikes. Now I know what to do, though. Come on. I don't really have much health after this, so we really gotta make this work. And I don't know how it's gonna work. Oh my. Um, because the tears hurt, and I just fell off the edge because I didn't know what to do. <laughs> oh no. Oh. <laughs> Why did I let that happen? There was nothing there, there were no obstacles. I just sort of let that 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 happen, the way it did. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There it is, okay. There we go, oh boy, here we go, come on, we can do it, we can do it, we can do it. Just go ahead and go auto-aiming. And then dodge the stuff I have the chance. And then, ow, ow, ow. It's okay, it's okay, ready? Hit him with the milk! Let this actually land, there it is, it's a knockout! Oh my gosh, we did it! <laughs> oh, that was tough. That was not easy. So as you can see, we got a minute, and maybe two minutes, yeah, two minutes and 36 seconds, one out of three HP, three out of three parry, six out of six super meter, and a full skill level. So an A minus, I'll take that on the final boss of the game. Very, very cool. Man, was that not easy. I feel like the reason why I thought it was easy the first time I did it was because it was right off the back of defeating King Dice, which took me two hours, so this seemed, in turn, much easier. But this time, you know, it took me another like 40 minutes, so I was like, oh my gosh, it'll take it forever. Okay, well, we got it done. And what's gonna happen now? Is everything gonna go back to being peaceful? I think so. The brothers had triumphed over the demon, forcing him to finally give up. We shall accept your surrender, devil. Cuphead laughed, but we're not done just yet. And with that, Cuphead and Mugman destroyed all of the soul contracts, releasing Inkwell Isles Red in Resonance from internal servitude. Gosh, I can't wait to tell everybody, Cuphead said. The boys set off for home and at top speed. Come on, last one there's a leaky cup, Mugman teased as they ran. Once home, the brothers gathered everyone together. You're all free from the devil's debt, Cuphead announced, and that fiend won't bother us again, Mugman added. The elder kettle was literally brimming with pride as everyone began to cheer. Let's hear it for Cuphead and Mugman! Hip hip hurrah! Hip hip hurrah! So everybody's celebrating us even though they were trying to destroy us the entire game. As an all-day celebration began, the brothers promised to never wander into trouble again. And they didn't, until next time, of course, but that is another story. <laughs> well, hopefully we get to hear all about that story one day, but for right now, the end. Very cool, we've completed Cuphead. It took a lot of trials and tribulations, but we finally reached the end. So off we go onto a brand new adventure on a whole new island. <laughs> Cuphead and Mugman in the delicious last course, or DLC for short. I love how they did that. 
The sun's smiling down on us. There's no way anything could go wrong with this, right? What could Legendary Chalice be looking for all the way out here? Gosh, Cuphead, I don't know. I hope she's okay. We sure are far from home. Whoa! Jumping jelly beans, you boys made it. I have the most amazing news. And it all has to do with this here cookie. Take a bite and see for yourself. A cookie? Don't mind if we do. Whoa! It worked, it really worked, I'm alive again. But now I'm a ghost. Wait, what about Mugman? What's going on here? Everything's gone topsy-turvy. Follow me, boys, I can explain everything. For ages, I've been trying to find a way to escape the astral plane, but nothing worked. Until now, boys, let me introduce you to... Chef Saltbaker, the greatest chef in all the lands. Hi, chef. Welcome, friends, welcome to my bakery. Ah, Mrs. Chalice, I see you've, you see my cookie has worked wonders on you. Oh, my stars. Uh-oh, maybe only for a limited time? I'm a ghost again. Oh my, a finicky thing, that cookie. The taste is sweet, but the effect is brief. Fret not, though, my concerned little cups. I've come up with an amazing new recipe. One bite of this wonder tart, and you'll have complete control over the astral plane. That, this wonder tart could bring Chalice back to life for good? No swapping places or nothing? Indeed, just one problem. The recipe requires exceptional ingredients held by the most fearsome of foes. Well, if the Wonder Tart is what it takes to bring Chalice back to life, then by golly, we'll find those ingredients. All right, so off we go. Gonna find the ingredients for the Wonder Tart. Sounds tasty. Okay, so we start off here. Stay on your guard, intrepid cups. Fetching those ingredients will be a test of wit and wills. But remember, like any good bake, heart and soul is the secret ingredient. All right, sure. Worry not, I'll keep perfecting this recipe while you're out and about. I just know you'll put yourself fully into bringing the wonder, wonder tart to life. The fabled ingredients await, friends. Hmm, now where did I put the salt? Aren't, aren't you the salt? Anyways, I have not played in years now, so I might be a little rusty as we go into some things, but hopefully we'll pick it up along the way. But of course, Cuphead is a very difficult game on its own. I can't imagine the DLC would have gotten all that much easier. One more thing, chaps. Remember to equip that nifty cookie charm in the menu if you want to battle as Miss Chalice. Well, I definitely want to do that, so I guess we have to go instead of the smoke bomb. Place Miss Chalice, gain access to her double jump, dash parry, and invincible roll. Oh, that sounds great. So now that I've done that, do I just get to play as her? I'll keep it the super. Yeah, the super art one. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's all good for now, for now. Uh, but yeah, let's take a look around and see if I can remember how to play. It looks like somebody wants our attention over here. Hello. x tree, x tree. Chef Salt Baker awarded the best baker in all the lands. Oi, you're one of them cubs, ain't ya? This aisle's tough, but if you sent that in packing, you got two cases to spare. Here, pals, take out a little moolah for doing the world a favor. We received three gold coins, awesome. Okay, so he's not gonna say anything more. But let's see what this is. Recipe from Miss Chalice. So do I have to do anything in this level? Maybe this is more of a tutorial. Guess we're about to find out. Ready to hop into some more Cuphead action. It's been so long. Oh, here we go. So yeah, she has a little bit different things. ZR is Perry Dash. Uh, for flavor, just a dash will do. Oh, I like it. And of course, she has the double jump, so that's way more helpful. And then down, and that is dodge roll. Wow, okay. Gotcha. So she can't hit it like that. She has to dodge into it, I guess? Did I, am I doing something wrong there? Hmm. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing anything more. I guess I could just exit. Sure. Let me try one more time, what if I... Oh, I see, there you go. And then, got it. And then it's gonna cycle through again. Okay, I think I understand. Let's keep it moving. 
So yeah, I definitely like Miss Chalice a lot. I think we'll be mostly focused on playing through the DLC as her, just because she's a new character, and experience her to the fullest extent. Cuphead and Mugman play the same. They're just, you know, player one and player two, like Mario and Luigi. But what can we do around here then? If that's sort of the DLC, or the, the, the not the DLC, but the tutorial. Is there anything extra we can do here? I'm sure this is where we can go back to the main island. Uh, stay here. That's very useful. So there's not really anything over this way. Good to know. I did see something down here. Whoa, what is this? The King's Leap. Oh boy. So here we go, our first proper level or battle or whatever it might be, because some levels are just boss battles. And I'm sure I'm gonna get my butt kicked. I'll try my best though to get through all these. Whoa, here we go. It's the king. Oh, I love this background already. It's sort of, looks like it's made out of clay. Very cool. Am I supposed to be doing anything here? How do I change to, I don't know. Uh, I can exit? Oh, I thought I was supposed to be fighting him. <laughs> Am I not supposed to be fighting him? I'm so confused. Maybe I just have to talk to him. <laughs> I'm here to just choosing violence, but maybe I could have just, you know, had a conversation. Uh, maybe I'll go back. Okay, yeah, I can just talk to him. I'm so silly. Holy cups, I bid thee welcome to my floating palace. I am the one true king, the king of games. But before I have seen you battle with zeal and aplomb. And lo, I grant thee a place in my royal tourney. In these bouts, your weapons and charms shan't be of use. You'll have to find different means to best my champions. From victories, riches, now into the fray with, with haste. Okay, I don't know if this is what we should be doing right now, if we should maybe try some easier things, but hey, it's here. Might as well give it a try. Because I don't really know if this is the first area. If it's not, it seems like, you know, a pretty easy way to access. Whoa, okay, here we go. Now we're playing as Miss Chalice. Oh gosh, wait, how do I fire? Wait, can she not attack? I don't know. Um, whoa, whoa, okay, that wasn't good. I lost some HP. Yeah, I'm pressing all the buttons, I can't really. Oh wait, no, I'm not sure. <laughs> okay, I died. <laughs> Let's retry, apparently I was close to the end already. I'm a little confused if I can't attack right now or if that's something Miss Chalice can't even do. Don't worry, we'll, we'll figure it out. Right now, I just gotta, ow, get through all these guys without taking too much damage. Got it. Oh, man. Gotcha. Whoa, okay, not good. I need to make sure I dive through those. But it says I'm getting pretty close to the goal pole already, so if I just dodge past those. Gotcha. The first few are really easy. Oh, got you. Just waiting for the last, oh no, couple. Trying to look up there while looking down here is maybe not the best idea, gotcha. Come on, just one more. Uh. Oh, here he comes, here he comes. I got him, so there we go, that worked. Not bad, not bad. So there's our first goal done. I took some damage, but it's fine. So is there going to be a second wave now, as far as I understand, or maybe I just had to talk to the king again? Yeah, here we are again. Oh, thy reward of wealth untold. Oh, we get a coin. Two of them, actually. Furthermore, I permit the special entry to the next match. Okay, so let's go for another one. Whoa, that's so interesting. I love how that looks. So here's round number two, and if we're not quite able to complete this one right now, that's fine, we can always come back later. So we couldn't attack on that one. Maybe we should try this one though and see if maybe it's a little bit better. This match will get to, to fight. Because it seems like an actual fight, but once again, no, that didn't work. Okay, that worked a little, but then I landed on him. I think that's just sort of the thing with Miss Chalice, is that that doesn't work. Oh, come on. <laughs> retry, retry. A W for me and an L for you. <laughs> Rude. Good. Okay. But yeah, no buttons I'm pressing allow her to attack. Oof. Okay, geez, that is, if I'm not, I don't know if I'm just not jumping in the right spot. Hmm. 
but it's a much different gameplay style than I'm used to. I sort of do wanna exit to the map really quickly and see, is this something just with her? Or maybe there's a way I can change it so that she can still attack? Cause I would, I would prefer that for sure. Okay, so I'm a little confused because I did take a look and I couldn't see anything, any reason why Miss Chouse wouldn't be able to attack, but now the ladder will come down. So this is super bizarre to me. Maybe it'll come back later, but at least we got one thing. Moonshine Mob and Bootlegger Boogie. All right, so let's see. Now we can attack. So yeah, it was definitely something with that. Whoa, okay, hold on, ah, not good. So we got all these bugs. I gotta make sure we use a double jump. Avoid those guys as much as we can. Whoa, okay, so I can dash through you, which is certainly something I'm gonna miss, is being able to dash through. That was such a useful move. But the double jump and everything else is certainly gonna be useful too. I got that, which of course that'll be used for our specials, which I can't remember the buttons for the specials at the moment, but it'll come around. Oh, but I died. That's okay, I, it's, it's surely going to happen a couple of times. Let's go for it, let's wallop. And then I can press which button to change? Oh yeah, okay, I see. Remember this does less damage, but it does auto aiming, so if I do wanna sort of be in a situation where I don't have to worry about it as much, no! Oh, I dodged in the wrong direction. Definitely not as what I wanted as much. But the big bug is I think who we're focusing on here at the moment. Alrighty, boom, got it. Remember that parrying through things will give me extra power so I can do more super moves. Okay, let's switch to the green one. If I'm not able to focus on them, it's just good to do the green one because that'll just auto aim. Even if it does less damage, it's still better than nothing. Okay. Some of those bombs are popping off. Whoa, gotcha. Ah, wait, wait, ah, couldn't quite get it. That's okay. Ah! Sort of lost where Miss Chalice was on the screen there. Ah! <laughs> That's okay that we made it farther. One, two, punch, and you and the cops are eating dirt. Bingo, bingo. Okay, we almost got the first phase done. So if we try that again, as long as we make it a little bit farther each try, I'm happy, right? That's a surefire progress. Oh, look at that. I'm able to keep up with them pretty well there. Got that parry. And I can hop back down. Just being aware of all the different elements is a challenge, but one we'll get more used to as we're playing. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, oh, there was a lock one on there. I think this is where I'm going to yeah, use some of the green. And then if I could parry through that, that's excellent. Back right down this way. Okay, so he's fallen. I don't know what's going on now. I guess I could have parried through those guys. I have enough to use a special, but I'm sort of scared because I forgot what button it is. What is with this stuff? Does this hurt? I guess when it's yellow or maybe something? Okay, yeah, avoid that, avoid that. Uh, that is really disorienting. Here comes our special and it's totally gonna miss. But now I know what it's like, so that's good. Um, the music is great, <laughs> but that's not so great. This dance is over, there's no excuse. You couldn't handle the giggle juice. All right then, so let's try again. But hey, we know how the special works now. I know a button to press and I, I sort of, I got a little bit farther. That's always nice. Oh boy. Let's fire at you up there. Okay, he's calling in for backup. I'll jump over, oh okay, jumping over that wasn't the best idea. Oh, wait. Got it, that was nice. Whoa, yikes. So I'm losing more ow, health than I, I'd prefer for this one. Oh man, they are everywhere. Ah, why'd I do that, <laughs> whoops. Okay, so I got him, we haven't taken any damage yet. I'm trying to keep it that way. All of his bad guys are coming in. And then, right about here, here we go, that's gonna land a ton of damage. Oh no, oof. I wonder if I can actually dodge through that. I'm not really quite sure at the moment. Ah, that aiming was not the best. For that angle, I guess. No, I can't go through it. Good to know, good to know. Learning every th something new every time. Okay, back over. 
When it starts to turn yellow, that's when we need to prepare. And that's when we should change it to green. So it starts doing the auto aiming. And we got her! That's great, that's really, really good. Okay, she, whoa, we got the big guy! <laughs> and the little guy. Okay, so, ow, I guess we're going for the one under the, the cap. One thing this nose knows is, use cap's gonna be pushing up roses. I love how everybody has so much character. So I got it, I just gotta get right back out there and try again. Okay, so let's see if I can maybe survive for just a little bit longer this time. Not asking, you know, for a ton. Oh, I wonder if I could parry the tongue. Whoa. Oh my. No, I, I, okay, that was not the answer. So he sticks his tongue out, he's an ant eater, I see. Weird he's teaming up with bugs, you know? They usually eat the bugs. <laughs> let's try it again. I guess he's teaming up with the snail though. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> okay, I got here with three HP instead of one, which is, you know, big upgrade. But when it comes to everything else going on around here, do I hit this? I guess not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Rest of the bugs bouncing around. Uh, he's trying to get me right now. And I don't know, okay, uh, what I do about it exactly. Oh man, that is a big wreck. Maybe I could just parry his tongue? Okay, I'm, I'm doing damage to the tongue slightly. As far as I can tell. Yeah, definitely doing damage to the, the tongue or the snout. Uh, uh, sticking that tongue out everywhere. I'm trying to send it back. Ah, oh, This one's tricky. I'm definitely getting farther though. As you can see, we're halfway through. So if I could just survive there and just use my super, that might've made a huge difference. We'll have to see. But this, they they started this throwing some punches. This is not an easy boss to start the DLC with, that's for sure. Ugh. Okay, we're getting pretty close to stuff, I think, at this point. Whenever he sticks his tongue out, I'm trying to focus on that. But in the meantime, try to stay toward the center. And if his tongue gets close to, to me, I just gotta jump out of the way. Come on, come on, ah! Okay, okay, whoa. There it is, there it is, we got him! The knockout! <laughs> All right, that took me quite, what? Wait, no! <laughs> Surprise, forgetting about the boss ain't wise. Oh no! They fooled me! All right, back to the beginning, but now I know, now I know. <laughs> and this game does not play around. Okay, I'm ready for him this time. I have two HP instead of one. Ugh. See, I can dodge that, and maybe I should just, ooh. Okay, so occasionally, never mind, I got him, I got him. Alive and kicking, there we go. It took so many tries. I don't even want to think about how many tries that took. But there we go. The first boss of the DLC is completed. And the results! We did it in uh, an okay amount of time. The HP bonus, 2 out of 3. Parry, 2 out of 3. Super Mini, 5 out of 6. It was okay! Um, I'll take it. That's a B plus. A brand new record. All right then, so there's our first boss defeated as Miss Chalice as well. Lots of cool new things to experience there. So I'm glad we could get that out of the way. And let's see what's next. All right, <laughs> yeah, it sings Miss Chalice instead of Kevin. You got the distillery dough, awesome. And what's going on over this way? The ladder still doesn't come back down for me, but maybe there's, oh, here it is. So we'll try that in a little bit. For right now, there's a couple more things to do. Boo, did I scare you? Nothing in, in I love more than a good ghost story around the campfire. I'd heard word of a ghostly gal roughing up no good varmints around here. I reckon I'd keep track of her exploits myself. I'd sure love to tell the tale the villainous veggies vanquished. All right, so we'll definitely try to help out with that. Uh, so what about this one over here? Esther Winchester in High Noon Hoopla. Let's go for it. So we'll do regular difficulty and hope for the best. Oh man. So far, very challenging. Very, very challenging. Ooh, so it's a flying mission. Oh, this child looks so cute, the little airplane. This is great. Okay, so we'll do what we can about this. Um, oh wait, the tiny airplane. Yeah, I'm trying to remember how to exactly do all this. But we have our super. That was actually very hard to spot. <laughs> this cow is just popping out of the saloon. Oh my goodness. That This moves really fast. Uh, 
you stay over there. I guess it's oil that's firing at us? Man, there is so much visually happening there. That took quite the fall, I suppose. It's the last call. Let's try that one again. Hmm. Yeah, I'll stay here for now and then, oh man. You gotta pay attention to all the fireworks popping up from the ground. As well as everything else. Got it. Because that person throws, oh, they're dynamite getting launched off. And then maybe we could launch some of those over, but that didn't really do. Oh, wait, how did I change? Oh, I see, I see. Whoa, interesting. Okay, okay. Trying to watch out for all the, there's so much stuff moving towards me. Wow, wow. <laughs> I, I love her, her cowboy boots. Those are great. Oh no, ooh. I missed my parry, but we did get farther that time. I prepared y'all a tomb right inside my vacuum. <laughs> we almost got to uh, tier three there, so one more time. Come on, we got this. I love seeing the, all of the, the mountains in the background pass by, so very visually pretty. Oh man, it's hard to dodge that and look at that. That's just a lot to manage. I wonder if I should try to focus on getting rid of the bird that's dropping the dynamite? Is that something I can maybe do? I don't know. It doesn't seem like it. Yeah, I'm trying to stop it, but. Oh boy. Ouch. Whoa, the safes are falling down. There we go. I got the. Come on, come on. Ready? The missile. Boom! That was good. That was good. Oh, I can turn small here, remember? That may maybe is something that can help a little. Safe's falling back down. Things flying at every single possible angle, but I got one of them. Ouch. That's <laughs> a hot dog? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, got it good, got it good. Ready? Oh no. This is gonna be tough. I can do it though. Did that count? Did that land? I have no clue. I sure hope so. Ooh. Got it, got it. So at least we're getting some good parries so far. <laughs> now you're in a hot dog tin. Oh, I can sort of go between them. Okay, I'm not getting that pepper. Oh, I had another, I didn't even realize. A gal can enjoy a moment, moment's peace without you meddling. So that was actually not too bad though. We made it pretty far that time. I think we could do it again. So let's give it a try. Okay, I'm going into the fourth round now, but this time with a bunch of health. So I'm hoping I can make that work, especially if we keep getting those. Got two pink ones there. So I just need, oh no, one more. Come on, got it, got it. And then, boom, that should really, really help. And we got gotcha. you. all right, knockout. So I did lose two HP all on the way there, but it's okay. We made our way through. That was really challenging. And as you can see, we get ourselves a minute 39, HP bonus two out of three. So overall, we almost got a perfect A plus. We're gonna get an A, brand new record. I'm really happy with that. I can definitely take that for sure. So we had one flying mission, one normal boss fight. That's pretty good overall, right? So what is next for us? I'm sure some other stuff is going to open up. So I might just wanna leave it for there for now though. Cause as you can see, other areas are opening up. You got the desert limes, cool. I wonder if she'll say anything different. I tried to tell the tale of the villainous veggies vanquished. I guess not. I am a little curious, what was up here then? I'm guessing yeah, different missions. Maybe I was supposed to do some of these first. I don't really know. Uh, but we'll take a look at the shop, the Pork Rinds Emporium, before we finish up today's episode. So yeah, Borg grinds back with the crack shot, the heart ring, the converge, the broken relic, and the twist up. So let's just start here, but this one was the cheapest. I know, a simple bauble of unknown origin. So that might be for something later, but for another crack shot, experience, or EXP turret, straight shot with good damage, breaks into weaker aimed projectiles. And then I can do the heart ring, parry for HP, gain one HP on your first, third, and sixth parry. Wow, okay. 
And then we get another one, another twin heart, but that's about all I can afford it for now. We'll go ahead and get the broken relic. What stone? Okay, so I have to afford some of these other ones later on, but it looks like there's going to be plenty of other levels to play in this DLC. And I missed a bunch of stuff over here, so let's go and check it out now. Uh, an audience at last. The climbing contest cer medal ceremony is about to begin. I'm the winner and all is right in the world. Second place, the only thing left to do is to get better for next year. All I can do is throw up my hands up, le left to swallow in third place, aw. So I guess they were having some kind of mining competition. And right over here, we have a level, Glumstone the Giant in Gnome Way Out. Let's get started. I think this was supposed to be the first level, so sorry about that if I did things out of order, but hey, at least you're gonna get done now. So we'll see if this is actually easier or dif more difficult than the other level since I missed this one. Cause I was saying how like, wow, this is surprisingly difficult for the first level, but I guess that wasn't the first one. I was just being silly as per usual. Uh, but let's go for it and hope for the best. Oh man. Okay, so we're literally the size of a mountain. And I'm sure as per usual, we'll be getting our butts kicked at first, but, oh, ah, I messed it up. Gotta remember, we have a double jump. There's enemies everywhere though. Wow, there really are enemies everywhere. What do I do about this? Okay, you're gone, that's good. Oh, there's another one. Gotcha, so I can already forget how this works. <laughs> Whoops, okay, that's not quite what I wanted. Good jumping so far though. Oh man, oh there goes his beard. <laughs> he wasn't so happy about that one. Okay, we got a puppet show going on, ow. Oh my. Uh, whoa. Oh, they got me, but hey, that was actually pretty far for the first try. Ah, such a delightful treat, I had a hand in your defeat. All right, then I'm a little curious to see what the the message is when we die in the first wave, but maybe we won't have to worry about it too much. Okay, well, I missed that one. Oh, come on. Those are tricky to get. I feel like I did get a little bit lucky on some things that first try. The geese crossing, whoa, did we see that before? I don't think we did. Okay, I got that though. Oh, I'm making a lot of mistakes. Come on, come on. There goes the beard, so we were still able to get to the second second part. And you know what, let's go for it. Let's do a super against one of these puppets. And then now might be a good time to focus on dodging more than anything, just have the auto aim do its thing. Ah, they, they still got me. That was a little farther along now, so, so we're doing pretty good. We're, we're getting started not too badly here. Let's go again. Oh, yeah, sometimes that one can be at a tough angle. It's sort of just random where they end up showing up, so. Got it. Oh, the spikes. Come on, the bear again, which we didn't get on my second try. Ugh, I, I got sort of wedged in between both of them, which didn't turn out so well. Oh, he's not happy. Okay, no more beard. Oh, the one on the left, oh, I see. The one on the left is the, is the, the dice guy, King Dice, and the one on the right is the devil. Okay, interesting. I didn't do so well there. <laughs> okay, one more time. Let's not get distracted. Okay, doing my best just to focus for the time being. I guess uh, that's not turning out so well. Let me use a super against one of the puppets. And I have to remember, I also have that move right there. And that might help me out a little bit in certain situations like that. Oh, okay, got rid of my one parry option. Okay, so yes, yeah, so doing the dodge roll can really be a big lifesaver. I might just wanna do it preemptively, but we got them. Not bad, not bad. So we're heading into the second phase now, right, or the third phase, where I don't know where anything's happening. We're going into his tummy. Uh-oh. Talk about indigestion. <laughs> Gross. Give up now is my suggestion. At least you give me indigestion. Is what I did. I just made that joke. That is... Really weird and scary though. I don't know if I like that so much. Okay, actually I ended up dying in the first phase. Let's see what he says. You thought you were bold, but I am bolder. <laughs> I get it, because he's a mountain. All right then, so let's get back to that third phase. Come on, we can do it this time. 
Okay, I got to the third phase, only taking one damager at the end. So, into the tummy we go. This one might take a little bit of work to figure out, but as long as I can just auto-aim for a bit while I'm watching everything else. There's bones flying. I can hit that. Uh, there's pieces of food all over the place. I don't know what's going on. Come on, ready? And hit you with some of this and hope that that makes a big difference. Oh no, oh, I made a big mistake there, but it luckily sort of turned up. It could have been worse, it could have been worse, is all. Oh man, uh. See, I don't know if that gives me any extra things. I don't think it does. Oh, but we got you, okay, it wasn't so bad. All right, awesome. So there we go, took a couple of tries, but we got the, the mountain defeated. That was a fun one, I enjoyed that one a lot. So, I don't think it was perfect by any means. We had a decent time. We had two out of three HP, three out of three parry, six out of six super meter, and the skill level is two stars. That's gonna give us probably an A, yeah. So we're pretty close to an A plus here. We could just do that again without making any mistakes. We'll get an A plus, that's awesome. Not gonna worry about it too much right now though. Instead, we're gonna move on to some other areas and get some other things done. If that castle guy is back, the king, I'd love to try that out again. Hooray! And that actually opens up a bridge this way. We got the gnome berries, delicious. So it looks like, yeah, there's just sort of two ways to go with all this, so I guess there's maybe no wrong way. I'm sure they both loop around at some point, right? I wanted to see if that, yeah, that ladder is back though. The king's leap, ooh. See, let's try this out, because I think we tried this before against the horse, but I didn't do so well. So I want to try it again. And hopefully this time we can keep up with all the action. Let's see, does he say anything new? Prithee, proceed to the next battle. Alas, mind thee well, weapons and charms have near, near, nary any effect. All right then, so yeah. Let's go for it then, and hope that without weapons, we'll do okay. A brawl is surely brutal. So this horse was really difficult before, but hopefully now that I've warmed up a little bit, I can... So you can't hit them like that, but they will leave certain openings. You don't want to do it then, it seems. What if I, oh gosh, that didn't work. It's gonna take a lot of experimenting, because I'm trying to see if I can't just go a W for me. <laughs> All right then, so we already read that one. But, uh, yeah, I don't know if I could go in between, because it looks like when he sort of, See, you can't do that for some reason. You'd think that's a wide opening, but it's not really. So this one takes a lot of waiting, it seems. Because I try to go for him there and it just hurts me guaranteed. Ah, I tried to roll from it. Ah, darn. Yeah, you get very little chances. I don't know about this one. Come on, try again, try again. Uh, so I know of at least a few options or possibilities or openings or something where we can hit him. No matter what you do, it just doesn't seem like that's one of them. But I feel like th there has to be, right? Okay, come on. Ah, darn it. You do not get much time. And you get some there? And like, you can attack a little bit more during your invincibility when you get hit, but that's not really what we want. Okay. Ah. See, I don't think we can get more than one hit at a time out of those situations. He tries to bait us into coming in, but I don't think it's a good idea to go. Because every time I try, oh my gosh, he's so quick though. And then he has that. Oh man, I don't know how to do this one. It's so difficult. Oh, that was good. So yeah, once again, once I take advantage of his mistakes, I can only really hit him once out of it. Getting greedy and trying to do more is always gonna get me hurt. Even if it looks like I could sort of do more, what I'm waiting for here is just, so he's gonna swing up and then, ah, you still have to be really lightning fast with it and immediately recognize his different animation cues, but I'm sort of starting to get it a little bit more. There are different things he will do that we need to react to super duper fast. So he's gonna call me on here. I don't really know what to do about this one, if there is anything to do about it. And then I'm supposed to be super ridiculously fast there. And getting behind him seems to work pretty well. I tried to go for two of them there. Maybe I could try to roll past him when he does that, but I'd have to be so close to him that it'd be such a risk in other ways. I'd rather just wait it out and see what else he does. Come on, come on. You want me to come closer so you actually do something else? I don't know. 
Okay, so he's gonna swing like that, and then that's when I go for it, but there's just no time to react to that. And it makes me feel like I'm doing something wrong, which maybe I am? There we go, got him again. This is definitely the farthest I've, I've gone now, so... If it works, it works. Whoa. Ah, yeah, see, I wasn't fast enough for that one. But it looks like I've barely made any progress, so maybe there is a better way to do it. Whoa, okay, dang it. That was not a good follow-up, but I was doing pretty well there. So far, I'm getting the idea and I'm keeping up a lot better. Yep, gotcha. We have two HP, uh, I th so I can hit him above his head there, but I probably don't want to try for it too much. If I could just hit him on the rebound, that's also good. Got it, okay, so I know those two, there is the third attack as well, which he hasn't been doing too often. Right there. And I get some time, I probably could have attacked twice there if I'm super duper ready for it. Oh, the super punisher, three hits in there. Come on, come on, he wants me to get closer. Ah, oh, that didn't count. Come on, he's gotta be lower though. So I'm down the one hit, I don't know how low he is, but this is definitely the farthest we've made it so far. Ah, oh, I guess on the downward swing. We did get a lot closer that time, so I think if I could just get used to those moves, we could definitely get him. Oh, I got him! It took a ton of tries. He's going crazy. All right, wow, that, that was really, really challenging without any kind of shooting available. But hey, we got through it. I don't know if the third one will be available now. I might want to go and do some other stuff first, but that was fun, for sure. With this valiant victory, I bestow riches onto thee. So we get one, two coins. Pretty cool. And now, away with thee. So I guess I can't do the third one just yet. Have to find it some other spot, I suppose. Okay, well that's still pretty good. We got two more coins, which we'll definitely be spending and trying to check out that kind of stuff later on. But for right now, if what I'm doing works. I definitely want to keep with it. I was a little curious to see. Okay, there's the next one. So there's multiple ways to go. I might want to try the other direction for right now and really just try to make the most of that. But so far, lots of cool ways to figure things out. Um, see so yeah, it back over here. What is this one? I guess after this little loop around. Snow Colt Scuffle. Mortimer Freeze. Okay, let's try it out. So will this be another flying mission? Probably not if it's in a building, so we'll see if this one's any different than what we're normally used to. We haven't had any levels where we'd normally run through like it's a level. It's all been, so far, just boss fights. So it would be cool to have a normal level, but I don't know if we'll end up getting that. Okay, well, we'll get this guy. Whoa, some kind of ice wizard. Ow. So far, it's already pretty congested with a lot of stuff happening. But the hard part right now is actually hitting him. He moves around a lot, and then all of his little guys get in the way. Ooh, grabbing that, but ooh, that ends up hurting me. Because it bounced me up. Oh, man. Come on now. Oh, okay, that one was definitely my mistake. It'll be a hot December before I let you be a member. Okay, let's try again. Yeah, all the snowmen in the background, cheering them on. Okay, let's get rid of these little guys before they cause me problems. See, there's the car, but man, what a not so useful position for it to be in. Ah, there's so much going on. So back to that. Whenever he's right above me, I'm trying to hit him, but I think it's just better to use the auto-aiming here for the most part. Gotcha. Run over that. Haven't gotten past his first phase yet, but I'm hoping we're close. Ugh. Okay, trying to hit that one thing, but it was just not working out. Come on, come on. Nope, not so good. Was that still his first phase? Right at the end, I guess we we're about to change. I still ready? Where Pewdie Cups go? Okay, so something was about to happen there for sure. It's just really difficult to get to that point. I think that using auto aiming and just focusing on dodging, even though I'm not doing so well, would be much better. Okay, I didn't know if I could dodge into them because they had like a little pink bow and that that was like a parryable, but I guess not. The only parryable thing here seems to be that one card. 
So at least I got that. Oh gosh. There you go, there you go. And so far, well, of course, it takes a lot more time to take him down with the auto aiming. It's better than everything else. Okay, what is this about? Whoa! He's huge! Whoa! Um, oh my goodness. What do we do about all this? The fridge? Oh my. Oh, and they break up into smaller bits. What are those things? Were they popsicles? I think they were. Oof. Okay, okay, come on, go, go, go. We're at our last bit of HP. I shouldn't have done that here, that's for sure. That was a mistake. But hey, we made it to the second one already, and we were most of the way through it, so hopefully we can figure that out. Okay, I'm hitting him with this, and I feel like, ow, okay, I got hit on the rebound, which isn't so great, but overall, yeah, if I just counter his roll with my own, maybe we can make something work. Oh boy. I just sort of want to get to the next spot. I'll hit him with another special, but darn, I died again. Oh, we're getting so close. It was just about to happen. It's Aurora Boreal over for you. <laughs> yeah, Aurora Borealis. I love the puns. Very good, very good. Well, let's try that again, and hopefully this time we'll get it. Whoa, okay, this is new. We're going up, we're going up. Okay, what in the world is this thing? Okay, I don't know if that was the best move, but I just fell right off the side. Okay, so I sort of get what's going on here. We gotta move on these platforms, dodge all the projectiles. That is not gonna be easy, so I just need to focus on getting there without taking too much damage. If we could do that, I think it'll be much easier to handle. If I can actually do that. <laughs> Might take a couple of tries. Okay, so here we go again. I don't know how well this one's gonna go because once again, I'm all, only back to one HP, but at least we saw one more attack and that might not seem very much, but everything we can learn about the fight, the more of a chance we can survive the next time. Ah, oh, man, it is tough so far. This is one of the more difficult boss fights yet, in my opinion. It doesn't feel like much, but this is my first time getting here with two HP instead of one. Oh man. Oh wow, they come from the left side too. Oh my gosh, and I lost it so easily. I didn't realize that the buckets, when they went to the left, they'd blast sort of projectiles to the right. Man, that is so difficult to stay there. It takes a lot of work to get there, stays even more to stay there. Okay, so I have two HP, but even bigger than that, I still have my full super, so maybe I could use that about here and see how far that gets me. Okay, I'm trying to be extra careful, paying attention to both sides now. Whoa, that's new. Giant Eyeball of Doom. Has a bit of a rhythm to it, but I sort of messed it up. Um, let's hit him with some of those that seem to have worked. Ah, oh, yikes. By far the farthest we've made it, but man, oh man. I don't know how we're gonna get any farther than that. Come on, come on. Whoa, going on this side now. Pretty more of these buckets, but. I got it, I got it. Nice, nice, that's actually really, really big because now I can hit you with some of that. And then another one. Awesome, and we got him! <laughs> that was so tough, now look who has a cold, huh? All right, well, that was extremely difficult. I don't think we got the A rank because we took too much damage and we didn't parry enough, but maybe? Got a minute and 50, two out of three, two out of three, yeah. So I think overall, maybe a B plus. Either way, A minus, okay, I'll take that. Pretty nice, pretty nice. So there is a brand new record for us, of course, because it's our first time completing it. And that was a ton of fun, but also extremely challenging. So I think that's maybe where we're gonna finish it up here. I'll go and see if there's anywhere we can spend our extra coins to check out some of our extra shop stuff. But if there's not, that's where we'll be done. We'll continue a little bit more in the next episode. Because as you can see, it's sort of looping around a little bit, but we got the icy sugar cubes. Seem pretty good. So yeah, let's go right back over here where we have the shop. Pork Rinds Emporium. Now we're pretty familiar with this place, but there should still be more stuff. Um, so we only have four coins, so we can only choose one of these things. Hmm. I think we'll try the whetstone, right? You know, your parry attack, your first parry move doubles as a damaging axe attack. I know I haven't been really equipping too many of these, just simply because what I have works. But maybe at some point I can mix it up a little bit and try these things out. I definitely want to showcase them sooner or later. We're heading back down here. So we've made sort of a full loop around and we have a level over this way. The Howling Aces in Doggone Dogfight. So we're going to do the regular fight to start things off. 
Um, and we'll move on to some other things afterwards. So I think this might be another flying mission if I had to guess. Seeing how there was an airplane there and everything, but I guess we'll see in just a moment. Whenever it loads, of course. Takes a while sometimes, but I suppose it's worth the wait. I'm sure that the loading screens are a little bit longer here on the Switch version. Oh wow, so we, we're not, we're on a plane, but we're not flying. Okay, so this one, whoa, this one's already really cool. And there's a lot going on. Whoa, I got it, I got it. That was good, that was good. So I don't think I can stand on the center of this plane. Whoa, is that Tom from Tom and Jerry? Sure looked like it. Uh, maybe I should try some auto aiming. We're throwing tennis balls everywhere. Oh no. Ah, uh, got it. Ah, uh, that actually worked out really well, but then I died. Okay, that's fine. You thought you were t top dog, but you never had a sniff. Okay, so that was a lot to tackle at first, but I think we could figure it out. Might wanna do some auto aiming for a bit. Oh, I got hit when I was trying to hit the parry, so that's not so good. Oh man, the yarn balls. Get back to this. There's so much going on. Got it. Got it. Whoa. Okay, keep hitting him. Was able to avoid most of that, which is nice. The fire hydrant's making its way over. I love all the, the dog theming. Got it? Okay, so we have our special ready. I have one HP left, so I should really try to get to the second phase at the least. And there we go! So it's quite the crash landing. Now we got all these pugs. I think it spells out bow, like in barking. Okay, so a fur Roger Fox, a fur Roger Fox. We didn't quite get through that, but that's okay. I, I sort of figured it out a little bit more. So I guess that one dog that we just saw on the tongue of the, the airplane or whatever is probably the third phase. Darn. Not the best spot to be losing health. Oh no, so I could see in there. I thought that this thing would hurt me, but I guess not. Okay, well that was silly, very avoidable. Come on. Yeah, I should have been ready for that one. It's making a lot of mistakes here, but that's fine. We'll, we'll sort of just get more used to it and hopefully along the way. Ah, we can do a bit better. Okay, so I'm just doing what I can to survive all this with the auto aiming. I'll hit some parries when I get the chance, but overall, okay, I got rid of one of them. There's another. And there we go. I think that's the second phase done. So we're moving on to the third. Oh my. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't know who we're firing at. I guess the actual arms of the laser. Can I parry that? Looks like your skills have gone AWOL, flea bags. <laughs> All right, let's try again. But that was cool. I was able to make it a little bit farther than that time, but I think I'm getting the, the different moves figured out a lot better. So that's nice. Okay, so far not too bad, I'm at two HP. I do have my super as well, so I can try to avoid some stuff. I'm just gonna do this here and see what ends up happening. Maybe that was a good idea. Whoa, what in the world is happening? Okay, uh, whoa. I don't know, the controls aren't flipped here, but it's just very disorienting. That was so cool though. Okay, now the controls are flipped. Um, oh man, this is something else. Okay, I was able to dodge out. I don't know if I can parry that or not, but uh, I think it's gonna be better off just to do the auto aiming. Okay, these are dog balls, I think. Ah, I should have jumped sooner. I thought I was gonna time that better. But that was definitely the farthest we've made it so far. Really, really tricky, but I'm figuring it out. That's always good. As long as in general I'm making progress is what I care about the most. Okay, I'm hitting her with the full blast here. Oh, I got hit by the, the bull there, I guess. Um, I'm just doing everything I can to keep up for right now. Darn, I jumped too soon there. I think focusing on the auto aim is our best bet for sure. Okay, we're back over. This is once again where things get tricky. Ooh, I made it though, I made it, I made it. Okay, so we're definitely farther along than we've ever been. Whoa! 
mean, I know I could probably parry that some way somehow, but do I really want to risk taking the damage, you know? And there we go, we got you! A vacation in the wilds! We did it! <laughs> that one was certainly a tough one. I loved it though. That might be one of my favorite fights yet though. Just in different angles and different things they tried with it. Very cool. And the character designs of all the different dogs and stuff. Really fun concept. So we did it in a minute 56. We only had one HP, but we did everything else. So that might still be a B plus. A minus, even better. Okay, very, very cool. So hopefully we can replay all these and not take damage at some point so we can get the A plus finishes. That'd be fun. But for right now, we're just focused on playing through the game normally. And let's see what opens up for us. Not entirely sure, but... Hooray, we get the pineapple mint. Awesome, so there's another level. We did it, that was the last ingredient we needed for the wonder tart. Let's get back to salt baker lickety split. So we'll be doing that soon enough, but there was still some other things around here that I wanted to check out, like you, hello. Say, young fry, I'm hot on the trail of, of a mystery, but I'm stumped. That contest of skill, that broken artifact, this eerie graveyard. I've discovered potent astral energy in all of these places. There must be an order and method to it. I'm not quite sure, though. Okay, um. What did that do? What? What is this? Take a little nap. Uh, sure? Um, I don't know what's happening. I just walked up to the gravestones. I'm honestly confused. What happened to the, the little time guy? Is he okay? What is happening? I don't understand. This oh my. Okay, so this is like, is this a secret fight? Uh, it, it's, it, it's, whoa. Okay, so whenever I turn, is this the, the same? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my goodness. Wish you may, wish you might. Your soul is now trapped in the night. So this is like a nightmare. Oh my, very spooky. The art is fantastic though. So it looks like I'm always facing the evil one. And which way I'm facing is going to change what attacks are going on. Oh man. So I guess if there's maybe some attacks like this one, I want to avoid it like that. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, I like the concept of this one, but it's it's very difficult to keep up with. Wow, I got a little bit farther, and by a little bit, I mean a, a little bit. This match will get red hot. Let's try it again. Oh man, so if I turn it like that, yeah. Jeez, and you can't hit those if they've passed you, basically. Ah, what a stinker. Certainly isn't easy so far, but I'm sort of figuring it out. This might take me a while. A wow. Okay, maybe I should. Oh man. Yeah, I can dodge out the cheese. Okay, I'm sort of getting more of a hang of it, which is nice. Because I could do this. Because I don't think that's dodgeable any other way. Yeah, I want to dodge. Ah, that one, but... Ooh, okay. It's very noisy so far. I'll tell you that much. Uh... Okay. I dodged at the least, and I got another one of those. I might want to do some auto-aiming, so I could focus on dodging and such more, because I do feel like I'm missing him a little bit. Oh, there's a lightning under the cloud I also need to be careful of. Good to know. The uh, singing from the, the angel maybe isn't m my type of music, it seems. <laughs> it might be a little ear grating. Okay, let's go for this. The super attack seems to have turned out pretty well there. And I can get another. So this is going along a lot better this time. And I got more than halfway through, actually almost through the whole thing. So let's try this one more time and see if I can get it. Whoa, I got him! A horrible night to have a curse. That took a ton of tries. That little, just 
I guess you just have to stay consistent with it and it's hard to do it for that long, but we finally got through it. It's weird that that boss didn't have any phases. I guess it was like a completely just secret boss. I don't really know what I did, but I got it. That was cool. We did it, hooray! Could it be? The fabled cursed relic long thought last to t lost a time, awaken at last. I've seen writings that say it des despises bravery. With a greater foe, more evil shall go. What could it mean? I think it, it, he's talking about this, the cursed relic. Okay, well before it was a different thing. Now it's a cursed relic, burdens host. Jinx cure that inflicts various status ailments. Gotcha, yes, so maybe we'll equip that at some point. But for right now, we still have the King's Leap to focus on. So let's try this out a little bit. But man, what an experience that was. But then after we defeat all the King's stuff, we should just be able to bring all the ingredients to the baker, right? Hopefully we'll be able to help Miss Chalice. I'm not really sure. Hello. Hey, the new challenger lies just beyond that door. Okay, well, can this really be more difficult than the horse? I guess we'll see. So I'm guessing we still can't attack or anything. I and mean, that's been the whole gimmick, right? But I guess we're about to see. Whoa. Okay, uh. So it looks like when the candles aren't lit up, they're not too much of an issue. But when they are, quite a risk. So yeah, I can't attack. I'm just looking for opportunities to parry and such. But I can roll past some things too, so I gotta keep that in mind. I think these are bells? Whoa, that was good, that was good. But I'm not really seeing it, I can't do that. Maybe I could, no. Oh, I see, yeah, I'm supposed to remove all the candles, so. I've got to beat from every angle. I don't know about that, I just didn't know what to do. So let's try again. Now that I understand. So who's gonna come in? And I'll do that, and then do that. Got him, that was pretty good actually. Great start. So the sooner we can get all those, the sooner we can hit him again. Ooh, so I don't even need to go through them, I just need to touch them. Oh, okay, that makes it even easier. Wow, okay, so far not too bad. We got it figured out, yep. Let's go through there, dodge over that. Ooh, I'm moving. Okay, hold on, got him. So far, this one is actually a lot of fun. Just about platforming prowess or something like that, right? Oh, okay, okay. Got him. Oh, I gotta hit all the candles this time. Ah, oh, okay, he snuck up on me a little bit. That was our first point of damage taken. And second, there we go, we got him though. That really wasn't bad at all. So it's definitely a chance to do that without taking any damage, but it's okay, we got through it. As soon as I figured out what to do on that one, that was a lot of fun. So will the king kick me out is the question. Again, on Zephyr's wings you flew through that clash. Thy reward, wealth untold. So two more coins. Furthermore, permit the special entry to the next match. Okay, here we go. Match number four. Is this the last one? A clash of force and finesse awaits you this fine day. Let's give it a try. Okay, so let's see what's happening in this one. Get two more coins out of it too, which would be great. Whoa. So this is the, I forget what this guy's called. I guess the executioner? Am I just supposed to make all these balance? Or, ba yeah, yeah, I guess keep balancing them. Whoa. This is tricky so far. I guess I need to bounce him that way. Yeah, okay, so. Oh, and he's hitting me with the sparks. Beating you was pretty straightforward. Wait a minute, was there something else I could have? I want to see what the other thing is, the other thing he'll sign. So let me do that really quickly. I guess I'll just run into him over and over. I don't know how else I would be able to get it, because there's clearly a checkpoint there. No, okay, it still says the same thing. Just making sure, I guess we just had gotten it to the end of that phase. So I understand how this one works now. What I have to do is that, and that'll hit him. 
Problem is, not all of them are very easy to move over, but oh, I can just pay attention to the sparks as well. That's sort of the big challenge is that I'm looking up, I'm not looking at what's by the ground. I guess you don't need to entirely, it depends. There we go. Because when you parry, you get an extra jump out of it, so you could, if you play it well, stay in the air forever. I can't even see where I am right now. <laughs> But they land on him. Jeez, we gotta do this a lot though. Ah, oh, I died. Let's see how far along we got that time, really far. It still says the same thing, but he was pretty straightforward. Let's try it again. What's funny about it is he's not really doing anything. He's just working on his ax and we're just sort of fighting him while he does that. Whoa, okay, that one went down. So even the vertical angle at which we hit it at matters. Oh darn. Okay, if we get hit once or twice, not a big deal. Oh no. And we don't have to hit it a ton, just enough so it actually gets over there is enough for me. I gotta figure it out now though. Ah, uh, once again, you can't go too high with it. Got it, I think that one's gonna hit him. And so will that one. Yep. Ah, darn. That one did not hit him. But there we go, we got him anyways. There's our knockout, that was awesome. His head fell off, that's sort of ironic. So was that the last battle, I wonder, or is there more? Because I think all these guys are referencing chess pieces as well. Ugh. Oh. You've displayed such ex expedi expediency. <laughs> Thy reward wealth untold. Furthermore, I permit the special entry to the next match. So no, there is still more. Whoa, the big finale maybe? Steal thyself cups for this final contest. Sure. So the last one of the castle. Will this technically be the final boss fight? I don't know. Because after this, we just cash in the ingredients and we should be good. Whoa, the queen. I love the little dresser rats. Whoa, okay, so we're sending all those pieces over. I guess we're supposed to fire at you. It might be a better idea to do that when it actually is gonna hit her. Easier said than done so far. Yeah, definitely, ah, easier said than done. Looking for that opportunity. No, I missed her again. Darn, right there, no. How do you do that? Oh, no thank you. Wow, this is not easy so far. Gotcha, okay, that was a hit. That was not a hit. That was a hit, ah! Jeez, there's a lot to focus on here. How did that one miss, okay? That's a good hit. Darn. It is surely tricky so far. Oh, uh, almost got the double. I'm down to one HP, but I feel like we figured out a lot in this first try already, so even if things don't go our way, which they didn't, that was still not too bad. Too little too late, I dare say, that's checkmate. All right, try it again, try it again. Because now I know actually what I'm doing. So hopefully it'll somehow go even better. That mess. It is so difficult to land. That was a hit. That was not, jeez, it is so tough. There we go. Ooh, that was a great combo. That one's gonna be too far over. At least I'm getting a better feel for it. Aha. Wait, that's in, oh no. Oh, and I got you too. Ah, come on, I'm missing it. Ah, ha, ha. Okay, that was my first point of damage taken, though. I have so much chance here to keep things going. How did that not hit you? It's so picky, too. It really needs a super accurate shot. That was a hit, though. Yikes. 
That was another hit. Darn, I died again. But we are getting so close to knocking her out. One more time is all I need, I'm sure. Come on, come on. On guard. Ah, okay, hold on. Whoa, I did it! Checkmate! I was not even expecting to get it done that time. But wow, look at that. So that's yet another chess piece defeated. And on top of that, should be the final battle. Well, the king lied and we have the battle of the king now. But wow, that was excellent. Huck, to my new champions, the remaining spoils. So we get three coins that time. And with that, the tournament has concluded. Henceforth, my castle shall remain a trading ground for thee. Fare thee well, champions. Awesome, so I guess we can just go back to those fights whenever we'd like to. I'll keep that in mind, but I think for right now, let's see what else we can do around here. I don't know if there's too much more. We can bring our ingredients back to the chef and I guess revive Miss Chalice. That'd be great. See, so let's head down this way. I have a whole bunch of coins to spend too, so I'll definitely have to take a look at that. But for right now, let's head over here. And he was in the bakery. Salt Baker's Bakery. Where'd he go? Oh, he's in the little basement. Uh-oh. This is spooky. What's with the skulls? Uh, hello? Salt Baker? Oh, no. I don't like the look of this. What is he up to in there? Welcome back, you meddlesome brats. I didn't think you'd be back so soon. Ah! No matter, it's too late to stop me now. The Wonder Tart will be my finest work yet. A shame I never told you about the most important secret ingredient. A living soul. While you suckers were out doing my bidding, I nabbed your little friend here. Oh no, Mugman. We gotta save him. When his soul is baked into the Wonder Tart, the cosmic powers of the astral plane will become mine. Mugman, Miss Chalice, you gotta help me. Well, I guess that is Cuphead and we have Bugman. Okay, but first, I'll take those ingredients and then I'll use your heads as serving dishes. Oh no. So we have to fight the Salt Baker. This is not good. We definitely have to save Cuphead. So this is the final battle that I have to assume. Whenever it loads. <laughs> this is too intense to wait for a loading screen. We gotta fight him right now. We gotta save our friend. April. Oh man, here we go. Here go. Oh, so I can parry that sugar cube. <laughs> he's chopping up some food over there. Looks like some limes. Oh yeah, he's chopping up all the ingredients we got him. Whoa, there's a big sugar cube. Oh no, poor guy. Jeez, this is tough so far already. Lots of, of projectiles to avoid. We almost have, whoa, whoa are special. Hit him. Ooh, with everything I got. Strawberries are coming in. Doing pretty good with dodging so far though. But the, the, the castle really helped prepare me for it. Oh no. What was that? It looked like something we could parry. What is happening? Where are we going? Whoa, the animation was so cool there. Gotta get rid of the salt shakers. The dancing flame is in the way. I missed the one parry. Down to my last hit point. But he's breaking apart. Ah, I died. But that's okay, that was so really far. My power grows with much aplomb. Your end is here upon my palm. Okay, let's retry really quickly. And I wanna see what he says if we die in the first phase. I always like seeing those. So I might just go ahead and just get taken out right away. But geez, we did pretty good for our first try there, that's for sure. Got it, so let's see what he says here. Marinate in your defeat while I complete this astral treat. Okay, so <laughs> this time for real, I'll get him and we'll get back to that second phase. Okay, so I'm back here again, this time with a couple more hit points. We're launching these peppers at him and sometimes it's better to use the auto aiming, sometimes it's not, it really depends. So I'm just trying to actively switch in between the two. But I think we're making progress. <laughs> They're still sneezing at me. Uh, got it. 
So I do have this special, but I might just want to save it for the next phase because I feel like we're pretty far along this one. Oh, I took some hit point damage there though. You know, let's go for it. Let's just go for it and see if this does damage. I don't know if it does is the thing. It didn't look like it. Ah, darn, I got hit there. So we're back down to no HP. Okay, we got through it. The whole kitchen is falling apart, and so is he. We gotta save Cuphead. Whoa, okay, that wasn't so good. Your futile efforts were in vain. This world will be my soft domain. Oh man, so that's a tiny little phase there that we gotta get through with a little saw dance. I think I'll get it though. I, I, I think that that wasn't too bad. I just made a couple mistakes. And now I'll be able to save my super up until that point because I know that I can't really hit him with mine. So we'll definitely, ah, try to get through that, but I need to avoid taking damage like that. Yep, okay, so I'll retry, and we'll keep going until we can figure it out. Okay, so this guy seems to move really fast, so I'm just trying to focus on dodging for now while I figure out its moveset and stuff. Uh, okay, something's about to happen. Oh my goodness, I'm supposed to go up, aren't I? Nope, I messed up my jump somehow. That was the last phase, though. The mark of my salinity shall scar thy fired glaze. What in the world is going on at this point? I'm not even sure. Okay, so I'm getting to these platforms again, and I haven't made it this far yet, so it's unfortunate. No, no, that's, I, I swear I pressed to the right to try to dodge him, because he's pink. He might be able to be parryable, but the controls just failed me there. It is such a tough boss. I've been at it for so long because it's just so ridiculously tough. And then I get to that one salt dancing section and the hitbox is so gigantic on them. It's so hard to dodge. Oh man. Okay, so here I am with two HP, which doesn't seem like much of an upgrade, but it's actually huge considering what we've gone through with just one. Can do more parrying. Oh man. Oh no. See, now I'm in trouble, but if I only had one there, no, we got it, we got it! I can't believe it called us to the chef! We did it! Wow, that took so much effort. I can't even begin to describe it. It was almost an hour on that boss alone. Wow, so let's see what our grade is by the end of all of that. It took us two minutes and six seconds, one HP, but we got three parries, the full super meter, the full skill grid, so it should be an A minus again, I would hope. Yes, it is, a brand new record. How cool is that? So there we go. We defeated the Salt Baker, whatever his name was. Oh man. Cuphead. He's free. Thank goodness you're okay. Oh, they're gonna swap though. That dastardly Salt Baker, he had his hood wink the whole time. Oh no, the whole place is falling apart. God, Zooks, this place is coming down. Let's get out of here. Run, eek! Oh, he's getting out of there too. Wait a minute, stop him. That's his, his bakery. No, my bakery. Aw. Oh. Serves him right for duping us. But with the bakery destroyed, you're never going to get that wonder tart, Chalice. Huh. That's okay, if some poor soul has to be sacrificed for me to live again, it just ain't worth it. But mark my words, boys, I'm never gonna stop searching. And in the meantime, if you ever find yourselves in a scrape, I'm just one cookie bite away. Hooray! <laughs> Besides, who needs a wonder chart when they have can have two new best pals instead? Aw. The power of friendship is good enough for us to move forward. The epilogue! <laughs> so hooray, that was really cool. So I guess that's gonna wrap it up for our DLC adventure. The Salt Baker gets arrested. And, oh my gosh. It's sentenced to community service. Oh no. So it looks like he didn't have to go to jail, but instead he's just gonna work on the farms. But yeah, this was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this DLC. It was a little on the short side. I didn't know how much of the game to expect, but honestly, a great adventure, a great addition to Cuphead. And what's really cool is you have that full new playable character that you can play in the main game. And we have, you know, all the characters we can play with Cuphead. And there's also different 
items and abilities and stuff that maybe we'll check out in a bonus episode or something like that. So I think there might still be a couple more things to take a look at. I'm not entirely sure. So you guys can always let me know if you want to see more. You can see Sawbaker doing all these different, giving to these service things, making food, working on the planes. Guess he's setting everything right after all. That's good. Playing ch checkers with the king. But still, of course, this was exactly what you could expect out of the main Cuphead game. A beautiful animation, really hard gameplay, but also really satisfying. Super interesting story, really fun design characters. And it looks like as he's actually helping everybody, he's getting happier. That's sort of cute. I guess he sort of learned to, to be a good guy. The grand reopening of the bakery. He's a good guy now. I like it.